wonderful day, Guardian. Good afternoon, gamers. Good afternoon. Good afternoon. How we doing? This is Edge Transit. This is Hungary. Where's Mountaintop? Am I tuned to Mountaintop? I might be attuned to Mountaintop already. I'm not. I don't know what I was attuned to. I should still probably attune to Edge Transit. That's like the most important weapon to me right now, but I literally don't even have a mountaintop, let alone several mountaintops to necessitate an entire mountain range. Stop yelling. Relax. Papinator. 19 months. SB. 22. SB. 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 22 months. Thank you very much. Particle tier 2. 106 months. Wonderful day, Guardian. Thank you very much. What the F is that? Loving the content of recent. Can't wait for final shape. Fire. Day, like a broken moose call outside. What's a breach loading launcher? It's a special geo. It's a special ammo using grenade launcher. Does chill clip riptide still cover all champs? Yes. Technically not barrier. Like, freezing a barrier doesn't technically do anything to it, but, like, it kind of does. Master of Arms, did I see that wasn't as good as expected? Um, yeah, it is, I, I think, it's what? It's, like, 15% now or something? Is it 15 or 20 Fifteen percent. So I mean, it's like it's like frenzy, except you can no. I mean, frenzy you can activate at any time as well, just by being in combat. Yeah. So it's just like it's like not as good as a thing that already exists. So. Yeah, it's it's not it's not that great. I mean, you can do worse, I guess, but like it's not great. <laughs> oh, hello, Brimstone. What are you looking at, buddy? What's going on? No more sun. Where's Mr. Fruit? Bro, I usually don't game that much with Mr. Fruit on Destiny. Your new emotes say, buy Datto. Did you make the new ones? The emotes say, buy me. Like, the art? I mean, I think it's just giving... It's giving me credit because they're on my channel. Like, I uploaded them. I didn't make the art though. I'm still waiting to hear from my from the artist. I don't know if they want to be credited. I don't know if they want to be put out there in the world just yet. Crack 
credit artists if you give them the artist role. Yeah, I this person does not watch the stream. So I mean, I can give him one, but you're not, I don't think you're ever going to see it. <laughs> Has there been any communication on how much the future enhancement will improve MOA? My guess would be a very small percentage increase or a, a duration increase. Those would be my guesses. Find someone at Walgreens or someone that makes emails. I got, I got my freaking sources. Okay. I got my sources who have their sources. Uh, Polly's Wag with the three months. Thank you very much. Thank you. Uh, Mr. Coffee with the 30 months and Tenny50 with 68 months of subbing. Thank you very much. And Mega Crispy with the 14 months of subbing. Thank you. What's the last set of weapons? I think they said. I think they said already what they are. I just don't remember. It wasn't it like blast furnace and uh, forbearance or something. <laughs> oh, the Luna, Luna. That's right. Yeah. Oh yeah, there it is. Luna and uh, blast furnace, and then I think Hammerhead's next week. I'm not I'm not as urgent about Hammerhead. Commemoration already kind of goes really hard. Definitely don't need a forbearance. Hall is a six person limit. Wow. Okay. Coming out. Uh, let me see what you guys are, are rocking here. Do I need to switch? Sammy is running Orpheus Hunter. Easy. And I'm guessing Jin is on well luck. No, Osmiomancy. Ooh, okay. I've, I don't think I've played with the Osmiomancy Warlock yet. Yeet. Interested to see how it goes. Wah, wah, wah. All right. We're doing some stock. We're going to stock right now. Stock me. Hold. Fix the loadout. Switch to Zally's. We're cooking. Mr. Fala, 32 months of seven. Thank you very much. And K Rose, tier two, 19. Thank you for the tier two. A couple of tier twos today. Thank you very much. Thank you very much. And uh, Pawn Shop. The stream with the did indeed be late. Six months of seven. Thank you very much, Pawn Shop. Snake Doctor, 18. Chuck, Na okay, Jesus. <laughs> Chuck Nasty, 17. Big Mac with I'm seven. I'm fucking, but not champing. Wonderful. We'll what? save both for my 12-month anniversary message, lol, datto hug. All right, that's fair. Thank you very, very much, everybody. Thanks for resubbing, holy. Call name Reaper, 54 months. Wonderful. Welcome back. Oh, God. It's Hive. I just hate Hive for the freaking for the Shriekers, bro. The Shriekers just are so troll. I don't, no, I don't give an F about Ogres. 
I don't give an F about those. I care way more about the sh The Shriekers are what is going to kill you. The surprise respawning Shrieker. That's going to cook you. Boost ping Discord. It's all right. Respawning, yeah, they respawn. I came for cringe free streams, what the heck? Wonderful day, Guardian. Yeah, cringe free. That's what I'm trying to do. I'm trying, you know? Whoa, sir. My hammer. Oh, okay. Sam Karate Man seventy one. Yeah, we're double knighted up already. Give me the battery, you stupid. Can't even see over the ridge. Okay. He's gonna push me off the cliff. All right, so. Very good start. <laughs> Ogre did not get spawned. That is a tough one. That is, um, going, going cringe free was going to be a bit harder than I thought. I'm not going to lie, but we're trying. It's hard. It's hard, man. Sam Karate Man 71, Ghost Hellion 15, Shoeless gifting a sub. Thank you very much, Shoeless, for doing that. And Mace Dog with the three months there. Thank you. Thank you. Um, sorry, there's a bunch of questions that I got asked in the middle of that. Uh, uh, Spoon Man with like 40 O's. Um, that's a. Very difficult question to answer in the span of like three minutes. He be killing apostrophe dog face like a turkey. Call him Thanksgiving. I need to reread that one. What did that even say? Um, but my my biggest piece of advice for content creation is it's pretty much always going to be start making stuff because the first things you're going to make are going to be terrible, awful, garbage, cringe. Unless you have a background in it already. You just need to start making stuff. Twitch is tough. Twitch is tough to start out on without any sort of baseline anything. It's very, very difficult. I don't even know what it's like to, to start a Twitch channel in this era of Twitch, um, but I can tell you it's a whole hell of a lot harder than it is now compared to, uh, or it's a whole hell of a lot harder now compared to when I was doing it, when I first started. So I don't usually feel the most comfortable giving Twitch specific advice because the landscape is just so different. 
but there's a lot more collaboration. You have to be multi-platform. You can't really just be one platform. You got to be willing to be making YouTube videos and YouTube shorts and TikToks and, you know, all this, all this extra stuff to get off the ground floor. So start making stuff is really what it is. Start creating content. And start soon. Yeah, TikTok is huge. TikTok is huge for... For getting started nowadays. Ludwig did, did, an, up, uh, did an update to his, like, how to be a content creator uh, video thing that he did a couple years ago. And uh, he was like, look at all the people who got super popular very recently. What are they doing? They're posting a freaking TikTok. They're posting a TikTok. They're posting a YouTube shorts. They're getting stuff going viral. And that's how they're blowing up. And that's where you got to start. Just is what it is, you know? Yeah, exactly, uh, the nine. Okay, so it was like 50,000 viewers. Blew up on TikTok. All, all these, like, this, like, this new wave of creators. <clears throat> they're all blown up on TikTok. They're all blown up on YouTube Shorts. That's just where it's at. That's where new growth is. Keep up the hard work, Datto. And, uh... See you having fun in this game mode and your recent guide was very helpful. Haven't hey. managed to get the 50th wave cleared on Legend, but we consistently get above 40 now thanks to your tips. Nice. Datto hunt Datto up. Good stuff. Yeah, like, I'm... I am making a... a much larger investment into short form content um literally starting as soon as humanly possible it's just it's just that important my growth on youtube has been literally nothing love watching you get set on fire lol thanks yeah my my growth on youtube has been quite literally nothing in the past, I would say, year and a half to two years. I've kept the people who are, like, you know, still here and still watching. But if you don't do more, you're in trouble. So, let's just say I, I will be making significant investments into my short-form content very soon. Short form can be also just highlights or previews of your full length content. It can be. But what I have found, what, one of the issues that I have found in doing that is that it's just as in-depth as the normal process, right? TikTok's all about volume. Just putting out as much as humanly possible. So the ideal is it taking the shortest amount of time to create something. And after I do a big video, the last thing I wanna go do is go write like a minute and a half version of it. 
and then basically produce another video for the same thing. 4.41666 years. Repeating, of course. Which is why I haven't really engaged with something like that, is because I write my long form videos because they're long form videos. They're not designed for short form. So short form, I just have to basically do all the work over again. And uh, I know it doesn't sound like a lot, but it's still like an extra, you know, hour to two hours of work doing that re rewriting. Rewriting the format, making sure people get the most out of it, redoing the the actual video segment, um, doing subtitles, all that stuff takes a lot of extra time. And uh, as much as I would like to do that, I'm already doing so much that like adding on, you know, three or four more customized TikToks that are like good production value is like another six to eight hours of work. It's basically another work day in my work week. Hence, investment. <laughs> I have loved the content, but don't overwork yourself. I'm still on this thing? No. Holy. Dude, these Marauders don't F around, bro. I hate it. Where are you going? Reload the freaking gun, man. Marauders getting a taste of their own medicine. YouTuber not overworking themselves challenge. <laughs> yeah. No, I, I will, more help will be coming. Trust me on that. Trust me on that. So. Oh my god. Run of the needle. Hello? No! Yeah. Anyway, that's my content creator talk for the day. <laughs> We gave you melee energy back after the sliding melee ability. That would be a uh, melee kickstarter. That would be melee kickstarter. Any updates on my sabbatical, by the way? No. Other than I will not be having one until at the very earliest January 2025. Yeah, no, I, I don't plan on getting rid of long-form cont content in favor of short-form content. Um, I want to have both. That's the goal, is you have the short-form to push people towards the long-form, or at the very least, uh, uh, you know, push people to... Uh, push people to your other forms of entertainment streams youtube videos like whatever it is it also does help that tiktok has uh been able to monetize a little bit and people some people are making really good money on tiktok too
cool. Oh, it went off the edge. Noish, noish, noish. A friend told me Bungie unsunsetted everything. What the F is going on over there? Um, they did not unsunset everything, but they did bring uh, some some older weapon. It's really just like weapon names back. <laughs> That's really what they did. Wait. Oh, we are over there. Okay. <clears throat> Do I have a streaming plan for Final Shape release? Yeah, stream as much as possible. While also still, how, still somehow making content. I usually don't sleep that much during new content releases. Or if I do, I'm literally working like from the moment I wake up to the moment I go to bed. As a creator, do you struggle with having others help you with things like editing for fear of giving up creative control. Not really once you establish, uh, once you like establish some trust. What, what I wouldn't trust right now is like the scripting. Like it's still Datto does destiny, right? It's not Greg does destiny. So I don't, I don't think I would really trust anyone to write scripts for me. Maybe like starting something out and then I give it my own tweaks later on. But it, it like scripted stuff needs to be all me. Patrick. From Executioner Thane, Legendary Creature, Phyrexian Vampire. Whenever one or more other creatures you control this is a myth, isn't each it? opponent loses two life and you gain two life. This ability triggers only once each turn. Myth finding TTS is like him discovering memes for the first time. We gotta, we gotta work on your meme game. Am I liking Vossok more than Midtown? I think they're about both equal. Oh, Lord. I wasn't even looking. Do you think TikTok being banned is a real possibility slash should be taken into consideration or do you think it'll be quickly replaced with uh, shorts, reels, etc.? I mean, they're, they're already, those both of those things already exist. Um, do I think it's a possibility? I mean, knowing our stupid ass government and them literally doing absolutely fucking nothing at all times, except the most inconvenient shit, um, yes. Am I the most worried about it? Not necessarily.
Is it gonna concern me too much? Look, if they banned TikTok, like I'm look, I'm already not making TikTok videos. I'll throw it up on YouTube Shorts. Or maybe I'll make an Instagram account, whatever. But I, I just don't know enough about that space just yet. Other than I know it would affect a lot of people's ability to uh, to create. It's not actually that strong. Um, but yeah, uh, regarding like, um, you know, ha getting editors to help and stuff. I mean, uh, the people who I have had help me with edits um, have been all really good because they, they, they understand like the YouTube editing landscape. And I've also found people that kind of fit my editing style. So like put... So, so, you know, getting a crew together that, like, understands the YouTube editing landscape and, uh, and how I like to do my content has been not that hard. And editing for me is, like, oh, editing for me is, like, pr like, the last step in the process. Most of the other process is, like, the creative part or the scripting part and, like, you know, I, I don't mind, like, getting ideas from people. Um, and then I kind of execute on those ideas. Or I write a script. Um, but, but having actual editing work done, like, I, I don't mind that. Uh, pretty much at all. Because I'm usually finding people who are within my area. Sorry, I'm going to interrupt real quick. Different architect with 5,000 bits? Jesus. Love the content, but don't overwork yourself. Yeah, I'm, I'm trying. January, February were the months of, of not overworking myself. But it, it's never balanced, you know? It, you're either underworking yourself and you're just like, I'm literally doing nothing. I am nothing. What is there even to make? Or it's just like, oh my God, we just got giga slammed with so much stuff. I need to work 16 hours a day, every day, to make sure that I get all the things out immediately, as soon as possible. It's never nine to five, you know? For some people, it can be nine to five, you know? And those people probably have a, a very good team helping them in the background. Acknowledge my tribal chief. Thank you, D-Man. 88 months. I know we have a bunch of, uh... We got a bunch of other subs. I have to thank. But we've been having good conversation. Was there ever a point in your life where you considered joining a media group like RT, Funhouse, Machinima, etc. and being the, the Destiny guys in 9 to 5? Or did you always focus on doing it solo? Um, no. I mean, I, I as much as I would love to be you know, part of an ensemble. I mean, I, in a way, I kind of am part of an ensemble with, like, Jez and Danielle. That's kind of where I get to do a different style of me. You're welcome. Um, I like running the show. Um... I like I like being the lead guy. Huh? No, I just I'm a control freak. Like part of part of why oh boy. Okay, buddy. Unkillable vandal. Yes. Is 
Sorry, I forgot what I was talking about. Um, yeah, no, I, I don't mean I don't I don't mind being a, a solo act. I don't mind that at all. I'm gonna put up. Never mind. I don't have a wall here. This is wave 19, so we have ammo coming to us. For a rally, so I'm not too concerned about that. Nice. If we see a Destiny 3, will be the same timeline, or could we jump to a future timeline? Thoughts? I, I, they could do anything. They could do anything that they wanted. I think some people, some people wouldn't mind starting completely fresh, new set of characters, new this, new that, whatever. Some people wouldn't mind like sticking with the same characters and go into like a different solar system or like whatever. Um, so open ended that they could they could literally do anything. Sorry, trying to keep up with all the questions. Reclusive Mountain Time were some big reasons for sunsetting, but now they came back and aren't breaking the game or anything. Do you think that's because we're so much stronger now, or could these weapons weren't ever really a big problem to begin with? No, Recluse was a big problem. There's a reason why Master of Arms is 15% and no longer 50. Like, let's not kid ourselves. The game has also evolved a lot since those days. Where had they not gotten rid of those things and also made some of the adjustments that they did, to, to this day, to this day, people would still be using Mountaintop Recluse because it would it just the, the most insane weapon setup that we've ever had. Right, very big reason. Recl oh god, recluse is uh, the way that it is now. So we're gonna, we're gonna scroll the way that back down here. Um, so you got you got to come at it from both sides, right? We we can't just like look at the game as it was five years ago because it's just it's not even remotely close to the same but then also realize that even five years ago some of these weapons were just absolutely berserk i'm not saying blast furnace was berserk i'm not saying hammerhead was berserk but there were some things that were way too berserk for their era and that was really the issue now that we've power crept along four years five years Things are a little different now. Everything dies now. But when you're around, it happens so much faster. Falling Guillotine. Relentless Surrounded. I could probably toss that one in the vault. I just got teleported. Wonderful day, Guardian. Hey Datto, good luck on your runs. Thank you. Yeah, sorry, let's uh let's catch up with subs.
Sorry, I usually talk to, um... I usually talk to stream for like the first 30 minutes, but we went right into, uh, into gameplay. So I wasn't able to see a lot of those questions rapid fire, because then it's also like people sub in, or uh, resub in from the, from the day. So let me uh, catch up here and we can get back to it. Um, North with 91. Oh my god, it got fixed. Let's go. Yeah, I, I don't know what happened to, to channel points yesterday. I, I, I still have a sniper. Um, they were just not working. Worst target to try to hit with a sniper. Like, I didn't do anything. Like, I didn't turn them off. Like, they were just not working. Let's go D2 back, D2 back. Okay! Frazzled right now. It's the wrong weapon. Okay. North, 91 months, Giga Sub. Thank you very much, North, for that. Shoeless Gaming, 100 bits. Thank you very much for the bits. Yes. Uh. Why is the stream cringe free now, Dataman? We appreciate a little Krigney from time to time less than three. Oh, watch out, Sammy. That was tough. I shouldn't have killed that one, but it might have just exploded on you anyway. Okay, Jin has almost got that one. I'm going to go help him. You know, now that I'm seeing it, Onslaught kind of tough to engage with chat sometimes. All right, we got it. Cool. Um, Tate, thank you very much for the prime sub. Thank you for doing that. Darth Gabry with the uh, 66. Thank you very much for the 66 months there. Thank you. Uh, Pete Massa with the 17. RC Win with the 69 months of subbing. Thank you, thank you. Guznik with 23. Different Architect with three months. And again, the 5,000 bits effing wild. Very insanely generous of you to do that. Thank you. Thank you very, very much for doing that. That is insane. Uh, trench coat full of rats, tier two. 53 months. I was about to say 35. Whoa, how are you here already? Oh, I'm picking up a freaking wall here, bro. Jayback, can you save that save that question for uh for when whenever I'm done with this run? Assuming you're still here. Thanks, Mac. Are you? No, you're not already ready, right? It's not. It's not two o'clock. It's only one o'clock. I was like, did I f up?
Uh, damn. Had to bait. The cookery. Um, Ruski with the 55, D-Man with the 88. Some uh, some alliteration subs right there. Love to see that. 64 for Harbinger. Thank you very, very much for the 64. Raiden with 17. How many chuggas are the appropriate amount for saying uh, choo-choo afterwards? I would give you four. I'll give you four chuggas, I think, before it starts to get obnoxious. But I would also say, like, four is the minimum, because that's kind of like the pace, right? You want to match the, the rhythm, the tempo of the normal saying. But I think once you go beyond four, it's just kind of like, you know, what are we really doing here? Eight? Eight? All right. Maybe, I would, I would maybe give you eight. It depends, I don't know, it depends on like how you're also like, is like the first one in the eighth notes like a staccato, right? How loud are the other ones? Do we have like a decrescendo? We cre we're loud on the first one, we're quiet. We're fortissimo on the first one and then pianissimo on the next three. Go back to fortissimo. If there's some music rhythm to it, then I'll, I'm, I'm willing to allow you to go more beyond. What are these words I'm saying? Any musicians in the chat know what I'm talking about? People who can't understand Fortissimo uh, caught as never being forced to play an instrument in eighth grade. Pop and heavy. I will join you. Oh, that's cringe. <laughs> Never mind. Any good shinies yet today? Nah, but I mean, we literally just started, so I've only gotten like four drops. Someone did just ask if I think Bungie is going to increase the um, the drop rates of shinies. And I, I'm hoping that they don't, but I could see a world where they do. Wow, I got cooked. Um, I don't know, to, to me, like, you know, the, the more casual players getting the shinies from, like, the quest, I think for, for a lot of them is going to be enough. I do think they really want the shinies to be special. Special and rare. And also a I was there pog champ moment kind of a thing. I could see them keeping it the way that it is right now. But then maybe adjusting it for future events uh, that we have. Bro, can you, like, come up here, please? Adjusting it for future events. In case they don't like it. Or, like, for stuff that's not as momentous of an occasion. You know, like, this is, like, the 10-year... But then you could also counter that with, like, bro, it's the 10-year anniversary. Wouldn't you think that they... Oh! Want everyone to, uh to be able to have all the cool stuff. And I hear you, but right now I'm pretty okay with them uh, keeping them super, super rare. But I do think there is a chance that they
that they increased the drop rate because enough people complained. Like, Bungie is very in, like, make people happy mode right now. And if increasing the drop rates even just a little bit is going to make some people happy, then I could see them doing it. Shaq's kind of going ballistic right now. Stupid. Oh my god. Bring him over here. Keep him debuffed. Bro, I, Shax's head is getting in the way. No one man should have all this power. I don't even know if this is working. It is. Lep said they thinks uh, he thinks it will increase the last week before final shape, you know, player retention. I can see them doing that. Yeah, I can see them doing that. Um, Schnaffer and Dragon's Breath. I'm actually going to also hot swap the ammo. Because we're starting to get up there and we don't have a well. Start with a quiv. Love it. Doosh. Should probably pick that up first. Just grab that real quick. Okay, excuse me. Sir, 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 excuse me. Shank. Oh, he's gonna cook me. Oh! Huge shot by me. Thanks, me. Sammy is invisible. I'm kind of, kind of thinking he's uh, he should be the one to go get that. Does this rocket really not hit this dude? Okay, that is attached to you. I swear on me, mom, my, my rockets are like disappearing. Eat it. I'm dead. I'm alive. Oh, come on. Cave would have been 
It's perfect timing with that ad. Why do I? Imp, what was this? Oh, I already have one of these. Okay, goodbye. Mountaintop. What do we got? Overflow, Vorpal, Demo, Harmony could be somewhat interesting. Overflow, Vorpal with Spike. Demo. Harmony. I mean, Harmony is kind of neat. Harmony is kind of neat with demo because you like you get a kills and you switch. Harmony shot, you grenade, you get another shot. Harmony, you get a couple shots, you get like three shots with the thing. I don't know. That's not, that's something. Impulse, this is, I'm not keeping that. I'm not keeping that. That's way too much for my brain to handle. It's not that much. All right. Let me close the garage. Hang on. Wonderful day, Guardian. Close the door, Daniel's not home. Okay. We talk about why your living room is upstairs. This is not my living room. Our living room is downstairs. I will say that our old house had sort of like, I wouldn't call it a living room, but you it could be considered a living room. Like you would walk up the stairs and there was like one big room that then expanded out into like the bedrooms. This is just, you walk up the stairs, it's a tiny hallway and it's just rooms. Okay, everybody's here, let's go. Uh, Atahans with the five months of subbing. Thank you very much for the five months. Charlton with the three months. Uh, Monomania MMO with the three months as well. Why am I spawning over here? Um, uh, Fristech with the two months. Thanks for coming back. Thanks for re-upping that prime. A den. What is a den but also a living room? You know what I mean? Uh, Asby with the 73. I didn't say it was gonna be cringe-free forever. I'm just, I'm just trying something a little new. Uh, thank you for the 73. That's a big sub. This is Dreg. I'm not even gonna use my wall on Dregs. How's Balatar last night? It was actually sick. We only got to play one game, but the game that we played was like pretty good. It started out as what I thought was gonna be like the worst round of all time. And then it turned into like one of my best rounds of all time. Okay, I'm dead. Why are sniper shanks the most threatening enemy? That 
that's not good. Oh god. It's my best super of all time. To save the run. Yeah, so the run that we played last night was actually so dope that I'm having I'm having that one chopped up to get thrown on the channel. The side channel, not the main. So, it's nice to be back. And it was on the new patch too, which is awesome. Well, technically it's not live yet. It's experimental. But, I mean, it's like we weren't playing like, the hardest difficulty. Like, we were on red stake, right? So, it wasn't anything too hard. You know, we needed to get back in the rhythm of things, but... It was still a lot of fun. Boonk. Boonk. All right, almost done. Uh, Ayla, I'm not sure if I'm uh, pronouncing that correctly. Sorry if I'm not. E-A-L-A, -A. let me know if, how to say it if I'm incorrect, which I probably am. Goodbye, world. Nope. A rebonk. Nice. Where's my hammer? Is that out of bounds? Where'd it go? I don't know where it went. Sag. least favorite enemy in destiny 2 to like fight against i'll tell you an onslaught these these marauders these usain bolt marauders that are invisible shooting and effing uh lord of wolves times three at you are like one of the most deadly enemies in the game this this wave right here literally this wave is probably one of my least favorites other than that, I would say uh, Scorn Lurkers with their stupid little shields. I hate those guys a whole lot. I hate fighting against them. Because they have such a small shield and yet it never feels like you're actually hitting them. Oh, this thing's getting cooked. Wow, I got destroyed. That one captain cooked it. Holy cow. I was not expecting that. That sucks. Wonderful day, Guardian. Substreak can drink now. All right, we'll try and sneak in one more. Um, I missed some, I missed doing my like uh, opening stream talk to chat uh, stuff. So let's do that for a little bit, and uh, and then we'll hop back in. Um, why not spend some of my scrap? Because I wasn't paying attention.
Um, give me one sec. There's a package at the door. Let me go grab that. And then I'm going to finish thanking subs. And then we're going to go. Uh, and by go, I mean do some chat questions. One sec. Wonderful day, Guardian. Give me one second. Sorry. I couldn't see Brim out in the yard. And I was just making sure that he's chill. Got to keep the cams up for him. Sorry. Just like ran all over the place. Um, okay. Let's finish thanking subs. Uh, Cadencio with the six months. Thank you very much for the six months. Seventh Sloth with 26 and Braddington with 23. Thank you very, very much for the 20s there. Mr. Bobber, thank you for the two gifted. Very kind of you. Thank you for the two gifted. If you just got gifted a sub, be sure to thank Mr. Bobber. Yeah. Um, Chicken Lord with the 112. Small gift to bright dust. Let's go. Wish he grabbed my package at the door. I'd like to see her package. Thank you very much, Chicken Lord. For the 112. Hope you're well, bud. Hope you are well. While we're posing for a picture here, we got Shoeless Gaming. 100 bits. Think Bungie missed an opportunity by limiting Tormentors to Campaign and Root of Nightmares. I think they should have randomly popped up in places in the system at any point. Um, I don't know. I mean, they're showing up right now in Onslaught. I think it does make some amount of sense, though, that they have some sort of, like, theming in where they show up. You know, I don't I don't know if you just want to throw them literally anywhere just for the sake of throwing them anywhere. This guy's jumping rope. <laughs> um <laughs> This guy's like jumping rope. I need some rage in the chat. Um 
So, like, yeah, they, they show up in, in some places here and there. I wouldn't, I wouldn't want to see them thrown in too randomly, you know? Whoops. Um, I am fine with their current distribution. Because they're supposed to be these, this very imposing, tough enemy. And they show up in some Nightfalls. Like, they show up in Lake of Shadows, right? They show up in Lake of Shadows. Um, so I wouldn't, wa I wouldn't want to see, like, a red bar tormentor. Not that I think that's what you're insinuating or anything, but, um, I think they're, they're uh, pretty appropriately spaced out right now. They spawn from Taken Blight heroic events too right now. Oh, yeah, I thought, I thought I saw something that said that. <coughs> oh my god. Where's Brim? Brim check. He's by the chairs. Okay. Um, Megalodon Hunter, two years of sub, and thank you very, very much for the two years. And call me Umbra with a freshy Prime sub. Thank you very much. Prime seven. Appreciate that. Thank you. Thank you, thank you. Um, let me scroll up here. And see if we can uh, answer some questions that I missed. Um, you pulled me when you joined me and Lep in Discord during Lep's birthday subathon when he was playing Balatro, and I pl now I play it every night before bed. Yeah. Yeah, that was a great Balatro game that we had. I've never played a full house build either, so that was kind of fun. Um, have you tried the deconstruct tusk of the boar post patch? I don't think I even have one. I mean, with that perk combination, what do I have? I have envious bait. I have envious hatchling. I have slideways chain. I have slideways deconstruct. So I do have deconstruct. I have not messed around with deconstruct. I know there's a lot of discussion about it right now. On like what it can do, what it can't do. It's bugged. It's not bugged. This is bugged. It's not bugged anymore. They fixed the bug. Blah 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 blue. Um. So I need to look into it a bit more than I have because a lot of people are just very stoked on like it gives you ammo for free, bro. And uh, for like a special weapon, that can kind of be neat. I just don't know. I mean, I don't know. I don't know the math on it. So, like, obviously, I don't need to be sold on math. I just haven't seen it. But without having seen the math, I don't know if I'm sold on like a deconstruct on like a power weapon. Until I see math. Until I see numbers. And then if the numbers are like, yeah, it's like four trillion more damage than any other option, I'd be like, okay. So, I need to try it out for myself. Day, is really what it comes down to. Brim check. Oh, Brim is plopping. He is big plopping in the sun. Okay. What time is it? 140. Okay, Brim's got to come in in 30 minutes. He can't have too much sun time. God roll midnight coup. Let's, let's look at both weapons real quick. And then, yeah, we'll get to that D3 question. Because I did answer it once before. But I, I haven't actually read the source. Um, duplicate and uh, mountaintop. So all of this is in the video that I posted. Like god rolls of what I'm going to be hunting down. Midnight Coup, I mean, is just so stacked. Right, like, first, I mean, first column, you got what? You got Explosive Payload, you got Firefly, Outlaw's okay. Second column, Rampage, Kinetic Tremor, Zen Moment, One for All, Frenzy, Desperate Measures. I mean, it's so stacked. I saw someone on Reddit praising uh, Firefly One for All because you can just get a Firefly proc and basically instantly proc One for All in Onslaught. Um, I'm glad people are finally coming around to the one-for-all train. 
because One for All has been one of the best perks in the game since it released. Um, so that's a role I definitely would not mind trying out. Um, but, like, otherwise, it's just, like, I don't know. Kinetic Tremors I've never been sold on for Midnight Coup because... Here, let me, let me bring it. Let me bring it to the main stage here. Um... I've never, I've never been huge on, on Kinetic Tremors. I've, I've never really gotten it to the point where I was like, oh, it's, it's popping right now, bro. It's so cool. Like, I don't know. Maybe I, maybe next time I get a Kinetic Tremors Midnight Coup, I'll try it out a little bit. But I've just, I've never been sold on Kinetic Tremors, even though it's like a really cool perk. Um, no disrespect if you want to use Kinetic Tremors either, though. Uh, what am I going to be hunting down? Probably, like, I, I would definitely want to try out Firefly 1 for All. That was something that I was leaning towards uh, from the get-go anyway. I don't even know if I would go old-school, like, Outlaw Rampage. I don't even think that's really enough anymore. I can see people going explosive pay, like, double damage perks. I can absolutely see people doing that. Uh, if you want to go a bit more traditional, you can go in Light and Action or Outlaw with, you know... I Like, don't sleep on 1 for All, man. It's so good. It's so good, man. Don't sleep on one for all, please. I'm begging you. And then mountaintop. Mountaintop. I think mountaintop just kind of depends on what you're on, on what you're going for. Like auto loading holster is sick, just as like a baseline. Overflow is not bad. Demo's not bad. Lead from Goal's not bad, right? Even Ambitious Assassin, it's not bad. Rampage, that's a, probably a no from me. Vorpal, you gotta be doing some really specific boss stuff. I'm sure there's a world where Vorpal on Mountaintop is like the craziest thing ever, but I'm sure it also depends on the exact situation that you're in. I always sleep on Adrenaline Junkie and like Pugilist by extension because, I don't know, I just like... I've just, I, I don't like the ramp up period, even though you're probably slaying out a whole lot and you can make a grenade build to make adrenaline junkie up like 100% of the time. But when you have one for all and you can just fire one shot and probably hit three things and just instantly activate it, it's like, why am I, why am I chasing anything else, man? Like I was talking about earlier, harmony, like this plays super well into like, like if you do like an auto loading harmony type situation, that could be really good. You could also do auto-loading with recombination. Get, like, some kind of a giga shot. That's also really good. Um, I saw some people doing some math about, like, recombination and, like, when it's better versus other perks. Like, depending on how much you stack it up and here's how much you, you need to do in order for it to be better than this and this and this. If you're just using this for ad clear, you know, I would probably skew more towards, like, a, some kind of a damage perk. Uh, like a one for all, like a harmony, but I mean, also recombination, you're probably in onslaught a lot, and there's a lot of meaty targets that you can just pop with a giga recombination shot and just do a massive chunk of damage, right? Like champion killer, yellow bar killer. Um, so again, it, it really just depends on like what do you specifically want to do with your copy of the mountaintop, spec it based on that. I don't know. You you you, just, you have so much, you have so much potential here. Like you can you can. It just depends. You know. I want to try harmony auto loading. I we just got the demo harmony. I'm gonna try that. I'll try a, a you know auto loading recombination. I'll try a frenzy. I'll try one for all. I skew more towards one for all than frenzy nowadays. Um, but like a one for all ambitious. That's kind of up my alley. You know what I mean? The radius sucks on mountaintop. That's fair. But I'm also thinking like I'm in onslaught where there's just clusters of enemies.
Have I tested out heliocentric heel clip incandescent yet? I don't think I've gotten one, so. Uh, no. <laughs> what about impulse amplifier? Is that any good? I mean, the, the increased reload speed's kind of nice, but it's like th there are other things that can do more. And also, mountaintop like fires in a straight line. I don't. I just don't know how much you need it. At least in like a PVE situation. If you're in PVP and you're trying to get damage out a lot faster, I could see that being a world where you want it. Um. Again, it just it just depends on what you're looking for. Thoughts on Obelisk, Joker, and Baltro? I would love to have uh, like a super rock solid Obelisk run at some point, but it also feels so counterintuitive because it's like you want to build one hand super high so that way you have free reign to play any other hand that you want and build up Obelisk, but by the time you're able to get to that point, you're already like more than halfway through the run. Wisdom and insight on the LMG recurrent impact. Are you talking about the stasis like 900 RPM uh, season 16 machine gun? If so, um, it's not my favorite. I put, I, put it, I put it pretty low on the list personally. I think there's a, many, many better options. I think it's been power crept quite a lot. Um... So depending on what you have access to, especially with like Hammerhead coming out next week, I, I don't see a ton of reasons unless you are very stasis pilled and cannot run King's Fall. That's the only reason that I would get it. Did I have to remember the full whisper route after all these years or did I refresh myself? You mean like the 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 platforming section? I mean it's pretty it's pretty straightforward. So you would suggest or prefer Quillums? I I would just because I I I am not personally a fan of 900 RPMs. And I'm also not really using machine gun for boss damage unless I absolutely have to. Wonderful day, Guardian. 29 months cringe free. Thank you, M Pons. 29 months. And Colonel Sanders Jr., 67. Thank you. Thank you. Um, Alright. I have a we have an ad break starting soon. So, Jayback, why don't you hit me with the thing that you were talking about, and then we'll hop back into a uh, into another onslaught. Unless uh, Mac is good to go before then, because he wanted to do a vault cleaning. So we're going to do a vault cleaning with him, and then we're going to go back into Legend Onslaught. There might also be some Ghosts of the Deep rocket farming, because y'all made me delete my effing envious bait effing cold comfort so i have to get back in there because apparently you can farm it this week oh wait it squats true 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 so true oh hi brimstone oh big sitting yeah, that was GMG. That was me appearing on GMG. 
Let's check the uh, rewards here. Pet the brim, pet the brim. All right, we have double pet the brims. Hey there, Wonderful. Thanks, Thanks, Deputy Director, how are you? Flavins refers generally to the class of organic compounds containing the tricyclic heterocycle isoaloxazine. squats and then we got and then and then jay back hopefully you hit me with the thing i don't know is jay back even here all right five. Oh, one, two, three, four. Do, do. Okay. Jay back. Hit me. <sighs> Got a Firefly Rampage Midnight Coup Charter Keep. It is, it is one for all adjacent in power, I feel like. You could try it out. See if Firefly is getting you those Rampage procs. If you can keep Rampage up with those Firefly procs, knock yourself out. Uh, Twisted Access 35. Obscurier. With the Prime sub. Thank you very much. Hopefully I said that correctly. Thanks for priming. And Corbler, 68 months. That was a Flavin moment for you. I don't want to actually know what a Flavin is. <laughs> I didn't even want them to be real. All right. J-Back is not here. So we're going to hold on that for now. Um. Oh, Sammy's gone as well. What is a forged mod? been talking about flavins all year in my biochem class like i am on guard okay i am on guard for y'all a forged mod what is brother man talking about like he's not talking about these or this. Wonderful day, Guardian. Can't believe it's 95 months we got Twitch married. Love you. Hey, Hodge, thank you very much for the 95. Big. The recovery mod I have in my helmet. Oh, Artifice. Okay. Because it's recovery forged. Literally never have even paid attention to the wording. 
of the artifice mods ever. If you would have told me, if you would have asked, what's a what's an artifice armor mod actually called? I would have just told you, I don't know, effing <laughs> recovery. I don't know, bro. That is a giga question. If I've ever seen one, holy, I'm literally about to effing put that Jeopardy effing 2000 glimmer question, Alex. Holy cow, that's insane. What is an artifice armor mod actually called? I'm writing that down. That's insane. That is actually wild. Uh, holy, bro. <laughs> that is insane. That is crazy. All right, J-Back's not here. So I think we're just gonna like chill and wait for Mac. So I'm gonna swing over to another character. And uh, cause Sammy left and I don't wanna rebuild the party just yet. Uh, I'm gonna go my hunter. I'm gonna go my, my hunter. Curious about which new armor set is my favorite from Into the Light. I'm I'm gonna be real with you. I literally bought and then immediately dismantled all of the armor. Um, so I haven't actually looked at each individual set outside of promotional material let's take a look it's probably back page right trade and we get to pull that in my menu ah And I have to just put on legendary boots. <laughs> God damn it. All right. And then base shading. Wait, no. Wait, how do I... Okay. Hunter one's not bad. It's kind of like an old school. I mean, they said literally like some of this armor is kind of based on the old school, old school stuff. I literally, this is like a season like one and two helmet. I almost remember the name of this helmet because I used this helmet in a well, good amount again. of my fashion early on. And support the Dato. Hey, thank you. Oh, this is the wrong cloak. Even better, it has that, um, it's got that wider hood, the effing, uh, the effing raid layer, Eater of Worlds, effing cloak kind of vibe. This is like a season one, season two helmet. Um, I don't mind it. Color's not my favorite. So I definitely want to fashion it out with some kind of a shader. But I also just don't really use like full armor sets. Like I would never just use the parade set and call it a day. You know? Cool. I effed up my colors for this. Oh, God. What did I use? I also messed up. No, I didn't mess up my boots. No, I, didn't. I think I'm using this. Valor Dusk. I think. I don't remember. Whatever. Where am I going? She's right here. <laughs> um. Yoink. And it's in 
Chamber of Starlight. What is there to do before the new content drop? I mean, we just had a content drop, so I would play, probably play that content drop before the next content drop. Thanks for the I'm returning to D2, what do I do video? Nice. Yeah, I had seen I had seen too many people in my Twitter mentions in like 2024 just being like, do you have a video for like returning players or new players or do 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 do? I was like, I will finally effing make a I'm coming back to Destiny video for people. And then into the light and like final shape trailers and stuff drop and I was like, I am now definitely making this for people. As a do 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 do, I appreciate the video. You're welcome. You're welcome. No, K Cha. I was waiting for Jay back to give me the uh, the thing that he wanted to give me, but then he vanished off the face of the earth. I don't know why I thought I should go up there. Oh, hang on. I gotta. <laughs> you have a video of shopping list of guns to get before final shape like the dungeon sidearm and so on um i have a list of the weapons that i think you should go grab from all of the seasons like the top five crafted weapons i think i i, I have it it's it's not the video is not top five weapons you should go craft it's just like all weapons you should go craft but it's basically like i, I think it's like five maybe six weapons at the most um, so I have that. Uh, I have god rolls for uh, the brave arsenal, which are definitely some weapons you should get before final shape because they're like the highest item budgets we've ever gotten. Um, so those weapons are Cat oh jam, my god, fine. Cat jam. Um, I have made mentions of the dungeon sidearm being good. It's not on like a specific list anywhere, but I've said like, it's good. You should use it. So I'm hoping people are like, oh, I should use it. And then they go get one. <laughs> but also that is uh, some additional paid content. Meanwhile, this update is free and like all you're I think you're more likely to have the seasons than you are the dungeon pass Even though I imagine a lot of people probably have bought all the seasons in a bundle That's her one tier list of all collectibles Tier list of all collectibles Like in the game I don't know we're gonna we're gonna tier list our tits off after final shape Tell you that much. It's gonna be tearless season. Checking, checking, checking. How's Matt the no cringe going? Vault cleaning. It's uh, it's tough. It's tougher than I thought. Matix, good when you are. Just fire me a message. Literally, no rush to your thing. Okay, I'm gonna finish this and then we'll do it. Tier list of all Destiny killers. Oh, that would be a tier list. That's something for the talk. Oh God. The one second I take my hand off the mouse, I get launched into the stratosphere. Team Jet Poop. Huge name. Thank you very much for the 100 bits. Hodge95 got you earlier. Thank you again. Thank you. Zenkai with four months. Welcome back. I'm not looking. We're fine. God damn it. Top 10 phallic looking weapons. Very Danielle pilled of you. The 
This was ill-timed. We made it. Oh my god, the angles. Come back already. Top 10 weapons to die to when you have 15 motes and gambit. That's my favorite Eminem album. Tier list, tier list. Yeah, that's definitely on the table as well. Did I get the pre-order pyramid? Oh, I didn't. I've never checked. I didn't check the uh, the kiosk. I think it's supposed to be in the kiosk. Um, stream greed six months. Goose with the forty months. Thank you both. Resubbin. Astro Grizz with the three dollar. Mac needs ball cleaning. I am aware, and we are about to do that right now. Oh. Top ten. Top ten. Tier list suggestions. You guys are getting real meta with it. And I gotta say, I'm into it. Also, someone asked if we're ever gonna do more drunk Mario Golf again. The answer to that riddle is yes. We're doing it like once every month and a half, two months. Um, but I'm definitely wanting to do another one. Uh, at least one more. It's probably just gonna be one more before... Uh, final shape. So probably sometime in May, we will do another one. Hundred percent. Don't worry about that. I'm just not, I'm not really doing them too often, because like I don't want it to get old, and also I just don't drink that much. So. <laughs> uh. So yeah, but we'll we'll definitely do another one. What about IRL golf? I do want to do, uh, an IRL golf stream in the summer because now that i know my friend spencer's in the golf i'm like we gotta do it i mean we gotta oh yeah the ship <laughs> um i also want to get into a rhythm of doing like at least one irl stream per month into the future i know i said i was gonna do one in march and that never materialized because Bungie was like, hey, drops for like the first time in a million years. And I was like, ooh. Ah, you got me. All right, fine. Um, so I, any IRL stuff is probably going to have to wait until after uh, Final Shape. It's also one of those things where it's like, because I haven't done it. I don't want to do it because I just don't know how it, well it's going to work out and like any of the setup for it. Like I have all the equipment. I've just never done it. So I just need to get one under my belt to see like what it's like. And then I'm more open to doing them more often. All right, let's get Mac in here and let's do this fall cleaning. And then, yeah, we'll, we'll do the, we'll do the whole D3 talk. Um, after we're done, because I had another person, I saw someone else ask about, uh, about that. Farming more talks.
Um, have I watched any IRL streams? Uh, not a ton, but like I I know kind of what I want mine to be like. Yeah, I know uh, the Connor just did his all uh, like raised like what a million dollars for for charity biking across Japan or something like that's that's super sick. I don't have my ambitions are not that high, <laughs> at least for now. Like my idea is like let's go to the arcade, <laughs> like just you know let's get familiar and then we'll talk about biking across an entire country for charity uh, down the road maybe. Um. But I have, like, a rough idea of, of how I want to uh, go about it. Uh, all right, where's Mac? What build do I use for Hunter? Uh, right now, I'm using just a very standard Orpheus rig build uh, for Legend Onslaught. It's a pre pretty cool looking emblem. Yeah, let's look at this thing. Yeah, I mean, it is just a straight up pyramid ship. That's all it is. It's just a straight up pyramid ship. Ooh kind of like that forbidden wish going hard again Ooh, with the texture that's kind of nice i mean i'm not going to use it right now but i'm still in a thousand when was the last time i you know what for my hunter i will use it i don't change my ships very often Wait, actually? Holy, this is actually kind of going hard, too. And that's a Vanguard shader. Kind of like that. Was it more time efficient to do Nightfalls or Lost Sectors for exotic armor? Depends on the Nightfall. Depends on how long you, it takes you to do a Nightfall. Depends on the Lost Sector. Depends on how long it takes you to do a Lost Sector. Got to figure out the math for it. Sometimes it'll be better to do Lost Sectors. Sometimes it'll be better to do Nightfalls. Are, is your team good enough to, to speed run Nightfalls in like 10, 15 minutes? How fast can you do a Lost a Master Lost Sector? Can you do a Master Lost Sector in five minutes? So it, cha it literally changes every day. Do I keep up with the old D1 raid team? I mean, half of them are, like, still playing the game. The other half? Uh, not really. A lot of, a lot of, uh, those older, uh, a lot of those older, um, members have just, like, stopped playing the game and, like, stopped really engaging with, like, the Discord and everything. There's a few people who still, like, chilling. Like, Zepic doesn't play Destiny anymore um but he's still like chilling around discord and and talking and and all that but then there's some people who just have you know kind of disappeared yeah zepic is a is an ff14 enjoyer rectangle five months thank you very much for the five months of seven re up in the prime okay i messaged Mac, I don't know where he is. Mac, Mac, are you in here? You in here? Listening for Brim. He's going downstairs. What stats do you want for a hunter mainly? Um, you want a nice split of, like, mobility, resilience, recovery, discipline, IMO for, like, the average build. I tend to go pretty high resilience and discipline. I go medium mobility, medium recovery, and then I go low intellect, low strength. Dun, 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 dun. I don't know where the F 
off uh, Maclan, bro. <laughs> I don't know where it went. <laughs> low intellect, low strength. <laughs> Sounds like me. Very relatable. Low intellect, low strength. And yet high discipline. I will say I do have high discipline. IRL. Well, medium. There he is. Gamer. Oh, okay. Now I'm good. What's up? How are we doing, dude? Let me turn you up just a tiny bit. Okay. I'm going to turn you th down a smidge. Oh. Let's see how there it is. What is the status of Bram? He just left. Do you mind saying it? One, two, two and a half sentences for me. Fortnite. Fortnite. We're going to play some Fortnite. No build. Preferably no build. If we have to play build, I'm not playing. I prefer no build as well, actually. I think. Wow, that's cold. It, it surprises me every time. Okay. Should be good now. I All think. right, give me that stream. Boot it up. Yep. In Discord. Do you actually, do you actually enjoy Fortnite no build? I mean, I would play it if like the buds yep. were like, let's play. I'd be like, I would, I would entertain the idea of, of playing. But only no build. If we have to do build, I'm, I'm out. Yeah. I will be literally I useless. Be, I used to be able to hang with build, but I can't anymore. Um. Yeah, I'm gonna run the ad break right now okay. as while Matt gets up his stream and everything. You should not Two have minutes. my audio, right? I know sometimes it does that. Um, I think you're normally supposed to get the audio. But I mean, like, it's tower music. It's not a big deal. And also, I can mute it. Yeah, I can hear it, but like, I'll just turn it down. All right, give me give me one sec here. Uh, ad break. Everything looks fine on your end. I'm gonna go check on Brim. Oh, uh, yeah, I'm good on my end. Sorry, I was muted. Um, no, you're fine. Volume's good. Everything's good. Uh, I'm I'm in the middle of an ad break right now, so I'm gonna wait until that's done. About a minute, a uh, minute and a half. Uh, I'm gonna go check on Brim, and then we'll that's be good fine. to go. My camera is doing weird shit right now. I want to make sure Enjoy that. Yeah. We're back. Oh boy, I love the spring cleaning. All right. Okay. Sunday Apparently, thing. when I share my application on Discord, it hisses everything off significantly. Oh, okay. Mm -hmm. If I try like 720p, maybe that's better. Yeah, it doesn't need to be super high resolution. Right. I mean, like I did the... like 720p, 30 FPS. Yeah, that should be fine. Okay. Let's try um, this. Here we go. Yeah. I'm like waving my hands around for a brief second to make sure that my camera's not stuttering again. I probably look doing? like an idiot. Doing a vault cleaning right now with, uh, usual, with Mac Dicks. And then uh, we're either going to hop into some more Legend Onslaught or I'm getting into Ghost of the Deep. For some rocket farming, again, kill me. Okay. Uh, I'm golden. Reductor. Now. It's Magus Reductor. 49. Big. Thank you.
Okay, yeah, all my stuff's good now. All righty. Okay, we're at five sixty-four. Yeah. Um, we're at five sixty-four. We're about to get another hundred slots. So you're not, you're not desperate. Yeah, no danger zone. So what what is our objective here today? I don't know. I'd love to get it like four four fifty? Four hundred to four fifty. Yeah. So maybe we clear a hundred things. A hundred to hundred and fifty items. Yeah. And if we if we're doing this for about an hour, mm -hmm. I just wanna let you know that that is two weapons or two items deleted every minute. Okay. That's the pace right. that we're working with right now. When you phrase it like that, it's... It's ambitious. It's more intense. Yeah. It's very ambitious. I'm in, I'm in an intense kind of mood today. Okay. So. Scrub through. Yeah. Let me see what you are cooking. I think there's going to be immediate notice in certain areas mm -hmm. where... Mm -hmm. Where things uh, might be a little more stocked than they need to be. Ha half your half your vault is armor, right? Yeah. Which the armor I'm not super concerned about, right? Because okay. my methodology with armor is, especially considering we're about to jump up to seven hundred. Mm-hmm. I feel like it's better to have more armor than less, especially if you use something like D2 armor picker. Mm -hmm. It's better to have more options for the calculator to just randomly spawn stuff together for you. Cause like, I mean, I'm never going to look at all a hundred pieces of your, however many ne piece of armor I have and see like, okay, is this, you know, how much is this one marginally better than the other one? Right. Mm -hmm. I feel so like, I hear you, know, you on that. And I'm going to interrupt you real quick because I was in a very similar situation. And I have finally, after over a year, I have moved on from a lot of the dupes in my vault because okay. they just weren't popping up in the armor picker. I like armor mm -hmm. picker would very consistently pick very similar pieces of armor for the majority of builds that I was going for. And a lot of the things that I deleted were like cope. It was like, yo, I'll t maybe Bungie will buff intellect, bro. And this t 27 intellect, 27 resilience chess piece is going to pop off. Spoilers, it never did. Right, yeah. Um, I'm with you so there. So I have deleted a lot of my cope from my vault in, when it comes to armor specifically. So okay. I don't know if you have like stuff. Now, I still kept some things like non-cope. I kept some, some non-cope. But if you have probably any cope, cope. rolls, yeah. that is where I would start. There's probably some cope. Okay. So you want to start with the armor? I don't want to start with armor because I feel like that is something that you can handle. Like, numbers don't lie. Right. Right? Like, yeah, numbers I, are not subjective. You're right. Um, So that is something I feel like you can do on your own to be like, how long? Like, especially stuff that's still 1600. Like, if you haven't even upgraded it. It's never appeared in a calculator. None of that. That's a good point. That yeah. can go. If it's still like, 1600, it means that throughout all my time of doing D2 Armor Picker, it's never popped up. Correct. Because if it did pop up, I would have infused it when I dragged it over. Right. Exactly. Good that litmus test. That was also my philosophy. So start with that. There were some pieces that I upgraded to like 9 out of 10 energy. Because uh, I was like, maybe this will appear in a role at some point and I just have extra materials. Right. Um, okay. Like so I like that you brought that up a lot. Dream Bane cowls. Four Dream Bane cowls that are all 1600. Yeah. Which means I have clearly never touched them in X amount of years. They've never appeared. So that's probably, I know, like, like you said, um, this is something I can do on my own, right? But I like that you brought that up because other people watching this like i think that's a good litmus test that they can use to like so they don't have to look at every single individual one and you know okay oh this one is two points higher in the stat two points yeah, better like than literally this one. They, don't to, they don't have to don't write it all out that. scrub through 1600 wipe it yeah and that's another thing that i do like to also use that someone just mentioned in my chat is going into dim 
and typing uh -huh. in minus is colon in loadout to see what armor you're actually using in some of your loadouts. Now, if you have like a bajillion loadouts like I used to, it's going to be not helpful literally at all because it's just like you have 400 old builds from stuff that you're okay. just like not using that you need to clean out. So the first thing you need to do is clean out old loadouts that are just like 14 <laughs> items missing from this loadout, you know, like right. what's going on. Uh, Which, yeah, like you... Since like, I make a couple of build guide videos and I put a dim link in everyone, I have a yeah, couple Yeah, you have to hold on to loadouts. some, which is part of why I don't put dim links in my videos is because I know if that link ever breaks, someone's going to be like, bro... Yeah. The link's broken, man. Yep, I got gotcha. you. Okay, so step one, clean up loadouts a little bit. Step two, minus is colon in loadout. Yeah, and, and so that'll show... That, will that highlight everything that is not in a loadout? Uh, yes. Right. Yes. Because, like, for example, I know I have... A load yes. outside with Celestial Nighthawk. And yeah, so Celestial so, is not highlighted. So anything highlighted is not in a in a is, build in dim. It's in the potential trash category. Yes, or at least it's in the you don't currently use this actively consistently category. <clears throat> okay, so cool. With what I saw, we obviously got to work on a lot of your dupes. Uh huh. So let's work on the dupes here, because a lot of these individual right. weapons, it's like it's so much tougher to dig through, like you know, a lot of like all the stuff on the bottom row, like you know, it, we have to go individual on every single one. Yeah, it's slow. Let's talk the big boys for. I mean, why do you have the the, the that? I should. Okay. This is, this is yeah. This all is right. the answer. Yeah, you got me. So let's see those dupes. Right. Okay, so we got a couple four adjudicators right here. Okay. Um so that's looking like PvP, feeding frenzy onslaught, okay. Okay. Is target lock worthwhile in PvE in any capacity? IMO, no. Okay. <clears throat> At least on primary. I am I don't like target lock on primaries really that much. You need to stay super accurate. Uh, for a very right, long if time if you miss a single bullet it's chalked yeah right i think yeah. it, it, i think it resets and if you're yeah. locked My name's not that good, on so. that kind of a target for that long and they're not dead you should probably be using a different gun <laughs> your gun's probably not good enough anyway right yeah now I, onslaught's a bit of a newer perk what are your thoughts on I, that one? i respect keeping the onslaught um okay I respect keeping it, even though, like, you, this thing can get subsistence, right? Uh, can adjudicator get sure. subsistence? I know it can get better than feeding frenzy. Mm -hmm. I'm pretty sure it can get subsistence. And you think it some can. subsistence on slot or subsistence frenzy would be preferable to I, either of these two? Uh, it would like I I wouldn't mind if you wanted to keep the onslaught roll, just because number one, you have to farm the cube, and farming the cube right. sucks. And yeah, number two, it's, like, so rare to even get an adjudicator in the first place. Um, so, yeah, I, I would at least keep the Onslaught until you get sub-Onslaught if you really want to go for that roll. But, like, okay. even with Feeding Frenzy, having to reload and, like, interrupt the flow of Onslaught is a little jarring. I see that. That makes sense. Hang on, my effing dad is calling me. Give me one sec. That's cool. I'm just gonna text them that I'm at work. Um, I'm gonna I'm gonna pull this one out just to infuse into something since it's 1810. Okay. Um. Okay, okay that is fine. Um. Stick some stuff in here. That's why I have open slots. There we go. I just don't like it when the icons are grayed out. It's harder to see them. Um, okay. So, some Warden's Laws. 
I feel anything other than fourth times the charm and Vorpal is kind of just not it on these, right? I agree with that assessment. Um, I think okay. it's also a bit better on controller versus keyboard and mouse. I can't remember if they've uh, made any big changes to its performance on mouse and keyboard, but mm -hmm. the only Warden's Law role that I know people are keeping are is fourth times Vorpal specifically for Lucky Pants Hunter. Right, yeah. A kinetic option for Lucky Pants Hunter. Or, sorry, a legendary option for Lucky right. Pants Hunter, as opposed yeah. to, like, Malfeasance or something like that. And none of these are that. Um, so, and I think it's Warden's Law right now, anyway. Correct. Yeah, it is. Um, so, we can scrap these. Um, I'll, I'll, I'm willing to scrap all three, just to force myself to actually go and get the good one. Um, don't know why I have this. Get rid of that. Love that. Craft that. Um, couple immortals here. Mm -hmm. Um, I like threat detector demolitionist on SMGs. Like, I just I feel like it's generally a good role for playing close range. Mm -hmm. So I like this combo. I like the threat detector hatchling for like strand builds. Mm -hmm. Um, anything that's gonna have threat of evolution. Um, especially on like warlock stuff. I love running this on warlock if I'm running swarmers. Um, because the threadlings will unravel too, so that feels good. Uh, we kind of just discussed that target lock sucks. Um, I think actually this role used to be like the PvP role, correct? Um, but not really the case anymore. Yeah. yeah, all I've heard about rangefinder is that it's ass, and target lock also got nerfed on SMGs. Right, and then uh, this one also was a good PvP one because keep away was like kind of decent when range fighter got its nerf but like now smgs and target lock are not really potent in pvp anymore yeah this is my understanding okay. also bungie just tweeted real quick i'm gonna let you in on this intel in case you didn't see it uh-huh um and chat will will actually talk about it when we're done here uh following the feedback there should be even better incentives to stay in onslaught for the full 50 so teammates don't dip after wave 10 adding two additional weapon rewards to onslaught and buffing trophies of bravery drops to help address this uh, change one, a chance for one additional weapon to drop when you complete a wave. Drop chance will increase per wave until you get your weapon, and then the drop will be guaranteed on wave 50. Uh, bonus weapon will also drop after you complete wave 50 in either difficulty. Uh, this means completing 50 waves will guarantee two additional weapons. Uh, increasing the number of trophies of bravery you receive from completing waves 40 and 50 uh, on normal, and then 30, 40, 50 on legend, because uh, they want people to stay longer. Um, yeah, actually do 50. Yeah, uh, Shax's uh, vendor rep was not meant to be reset. Uh, we investigated adding resets, but it's not feasible. One of our goals uh, for a weapon drop, uh, increase the total rewards earned, uh, as you can no longer earn Brave Engrams from Shax after you hit his reputation cap. Targeting an update next week to get these changes live in-game. Cool. I knew they were going to do something about it. So yeah. we'll talk on that. Did they uh, did they specify whether or not the weapon that you were going to get as you continued is specifically going to be your attuned weapon or is going to be? Um, uh, it didn't say, but I assume that just like if you can get a brave weapon, that the attunement is uh, like a factor. Yeah. But they didn't specify. Okay. They didn't say anything about um, guaranteed masterwork no. rolls for 50 clears gotcha nope 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 okay um i don't know why i have this that's not particularly good mm -mm. interesting do you think that that makes 50 actually an incentive now or um I think they could maybe do a little bit more. Yeah. I feel like most people are still going to reset 10 20s. Yeah. We'll see. I'm, ultimately, it's what? Two extra weapon drops? A couple extra weapon drops, but more tokens as well, which you can then convert into more weapon drops. Yeah. We'll see. Yeah. Let's see how it plays out. We'll make a little talk of that uh, a little bit later, chat. Um, I don't see myself ever using either of these, so I'll probably... Yeah, Chrome, hold on to them. that. Hold on to that for now. Um, 
pretty much the only thing you actually want on this is slideways is it slideways chain um you could do slideways chain if you wanted to i have one i haven't i actually haven't even used test of the board yet i know there's a lot of discussion okay. about deconstruct right now because it can just generate ammo out of thin air if you hit right. enough targets um but i i haven't done any testing i have also hearing like some stuff's a bug so it's not intended this is right. uh not working correctly this is working correctly i haven't investigated just yet mm -hmm. um so like if i was gonna keep one i don't know what's that middle one slide was hatchling yeah yeah, you gotta you gotta really find that in a build. Which, like, to be fair, like this grenade launcher is very good, and I don't think it's. Uh, I, I'm I'm also more lenient with like keeping more copies of a brand new thing. Mm -hmm. uh, like holding on to three of these is like not a big deal in my mind. Um, yeah. So, I'm just like, trying to. Rem I know there now, was a specific them. role. It was slideways and something that like people okay. were feeling, and I can't remember what the second perk was. It might have been chain. It might have been sideways chain. But I know bait and switch generally is kind of butt on breach loaded GLs. Yeah, I mean it's like it's it's bonus damage, which is nice. Um but it does take a little Over bit of effort to uh to in get this it rolling. Situation. I think I'm gonna lose this one. Right. Um I, I wasn't I'll gonna hang on to delete the any of them. I know, but you know, I told you I'm feeling intense today. Oh. Um, yeah, I think I'll hang with this one just in case. Okay. I don't know what's gonna happen with deconstruct, so whatever. Again, no, it. no pressure. I am not gonna pressure you on a, a brand new weapon to the game. Not gonna <laughs> do that. What's up? Okay, what is up with the perpetualis on uh, uh, r row two, column four? Column four. Uh, I don't know. Oh, I think it looks cool. This is what's up with it. Do you have the, <laughs> do you have the pattern for it? I don't believe I do. I might. Let's take a peek. I yeah, do you do. For it. Yeah, got me. It does. Brother cool, man though. hit me with the. I think it looks cool. It but does it not? Very I mean... blueberry pilled of you. You got, I know you got Rufus's Fury pattern as well, unless that's an adept, in which case, fine. I actually don't know if I have that pattern. I am not a Root of Nightmares enjoyer. Well, we just looked at autos, and I think you did. Oh my god, you do. <laughs> I'm not having fun anymore. Let me see. Yeah, and that's a normie version, too. No, it's definitely not adept. I don't mess with Master Raids. I'd rather... Um... I'm not trying to get demonetized. <clears throat> then do All a right. master raid. I'm seeing, I'm seeing a few more. I'm seeing like a submission at the top. Bracelets, by the way. Uh, you know, I don't know if you have the pattern for that. This is also completely unused. Yeah, I'll force myself to get the pattern. Let's drop that. There. And you're right, it is unused. So. Okay. This hung jury. Sixteen hundred. Yeah. Not use it Early. in an over a year, and you can also go get another one right now. Right, correct. Next Got page. There. Next page. What do we have here? Okay, we have we have some amount of dupage. Mm hmm I don't know if the okay the 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 deafening whisper at the top. If this is anything other than the giga roll, what are we doing? I don't <laughs> can't get it anymore. I don't know. You're right. Clearly, I haven't used it. 1600. Um, disorienting auto loading demo. Disorienting auto loading disruption break. 1600. One yeah. kill. Yeah. I'm sure I worked really hard for that kill, though. What um, else? We have triple tap and we have fourth times. These are both 1600. And Iclos right. is in 1.0.3 now. Let's double check <laughs> Iclos Sniper. Yeah. I think the reason I have both of those is because 
I remember the folks who cleared World's First Deepstone Crypt. One of them had the Iglos and Sniper, and they were just ripping the boss with it. And I was mm-hmm. like, I guess I'll hang on to one of those. Just yeah, and case. you held on to the, the World First Deepstone Crypt memory for four years to be like, it wasn't it still that might, ago. bro. There's no way that was four years ago. Beyond Light was like, what, 2020, was it not? So we're three and a half? Oh, God. Life's going too fast. But you don't have the pattern for 1.0.3 anyway, so. And no, also, it the, the perks on this thing are dog. All it has is focused fury. Fourth time's focused fury. Keep... I mean, you have high impact reserves, so like that's not even that much better. Right. But, I don't know. If that's all you got, then like fine. I noticed Sh- uh, that's kind of the way with some other, like for example, the Ikelos SMG 1.0.2. I like better than the three because the two can have threat demo and the three cannot have demo. <laughs> yeah, I mean, surely you have like, I don't know. Do you have other? Uh, DPS snipers are like a whole different like bag of worms right now. Uh-huh. Um, that I'm okay. Well, what is that? Uh, <laughs> nothing. I don't know what you're um, talking about. I feel like you could hover over like half the things, and you I would interrupt myself and and would have to be like, all right, but what is that? Um, okay. Shadow price, both sixteen hundred, and we These can make. Broken. Uh, the auto rifle from season 16, which is called my ass. I forget. Sweet sorrow. Thank you. Okay. I might not have the pattern for that, bro. You got to get on the pattern game, man. Dude, it's, it's boring. It's not, I, but it's like it's not that bad. <laughs> it's pretty. Boring, You're a creator. Though. What if what if something like of all of all the people, <sighs> for like people being like, but what if it gets good in the future, bro? Bungie <laughs> literally gave you access to, if it's better in the future, bro. And people are like, nah, I don't want it. Literally, don't have to store it in your vault. Takes up no space. You can make it whatever you want. I know. They're giving you the vault space. I know. They're giving that to you. And you're like, nah. You're playing the new content. You're playing the new season. Yeah, it's seasonal content, though. It's like, you know? Yeah, I mean, like, don't tell me you're not into coil at the very least. No, I like coil. I have I have most of that. I'm I'm pretty sure I have, like, 99%. You better, because the... three of the best five weapons of uh, the year are from this season. Okay, hold up. I know for a fact I have... I know I have the fusion. Okay. I've got... You don't have Aramite. I I would go get an Aramite. It's Uh, top five. You need one more of those. Okay. Um... I have... Do you have the linear fusion? Uh... I do. You have the linear fusion. Okay, that's good. We're chilling. Yeah, and also you can buy effing free deep sites. As long as you did all the challenges. It's free, bro. I know. I just ugh. It's boring. <laughs> Go I'm oh, sorry. Visiting the helm for four minutes. Can't do it, bro. It's free stream content. I, I know I'm not alone though. I know <laughs> there's no way. Bro. There's no way I'm the only one with this problem. They're giving it to you for free. I know. It came free with your existence. <laughs> Come on, man. <laughs> no, I know. I'm it's... sorry, but hot take. All cre- all content creators should be getting every single pattern available. I don't care how effing boring you think it is. <laughs> all creators. If you are gonna, li- if any creators are gonna live the, but what if it gets good lifestyle and you don't have every single pattern? I'm gonna throw you out a window. I'm gonna defenestrate you. Can I use the, but I did have a day job excuse? Fine. And so technically, but you just went full time, right? Actually, in like two days from today. 
by the in time two this days is from yes, today, I will. I will be technically okay. Full time. Then I expect you to get all my to get stuff. every. I want you to get all the patterns. Is that for, my new job? For stuff. Yeah, that my new that's job? your new yeah. stream. If you don't, if I if I ever hear from you, like, man, I don't know what to do on stream, bro, and you don't have every <laughs> pattern, I'm coming after you. Uh, okay, that's for you. Know, that's fair. And now that now you know now that full time, yeah, okay. Okay, I I sign I signed the contract. But that is fair. You were you were not full time. You had to prioritize. I totally understand that. Yeah. As someone who also worked a job and also tried to make content on the side, I totally get that. Yeah. Now there's no excuse. <laughs> yeah. Now you gotta go get them. Now now there's trouble. Right here in River City. Okay. Snap Vorpal, sn dub double Snap Vorpals. I hate these situations because Ooh, then it this comes one down has to extended the mag. Bag, this one has tactical bag. <laughs> <laughs> Pick one. Stop. Be quiet right now. Don't, I'm anticipating. Don't say what I was going to say in a completely <laughs> normal voice and a, in a dick voice. <laughs> but yes, you are correct. One has extended bag and the other. If this has tack mag, oh my God, bro. <laughs> oh, appended. Sorry. Yeah, it's a different masterwork too. Oh, These differences are important. Um, I don't even know why I have either of these. Okay, this one though, maybe this is li this is living some some old school snipe cope. I know there's better stuff to go get than yeah. than that now. What is that? That is a season. 14 icon that is splicer no -uh. it is that's, that's uh, nine seasons ago <laughs> no it just it just looks similar to that one go get effing supremacy oh i do need to get that <laughs> okay yeah wait. whenever it's last wish we get get a group together and farm kali it's two surely minute runs. I, surely I have that, right? Oh my god. Two out of five. Okay, never mind. To be fair, that no. that is like literally a once every like two months situation where you can even do that. Like literally six to seven times a year that you can actually do that. So yeah. And if you're just not to, around, it's like, well, f me, I guess. Have to cancel my family vacation. Last wish is next week. Guess who just started full time content creation, baby? I want us to see that supremacy on my desk. I'm going back to 9 a.m. <laughs> I'm telling them I changed my mind. <laughs> Guess what happened? I said red borders. <laughs> I would rather I would rather be up at 2 a.m. for a release than go get crafted weapons. Next page. There's it's an abomination on this page. Yeah, I know. Okay. I listen. I don't. Is okay. Is Aramite just better than every single one of these? Um. Generally speaking, the 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 slower the charge time, the more total damage you're going to be able to put out. But the slower you're going to do it, obviously. Um. And I saw you skim through every single one of these rolls, and every single one of these rolls, I totally understand why you have held on to them. Um, uh -huh. Although I do think you have some dupes in here, in here, like I'm seeing two envious controlled. I'm seeing a couple of auto loading. Was that three auto loading? Uh, but the thing is, on fusion, like the battery, like actually matters a lot, right? Yes. And I don't know which one's the best battery. Okay, I think I you, you're pretty much just always going for like enhanced battery, if I'm if okay. I remember correctly. I remember back in the day, there was like so, like half half the people would tell me enhanced, and then the other half would tell me like aggressive or something like that. Yeah, I mean, here's the thing: you want you want to know like the biggest secret of all time? None of it matters. Is uh is literally <laughs> it doesn't matter. Yeah. Literally, like we're we're talking like fractions of percentages. That like okay. in in real time play it, and not even yeah. in practice, it's just like. So not be negligible. 
with six HP left, and I'm going to say to myself, oh, if I had accelerated coils instead of enhanced coils, I would have killed him there. Right. I like, also know that I don't know, like, why on paper I drew this up to be a realistic scenario, but I know there's no way auto loading holster is ever going to benefit me on an energy fusion rifle. I mean, I mean, the whole concept of auto loading reservoir is just you pop right. one shot, you, shoot, you shoot throw it one. away, and then you come back. But, like, I don't think I'm ever going to use it, you know? Okay, I mean? so then, I mean, hold on to one. You have three of them. You want to keep well, sure. one, keep one. Okay, which one did you say? Enhanced is the move? Yeah, keep enhanced. Okay. Like, this one's fine. It's got some range on it, too. Like, get rid of the other two. You don't even need to freaking look at them. <laughs> but I want to look at them. <laughs> Just get rid of them. If you can get an envious one, though, then, like, envious can, like, chain, like, you know, four or five of them in a row. That one's cool. Um, yeah. Wait, envious like can... Envious... Reservoir burst can do multiple reservoir bursts back to back because yeah, it's as long as your magazine is overloaded. It, it thinks that the oh, yeah, oh, that's legit. Yeah, read the perk. Ugh. Reading the perk explains the perk. <laughs> Listen, <laughs> I got nothing. Um, Magic the Gathering sound and ask me. Okay. Maybe it was liquid coils that people told me was better. Yeah, there's a lot of liquid coils mentioning mentions way back when as well. Okay, but your enhances the move. Forget the. I get it. like I. Scrap it. It, it, it probably does doesn't matter, matter that much. at the end of the day. It really, it really um, doesn't. O only the most minning of maxers, the uh, the max maxers, if you will, are gonna care about that kind of stuff. Yeah. Born to hoard, forced to craft. Speaking of crafting, do you have a tyranny of heaven? Uh, there's no way I have that pattern. Okay. So why do we have nine of these? Because I just stuffed them in here and never looked. So I, I know we can probably get. Mm. Yeah, that's we don't need that. We don't need that. Yeah, so you, I just want I just want tempo precision. Really okay, what you want is like is, a tyranny of heaven. You think that tyranny of heaven good. is better than Priestian X? I so I I did a move, right? I did a video on the tyranny of heaven bow because everyone I I'm like a legendary bow hater. Like I, uh -huh. I'm like these are cringe. There's so many good exotic bows. Wow, why did you delete that? Because um, uh, I have the crafter version. All right, then good. Um, oh, now we <laughs> hey, the hold up, hold up. Wait, this operation was your idea. Now we got the freaking crafted. Because um, yeah. I was like, wow, that's the best roll, and you probably don't have the crafted, but you do. Um, I do. So I finally it's from, used... It's, it's from the coil season. I like the coil. It is from the coil season, yes. Um, I finally used Tyranny of Heaven because so many people are like, no, -uh, Tyranny of Heaven is actually good, bro. And okay. I was like, it's not. And they're like, it is. And I was like, fine, I will use it for content-related reasons. And then I used it, and I was like, okay, it's not as bad as I thought because they unnerfed Dragonfly like 14 years ago, and I just never really cared about it. And like Dragonfly does go slightly hard on the Tyranny of Heaven. Um, okay. And so I do really enjoy it on the Soul... Yeah, like Dragonfly Incandescent. Um, does actually go kind of hard. I don't think there's anything wrong with this. There's nothing wrong with this at all. But Tyranny okay. of Heaven is also just like a naturally fast shooting bow. Yeah, draw time 500 okay. MS. Um, so if you got one of those, you could probably get rid of this. But I'm also just a legendary bow hater in general. Uh, so I'm you sure me, I'm someone get all the out patterns there. anyway. So. Yeah, I'm sure someone out there is going to be like, no, but this bow, if you uh, calibrate it correctly and you get the right masterwork with these really specific perks, uh, it can do uh, 300 more damage, which is able to kill an acolyte in one shot, whereas Tyranny of Heaven... I don't care. So keep it for now and then go get a Tyranny of Heaven. Okay. I'm done. Uh, this is craftable, right? Craftable and from this season. Yep. I probably have it. Um, this ain't bad, yeah. Do you have forbearance? Yeah. You have forbearance pattern? Yeah. And why do we have any undercurrents? I'm 
I'm sorry, that's on me. That's my bad. Keep at least one? No. Purge. How many of the how many how many kills do you have on all of those combined? Probably zero. <laughs> zero. Probably a negative number. Zero. Are you still using forbearance? Yeah. Yeah. Okay. So there we go. Okay. Chain reactions getting nerfed. I know that. But guess what? Forbearance 2.0 is coming out in two weeks. Go get another one. What do we got? Sudden death. Slide shot 1 2. Mm -hmm. I mean, if you need a this... void 1 2 shoddy, yeah. like, that's fine. Mm -hmm. Okay. Yeah, that's chill. Only reason I'm Welcome keeping this Violet one Raiders. Is I was going to do a build that someone recommended for a Willow build video, and they specifically said you had to have a Discord shotgun, and mm -hmm. I never, so that, that's literally the only reason I'm keeping this. Yeah, a lot of, lot of oh. stuff to explore with Discord, although I will say I'm still incredibly underwhelmed with destabilizing rounds. I agree. I think because it has an internal cooldown on activation, right? Yeah. And like yeah. you just you just can't spread it as much as like incandescent or volt shot. Um and I tested it like a year ago and I don't think literally anything has changed since then, so I'm still like, okay, if it's if it literally has gotten zero adjustments, right. I'm still not going to use it. <laughs> so Give me 20 seconds. I have a piss real quick. Copy. Do a quick brim check. Let's see where he went. Brimstone. Okay, he did not go outside. Let me see where he went. Good brim check. Um, Papa Crip, 56 months of subbing, and Plifto with 52 months of subbing. Thank you both very, very much for the resubs. And we're going to be uh, wrapping things up here pretty soon. That was nice. Welcome back. I gotta do five push ups, one sec. Oh, okay. I'll join you for the heck of it. All right, I'm back. Uh, yeah, I'm never using this. Um, yeah, this probably ain't all that, is it? I don't even know why I killed 106 people with this. Gutshot straight cascade point. I mean, I know they un like slightly buffed it, but like I'm still yeah. good. Um, it says Volchot, but like surely there's something better I can get in the first column. For PVE? Yeah. Um, let's see, because like Volchot's pretty good. I no, I meant surely pair. there's something better I can get than Zen Moment. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, you can get Rewind, you can keep away. You can even get Dragonfly. Really? Yeah. You can go Dragonfly, yes. Volchot on this. I'll get that one later. Um, yeah, we just talked about how uh, the booty title. destabilizing is. So we'll get rid of that one. Um, the only I people like... that I think should keep like destabilizing or like repulsor destabilizing is probably Jura Falcon Hunters. 
Yeah. At least as of right now. Uh huh. I don't. Well, do you even need to stabilize in those with your Falcon Hunter? Don't you generate your own volatile? I'm not here to argue semantics. Sorry, semantics, if you will. You shouldn't, just for the record. Yeah. Um, probably don't need this one. Nope. Probably, I don't know. I just 68 I'm a kills and zero kills. I'm a threat detector addict. I just got these. What do you mean just got yeah, it? I, Guardian game's been over for a month, brother man. Okay, but that's that's like relatively recent in a ten year game. You, I haven't had time to break him in. Where where are you using repulsor brace vorpal? I understand Jura Falcon. Where else? Do I need more than one answer? I I mean, if you're gonna use it on Jura Falcon, then okay. How often are you using Jura Falcon, Hunter? Hang on, someone has committed a cardinal sin in the tower. Uh, yeah. Wait, what? Sorry, I have to reset my tower. Anytime oh. I hear someone put the the DJ emote on next to me, uh, that is a cardinal sin committed, and I leave the tower and I refresh my tower. Mm -hmm. So they're because no I've heard it be in your presence so much for so long. Yeah, that I just I I can't do it anymore. So we reset. Anyway. Yeah, yeah. Fine. Keep it. No. See what I care. It's, it sounded like you cared a little bit. <laughs> I mean, it's just... The title, again, has to be... The title has to hold the title of most kept weapon and least used weapon, like, of all time. You know, I'm just going to prove a point. Let's get it. See how much I care. You have two anarchies and two 1,000 yeah. voices. You have 2,000 voices. <laughs> I'm dual wielding them. Lay it off me. 16 hundo. 16 hundo. At least keep the one with some kills on it. Dude, listen. <laughs> you never akimboed some anarchies? I wish I could. Okay, but like uh, one of them is the ornament on it. Okay, but you can switch the other one to have the ornament on it too. It ain't one time really use. I mean, it ain't I, year I, one shaders up in here. I was really hoping you wouldn't have that argument in your back we pocket. Ain't, we ain't out here farming escalation protocol for some genotype was, null zeros. I'm not, I'm not gonna lie. I was trying to slide that one by you. What is this outrageous fortune in, uh, in row two here in the middle? I definitely know what that weapon is. Um, How did we miss this one? Um, it's a very sentimental weapon to me. Is it? Uh, yeah. Are you going to explain why? There we go. No, I couldn't think of a made-up explanation quickly enough. <laughs> Code Duello. I know, okay, Apex Predator. Yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah, and like, Lasting uh, Impression's kind of out right now, anyway. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Pfft, these hotheads. What are we cooking? Yeah, I'm Because I understand recall, keeping multiple. But the slammer problem that we have right now mm -hmm. was the hothead problem the first time you and I went mm -hmm. through. Okay. <laughs> Apparently. So, Okay. This one, I, uh, this one, I maybe kept for like, uh, I don't, I don't know. Okay, I don't know. Lasting impressions out. Field prep clown. Like, what are the other two? You, I, you keep it at least a hothead. Yeah. Lasting impression kind of out. The thing with rockets is like ammo. In what if they the, buff as it many, though? And, no. What if they buff lasting impression? Yeah. You really think they're gonna buff lasting impression? It's it's got to be next. You think that's you know? high on their priority list? It has to be. They're giving it's us gotta, like, like triple damage like, perks right now, and they're like, "But what about lasting impression, man?" It's got to go like make up for the final shape, make up for the final shape pre-order projections, and then figure out 
D3, and then like number three, I'm confident has to be buff lasting impression. Bro, you are so jazz pilled right now, it's insane. It makes sense though, right? Last Bungie doesn't even know that lasting impression is still in the game. Right, but once okay, they, they remember, forgot about it, like disruption break. They're okay. gonna be like, oh, we want the final shape to create a good lasting impression on people. And then and then they'll buff it. Right? You you get where I'm Alright, we're switching over to Balcher, everybody. You're switching over to what? <laughs> no, different game. Um, bro, <laughs> stop. Here's what I'm going to say is stop trying to make lasting impression happen. It's old school. It's okay. a very old school boomer way of thinking. I would keep, unironically, like, the field prep clown cartridge. It's like the social security fund of rocket perks. Yeah. Like, it's just yeah. not like by the time it's relevant, like there's going to be no lasting impression left. Yeah. It's just going to be house. impression right now. It doesn't last. Buying a house for six raspberries per of Yeah. And, and a, yeah. And a sure. effing promise to their kid that they'll hire them at 16 in their effing repair shop. Okay. Let's go to the slammer. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You're, you're right. What What is the objective here of keep? Like, what do you want to keep? I want to, okay, so in my mind, there's two good slammer rules, right? There's like the theoretical DPS one, which is relentless strikes, bait and switch. Uh -huh. And then there's like the utility one, which is eager edge, cold steel. Mm -hmm. And I probably have a decent amount of all of those. And I think when I was running corrupted, I just stuck them all in the vault and thought I will look at them later. Mm -hmm. Because similar to how i always get confused with what is the best battery for fusion rifles i always get confused what is the best edge and guard for swords mm -hmm. but i believe it's jagged and sword masters i believe you are correct okay you certainly know how to edge i'm edge maxing as often as i can and that one even has oh my god that even has effing uh freaking chain reaction bro Are you to do a little... with me? No, I'm not. Because like oh, chain okay. reaction cold it... steel does like some some neat stuff. I don't know. It's kind of oh, fun. Okay, okay, okay. I don't know. It's That's a two for. Keep... It's a two for one. That's why I keep this stuff. This one, yeah, not as. Yeah, this let let's probably... let's do us let's do ourselves a favor and delete the ones that Any... we know we're not gonna keep. Yeah, we're not like gone and freaking yeah. gone. Hey, but this could be two perks, you know. See, okay, so then, ah! so, all right, then hold on to it. Ah. It's all it's all in the and then we column, filter right? down from there. And we filter collective down from action, there. probably not. <laughs> yeah, no, probably not messing with the collective action ones, probably not messing with the demo ones. Oh, permeability is next on the buff list. It's a utility thing, it doesn't need to be buffed, it just is what it is. I don't even know what it does. I'm just you know what permeability does. No, I don't read the new perks. It's like osmosis for your class ability. Do not say what is osmosis or you're fired. Give me your I gun and badge. That's not, it's not what I was going to say. I know exactly what it does. Um, Control T D2 foundry dot GG. Google.com. What is osmosis? I don't even know what that chemistry course. I don't even know what that. I don't even know what that website is. Um. You got a, a, another like exact copy of the chain react. Oh no, sorry. This one has bait and switch. Okay. Right. I wouldn't combine well, like, chain with bait and switch. Although yeah, I, mean, I don't yeah. know. You can make some cool explosions, I guess. Yeah. See, I feel like we're just gonna get in the hothead situation though, where I keep this and then we do another one a year from now and this is 1810 and I have zero yeah. kills on it. And also like we have Falling Guillotine 2.0 that just came out too. Yeah. So here's yeah. what I'm gonna say about the slammer is that you gotta you gotta get this down to 
at the most four. I'm, I'm gonna drop that. Um, Sword Masters, Jagged, Relentless Bait and Switch. That's like my perfect one. That's what I was. That's what I was okay. gonna lock it. Let's lock. So let's I'm lock some stuff so you know what to keep. Yeah. So I'm gonna lock that. Lock it. I have that one locked. Lock I'm gonna delete it. all the other bait and switch ones because I got right, my. Go for it. I got my perfect. Oh, but so this many one's exotics already I don't locked. use. Yeah, if you're not a content creator, you do not need to keep every exotic in the game in your vault. You just don't. Okay. What was the second perk on this one? It doesn't matter. I'll keep this one. And then I'll get rid of this one. All right. And then everything else with BNS. Get rid of. Gone. So I don't need BNS Gone. anymore. So I don't have my BNS. Gone. Gone. Bye bye. And you go. Okay. All right. We're at four. Okay. These. I think, uh, I, think, I, think I can do more though. What's what's happening here? Uh. And I like the cold steel. Or I like the chain cold steel with eager edge as another option versus this one. I'd like thresher or whatever. So boom. All right. You Your entire back? vault should be board? one sunshot and you'd be fine for 80% of the game. Okay. So true. Um, these Wendigos here. Uh-huh. I mean, like... I have two auto-loading explosive. I don't know why. Keep that one of them, spike. but, like, edge transit is literally in the game at this point. I think it's, like... I think it's always okay to keep one auto-loading thing around in case just something yeah. happens and we're back in an auto-loading swap everything meta, even though we, like, mm -hmm. we sort of are right now if you're, like, doing some more advanced stuff. But, like, for most people, like, we're just still spamming as many shots as humanly possible as fast as possible. Do you think it's okay to have an explosive and a cascade? Okay, SK because useless. because it has the versatility of clown cartridge. Okay. Yeah, that's what I was. I'll thinking. give it to you. That's and then exactly we have what, what else? This you gotta get crafted. I have it definitely crafted. gotta get that crafted. Somewhere. Okay, fine. Um, what else? There's another one of these. Wait, why do these adepts look different? Never mind. Because they're from different that. seasons. Yeah. 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 Okay. This also has a versatility. Right. I'll get rid of the cascade one. That's fine. And then you know what? I think that means I can also. Okay. Okay. I, I, I'm figuring things out. Let me see these fractadooskies here. All right. In light action hatchling, that has to be like some personal reasons. No, that's a lazy reason. I mean, what are we like, looking at? The the edge transit situation is like. Like, the only reason you'd want a cataphract is... I don't know why I have this. Yeah, why do you have... Any... Oh, because that's the that's the, the one is that, that the they quest gave one? you. Yeah, that's the quest okay. one. Um, what, the only you reason you'd want at? a cataphract, I think, at this point, is if, like, for some reason you really needed to be on strand and to get, like, weapon bonus synergy, something, something, Flavin. Um, keep yeah. one. You okay. keep. I'll okay. let you keep one. Like, you keep one. Yeah. Keep one. 464 okay. and you still have all this armor to dig through again could we go through like literally every single weapon and i could find some stuff to delete like on page two i think row three column four uh could we take a look at that you're on page two you gotta turn the page oh i thought you said page two no page three unless page i did three. say page two in which i miss in, in which case i meant page three page three row three column four <laughs> Okay, this could be really good in the right. So, yeah. Okay. We could go through every single weapon. I'm sure there'd be more stuff to delete, but we're yeah. at 463. That's almost right. like exactly 100 items, I think. No, you were at 564 hot. when we started. So 102 items gone in about an hour. Next. And you have all that armor to dig through as well to get rid of. Yeah. So you can definitely get down, get down to the 400s. Got two risk runners here. Kimbo. Dual four runners, Kimbo. I'm just saying, could catch on. Two I have a lot Arianas. of. Why do you I, have so many duplicate exotics? I don't know. I... I don't have a good answer. 
I was trying to think of a good answer. I don't have one. I think we're in a good spot. All right. Yeah, 458 is really good, and you got armor Ooh, to get up? rid of. Like you, you got a, uh, you got some some room to work with now, and then you're just gonna get an extra hundred anyway. Yeah. yeah. Double parasite. I, is that a double? No, that's a prospector. Never mind. All right. I think that's a good. Uh, I think that's a good stopping point. Yeah, I agree. All right, GG's gamer. Thanks for your time as always. I appreciate of course. It. I I'm not going to say I promise you all the crafted patterns because it's. You should go get some. It is something to I'll do get to like chill. You need some chill gameplay on stream every once in a while, man. You just some like I do bounty prep when I want to just go no brain and like just talk to chat and just kind of chill. You know what I mean? That is what pattern farming is, is just yeah. chilling with your chat, talking, shooting the shit. That's what it's all about. Okay, I got you. I'm pick. Okay, I'm a, I'm a, I'm approach. Frame farming with a different mindset. All right. Yeah. Again, if you are like, bruh, they might buff it. You gotta go get patterns. Yep. Okay. I would disagree. Yeah, and yeah. at least like the top patterns from any given season. I know. I've I've needed to get supremacy for a while. That's you know that's very good. Mm -mm. Mm -hmm. Good stuff. Well, thanks for hanging, brother. Appreciate it. Of course, bud. Yeah. Hit me up anytime if you need something. Will do, dude. Do. Take care. Best of luck with the Likewise. transition over to uh, full time. Thank you. Excited, nervous. Yeah. We'll probably see how it goes. Yeah. All right, dude. Take care. I think I'll be up on time. You, you as well. Bye bye. See you, bud. Another successful shaming. Love that. All right. Let's take a look at this. All right. We're going to turn TTS back on. Do, 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 do. Let me turn it back on. Uh, we have an, actually, we have an ad break starting literally right now, and I really have to go to the bathroom and get new water, so let's run the break right now. When we come back, we'll talk about this.
I'm back with water. Bunk. Okay. Okay. Hi, Bim. Hi, Bimstone. Uh, JD with the five months. Thank you very much. Thank you, thank you. That was a little uh, a little while ago. We have Young on Watch with 47. Halo Sniper with 49. Thank you very, very much, both of you, for the resubs there. Sorry, I had to, like, turn my brain back on for a second. When I started thanking subs, that was me being like, hey, you're streaming right now. Like, do something. So that was my bad. I had to wake up. Okay, so Bungie just tweeted what they're doing to incentivize people to stay for the full 50 waves. Uh, this was something that I thought that they were going to address very, very quickly because Bungie historically has not liked when people just run a super easy part of a thing or just like take the easy way out in terms of getting loot. So they are buffing going the distance on Onslaught. What are they doing? They're adding two additional weapon rewards to Onslaught and buffing trophies to help address this. Uh, change number one, a chance for one additional weapon to drop when you complete a wave, uh, and the drop chance increases per wave until you get the weapon, and then the drop will be guaranteed on wave 50. Bonus weapon will drop after you complete wave 50 in either difficulty. Uh, so completing 50 waves will guarantee two additional weapons. Also increasing the number of trophies you get from normal on 40 and 50 and uh, 30, 40, 50 on legend. Uh, because they want people to stay around. Also, Shax's uh, reputation is not intended to be reset. They looked into being able to reset it, but uh, they were not, they're not going to be able to do it. Um, so, yeah, they essentially just wanted to increase the amount of drops that you get from running the full thing because right now getting to wave 50 gets you one extra drop and it's not special in any kind of way literally at all uh so people are just farming the first 10 waves which i think is super boring but like i totally get it um so i think this is a good start um i think it also depends on like how many extra trophies of bravery are you getting and then can convert into extra loot drops at the hall of champions um I am also pretty okay slash kind of happy that they did not really do a lot with the shiny weapons. I'm still very iffy on the shiny weapons because, like, getting a shiny is a really special moment. It's really fun to get them. And I think the more that they pushed towards potentially guaranteeing shinies, the more people only would have gone after that guaranteed shiny and the less they probably would have tried to get random drop shinies. Um... So I'm okay, I'm okay with them not doing anything with the shiny, even though I think some people were maybe anticipating or hoping, uh, like, you know, once a week, maybe guarantee. I think once a week per account, you do a Legend 50, uh, you get a shiny. I That's probably the most I would have been comfortable with right now. Um... But otherwise, good start. We'll see if it's enough. I still do think people are going to farm just like the first 10. Um, I don't know if two extra drops is going to be enough. Maybe if the tokens are really good, uh, it'll get people. But I do still think a lot of people are going to farm the first couple waves, and that's it. Just because it's easy, it's reliable, even if it is pretty boring. But I really enjoy just, like, playing Legend 50. It's just, you know. Isn't 10 still going to be faster? <sighs> yeah, I mean, like, because the later you get in certain waves, the longer it takes to complete those waves. I mean, some people are also doing first 20 just because, like, waves 11 through 20 are also not really that difficult and just saves time on, like, loading screens and stuff. Um, so, and again, people just want to take the easy way to, to getting the loot, no matter what. Whatever's the easiest, fastest way, they're going to do it. Um, I do think guaranteeing a shiny on, like, at least one Legend 50 clear a week would have done something to get more people to run full 50s. Um... But, yeah, exactly, Booze. It's, it's Path of Least Resistance. That's it.
What's up, beef? Dink. Okay. Do you think a flawless 50 wave guarantee a shiny is okay? Flawless Legend 50? I think I'd probably be okay with that. I don't know. I'm trying to, like, how often are people really getting flawless? It would, I mean, it would even incentivize trying to get a flawless. I think, I, I don't know, I guess I'd be okay with, like, a, a flawless, like, whole team flawless. You're talking whole team? Whole team? Flawless? Legend 50 guarantees a shiny? I I that would be okay cuz like how many teams are really going to do that? You deserve it at that point. You didn't incentivize lamo strats. What's a lame but what's a, like a lamo strat for for that? Just like triple well or something? I don't know. It's, it's one of those things that just feels like you wouldn't be chasing it every single time. Because it's, it's that's something like that's kind of tough. Sit in the back of the map. Yeah, but then like stuff. Well, I guess for moth yards, maybe. Yeah, because I'm so like Vostok and Midtown pilled. I don't even think about I don't even think about moth yards and moth yards is probably like way easier. No offense, the main people getting flawless are net limiters, so nah, I don't like that. That is a take. To say the least. That is... I mean, you said it. You can't unsay it. People leave the instant someone died. I mean, you just, you can't make it all about, like, shiny or bust, you know? Like, you would still want to incentivize people to do the full clear even if they die. Do you think we'll get a third darkness subclass at some point or prismatic it? Um, I don't know. 50-50. Actually, let's, uh, I'm going to talk with my agent real quick. Ooh, cannot predict now. Actually kind of a based answer. The average good Destiny players are not getting a Flawless Legend 50. Right. Exactly. Like, it's really hard to do. That's the whole point. Is make something that's really, really hard to do rewarded with a, with a Flawless. It's not supposed to be like a normal thing that you do. Oh, sorry. TTS is back on, actually. Boink. Is buying dungeon key worth trying to farm for cowboy cloak? Do you want to pay $25 for the cowboy cloak? Because that's essentially what you're asking. And IMO, I would not. I would buy the dungeon pass because you want to play the dungeons. But like to each their own. I'm not going to hate on you if you would spend 25 of your hard-earned dollars for a cowboy hat. But that's kind of your prerogative. Are the dungeons fun? From that dungeon pass, it's Duality and Spire of the Watcher. Duality is probably more fun than Spire. Spire has a fun final boss. Duality is kind of neat. It was neat at the moment. 
fixed odds pretty you good from Bungie duality would increase a shiny chance to like 20 to 25 percent for like the final day of the being available um fatal camo with the 50k um yeah someone mentioned that uh earlier changed setup changed setup no same setup um yeah, someone talked about that earlier, like someone in Lep's chat mentioned, or maybe Lep mentioned it, that they would it, perhaps increase shiny drop chance during the last week or the last day. I think that, that'd be kind of fun. Spire's more fun if you've never done Garden. Yeah, kind of true. Yeah, I could I could see them doing that, just kind of like a last hurrah, like we jacked up the chances. But see, if here's the thing is that if they say that, and he, he, people are still gonna get mad no matter what, because people are gonna be like, "Bro, I spent all this time farming for the shinies, and then you increase the drop chance during the last week. Why wouldn't you just say t t two months ago that you were gonna increase the drop chance? I wouldn't spend all that time like it's just you can't win, bro. Checking, it's the same checking. people who are like, bro. I bought this game on release for sixty dollars, and now it so is twenty nine ninety nine. It seems like Bungie is actually interacting and paying attention to the community and certain details regarding things. Does it seem like Bungie is going in a good direction now? Chrome Angel with the three dollar dono and that question. Thank you very much for your dono. Um, I think yeah. I mean, I don't know what happened. I mean, I do know what happened, but I don't know what happened. It's kind of like a like a Schrodinger's what happened. Um, why, like, they ended up laying off so many people on their social team, and yet they're being more social than ever. Um, like, I don't know what's going on there, but I think Bungie knows that they are in make people happy mode. And therefore, they need to be very quick to their reactions and their responses to a lot of things right now. Because, like, they gotta. You, we can't, we, you cannot go into Final Shape with bad vibes. You just can't. Like, vibes gotta be so up going into Final Shape. And I'm not, that's not to say, like, like you know, what they're doing right now is, like, bad or anything. I'm just wondering where it's been the whole time. Where has this been the whole time? You know what I mean? Reactions to Shiny seem like they've been super fun. I think they'll continue this limit time possibility for special skins. Also, any word that's been missed on if Enhanced Shinies will have both perks or will we be able to pick? Oh, like being able to enhance them? Do you have to pick which perks? Um, I don't know if they've mentioned anything specific to that. I think it would be cool if they did continue the shiny hunt. Um, I think something that would be... I know I'm going to like enrage the FOMO crowd right now. Um, but something that I think would be cool is if they gave that treatment... I realize, like, seasons don't really exist anymore, but let's, like, pretend that Season 24 would have been a thing. During Season 24, you could get shiny variants uh, of those weapons, and then as soon as this, as soon as the season was over, you can now get Season 25 shiny weapons. So, like, in the season, you can get shiny versions of those particular weapons. So if you're active during the season, you can get the cool version. Um, obviously, we're kind of rotating out of that now uh so i don't know how like episodes are really gonna work um but i think it's something that they should consider continuing to uh try out in uh in destiny because it's made loot for people like myself pretty exciting again like as someone who is able to you know get all the crafted weapons super easy and have that side of the game get kind of boring now. The shinies have kind of like revitalized my excitement for loot because like anything could be a shiny and uh, you could get like the giga roll shiny version, all this kind of stuff. And that's super cool for someone like myself. Uh, so I would like to see more of it because like it doesn't, 
even if even if they don't do like the double perk situation anymore keep it keep it single perks i don't care make it purely 100 percent cosmetic right so no one can complain about my double perks like just make it 100 percent cosmetic and like i'm still down you know i think i think it's a cool idea ornaments that you can earn in game that are just rare only took him 10 years All right. Do it for raids. Yeah, you can make raid weapons shiny. Random raid weapon can drop shiny. That's pog as f, bro. You get like you get to run the. You get to run the raid. And getting the the feeling of like getting the exotic every time you run a raid. You never know when it can happen. Like that lotto experience is still so important. Like we've lost, we've lost the line on the lotto experience. You know? Garage. Checking, checking, checking. Hey, Odato, I'm an on and off player of Destiny. What are the best ways to get better armor stat roll? Been watching it since Taken King, keep it up. PG and Dre have joined the team. I don't know if they're baiting right now. <clears throat> Where are they rocking? Another Orpheus. Three Orpheus rig hunter. <laughs> um... Hamadriano, 59 months. House, 46 months. Thank you both very, very much for the long-term subs. You guys going Titan? Um, Chrome Angel, again, thank you very much for your uh, for your dono there. Kinney with the Prime sub. Thank you very much for priming. Uh, Shura with the $3 dono as well. I'm an on-and-off player for Destiny. What are the best ways to get better armor stat roll? Been watching YouTube since Taken King. Keep it up. Um... Run the raid. Run raids. They're supposed to have better drops. Doesn't always happen. Um, pull the armor out of your season pass. Run master dungeons. Uh, focus armor at the vendors. Those are all... Uh, there's all ways to, to do that. What do I use for my thumbnail? Like Photoshop? What do you mean? Power caps eighteen hundred, pinnacles eighteen ten. Okay. If PG is gonna be an Orpheus hunter, then I, I want to stay on Buried Bloodline. I kind of want to do the re the renewal, the renewal build. This bro is not fashioned up right now. I'll try a Stasis Hunter. Like, why the F not, bro? What do I want the look to be? 
what do I want the look to be? Let's just let's just kind of mess around and see if we get a triple double. First shade. That's a good starting spot. Hello, where's my character? Hello? The one thing that I need to load? Oh, okay. Welcome back. Um, probably gotta do a different cloak. Let's, um, you know what? I'm gonna unlock the, the parade cloak. I'm gonna unlock it. I'm gonna do it. Let's do it. Chess piece. I don't know. Maybe we go sleek. Maybe we go sleek with, uh, with the hunter. With the stasis hunter. No. I mean, those are sleek, but no. 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 Solstice. No. I know a lot of people like the solstice stuff. I try to avoid it. Eh, virtuous? No. Not as sleek as I was uh, anticipating here. There you go. That's not bad. How do we look? Eh. It's a little boring. I'll be fine for now. Yeah, it's a little... Too, like, going sleek toes the line between, like, I look like I'm fresh out of the Gift of the Thunder Gods and I'm wearing top-level armor. <laughs> it's a fine line that you need to walk. Nine, yeah, sorry. I, did, I never masterworked these. There you go. Now we're good. I need to remember everything that I actually have. Okay, rhyme. Okay, so overshield, reduce damage, shattering stasis crystal, boost grenade, damaging with stasis melee, reloads me, slow lasts longer, grim harvest touch of winter. Okay, okay. Maybe I should roll with not fate bringer. Maybe I should roll with like a headstone. Headstone. Hi, Brim. You're gonna sit? You're gonna ploppins? You're gonna do some ploppins, Brim? Plop. Tubbs McKenzie, Deputy Director, how are you? I'm not liking this helmet with the cloak. I'm not. There's too much, I got too much neck. I got too much neck going on, but I think that's just now nah, that that might just be the 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 cloak. That might just be the cloak. I think that's just the cloak. I kind of like that. I like that a bit better. Join you in the pool for a moment. There you go. Hope you take your screenshot. Let's get a run in. And then I'll see if Toes still wants to farm Ghost of the Deep. And then we might head to Ghost of the Deep.
do 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 you have to love the content both destiny and variety brim is also super adorable take my bit wallet and maybe give brim a treat after stream i will do that i will absolutely do that uh, mukla loves cromorant mukla mukla what kind of you are we talking should there be an umlaut there do I have to go re-attune every character? Is attunement a character thing or an account thing? Anybody know? It is account. Pogging. Okay. I'm running the break right now. So by the time we're actually gaming, we'll be good to go. In about an hour, I'm taking a break, so no. Okay, maybe when you're back from your break, Toes. Because I'll be here for a while today. <laughs> I'll be here. Oh, and after this, uh, we already have some we already have some talks cooked up. I'm actually going to download these now. Because Vada is cooking. All that... Uh, All that ad revenue is going to start making its way out to other sources. We got Hive. We got Hive. Oh, yeah. I said I was going to run with a headstone weapon. Headstone. 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 Let's, let's break out old reliable here, IS Luna, because I'm running with commemoration. Otherwise, I feel like I would have run. I mean, I could still run with the Quillums. Quillums or IS Luna? This this IS Luna has ten thousand kills on it, dude. Why not both? That's too much. Too much of a good thing. You feel me? Ad break type? Yeah, I know, because we're, we're still in an ad. Trying to be more diligent about it. Yeah, it's up in 10 seconds. Dunk. I know, we never ended up talking about Destiny 3. We will, we will. After, after this run, we'll do it. Make me do it. Oh, there's another one behind. Brim, can I help you, bud? <laughs> yeah, guys, so D3 not happening, lol. Oh, my God. Look. Oh, my God. Where'd he go? Where, where was this? Wow, that guy went far, dude. Wink. Whoa, guy. Loop doop doo doop doo. Okay, you're gonna take too much to kill. I'm gonna leave. Okay, never mind. Literally everything's dead. Oh. We have a void titan on. Oh god, they pulled heavy. Holy, what's cooking me? I'm just putting this down in case I die. 
This ogre wandered all the way over here. Jesus. Alright, that got a little scary. Like a new, the new parade armor set. I think it looks fine. You know, it's kind of like a celebration, kind of mishmash of a bunch of older sets. Um, so I think they did a good job. PJ may have crashed. Oh. Sorry, he can rejoin. It's wave four. I think we'll be fine. Let me get... Devour. Who is here? Hello? Oh, he's running that build. Okay. Bro, sometimes the, the ADU be talking Japanese, man. Like, there's nothing here, bro. I guess it's because they're shooting it, but like also grow up. I wonder what dad is thinking when he looks over and there's us spamming emotes and laughing at each other. You know what I'm thinking? Thank F, I get to take a little bit of a break. Chad is just shit posting, I love it. Like, they're having a good time. I can just focus on that if I'm playing, bro. <laughs> they're, they're fine. Japanese may be the funniest thing you've ever said. Yeah, that's 100% a Datto original. Gonna trademark that. It's not. I stole it from the internet. What heavy should I use if I'm on Solar Titan if I'm running Sunshot? You should run. My fixed odds. Or your regional equivalent. Like Unwavering Duty. Or, I don't know, if you have a good avalanche, I guess. But fixed odds is your best bet. 100%. Oh, hi, Brimstone. Oh. A deke on effing round one, bro? That little maneuver's gonna set us back. About 10,000 scrap. Avalanche enjoyers, parentheses, I don't have a fixed odds. <laughs> Oh wait, I have a root. I have that. I forgot I need to be in the dust field. I'm in the computer. Oh my god!
No. Thank you. Couldn't even get a shield up. Did I change artifact? Ooh, definitely did not. Almost deleted my Quillum's Terminus. Let's lock that up. Remind me to bring you yeah, I'm still on that, 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 that. Um, I think those are the three, right? Okay. Whoa! I'm not. I need to get devour. Boss DPS weapon. Quilla, or uh, this thing's fine for now, because it's the first boss. Gotta think about the future. What are we thinking? What are we vibing? Thanks, Huda. I was doing it. Doomed per tish. I The only reason I'm a little sketchy on doomed per tish is because these bosses do be schmoovin'. And I'm afraid that I won't hit my shots because I'm a little pleb. So killing tally up. Am I not killing tallied? Arsenal so nimble. Oh, it hurts. Nice. NPC stream when? Eh. Eh, I don't know about that. I mean, if you think about it, half the time I'm basically an NPC. Just sitting here. It's like, yep. Trying to kill stuff. Auto-loading adrenaline. No. No as well. Itchy broom. Half the commands are basically NPC action. Half my channel points. Yeah. So go go do push-ups. Go do weighted squats. Pet your dog. <laughs> Just got back into D2. Is the Monte Carlo and Recluse SMG a good duo? I mean, you're you're doing double primary, which in PVE is not what I would really recommend. PvP, like maybe you got something cooking, I don't know, but you just said you are uh, you got back into D2 and I don't know how long you've been gone, so I don't necessarily believe in your ability to cook uh, at this particular moment in time, if you're uh, coming back from, a, from an extended break. So I would recommend throwing in a special weapon in there.
faced. Thank you. Slow your ass down real quick. Ooh, get out of there. So I don't really be using that for everything. Did I ever pay out the prediction? I don't do the predictions. That is all mods. So mods set up a prediction and then left. So I will see what I can do for you. It was paid out? Okay. Uh, in that case, then uh, mods uh, put extra gunk in their eye when they wake up, up tomorrow morning. Sir? Why Ias Luna over Volpecula? Because Volpecula is a 180 RPM, and I think those are cringe. That's really about it. <laughs> that is quite literally the whole thing. No, I don't even have a Volpecula let alone many Vulpeculas that would necessitate an entire st uh, stasis subclass. Why do I always want to say strand over stasis? Anytime I'm talking about stasis, I want to say strand. Does that happen to anybody else? I do it so often. It's crazy. That'll work. You too. You too. Oh, you're not stupid. You think Stasis Hunter Super needs a PvE buff in some way? I've always really considered it more of like a crowd control type deal as opposed to a damage thing. And I feel like it does the crowd control thing pretty well. So I would want to hear your arguments uh, for for a buff before contributing more to this conversation. Is Rewind Onslaught good on Rosarago? Yes, it's very good. Uh, Belo, thank you very much for seven months. Welcome back. Thanks, Lightning McQueen. <laughs> ka -chow to you as well. Cool, the second one missed.
Tornado seems to have a mind of its own sometimes. That is fair. Um, but when it does do its job, I feel like it's, uh, it's good. Nice unusual salmon. I hope the same for you. That's very, very, very nice of you. Updato, how do you think the new stasis verb frost armor is going to work? Um. Well, they they probably want stasis to have some good survivability to keep up with, you know, stuff like Resto X2 and Devour and stuff. Like, part of the reason I'm running this build is because I can get Devour with Buried Bloodline. And just, like, spam grenades everywhere. So I'm guessing they're probably going to do something maybe a little similar to, like, Woven Mail. To give you a bit more survivability to get in the fray. I know what you're talking about. I would just... I want to see, like, the exact update based article. Man, so based, he's already on third. I would want to see the exact article where they mentioned it. Because I, I sort of remember that. To see if they gave any extra information. No. Nope. Nope. Wait. Get off of Shax. Oh my god. I'm just gonna drop this here. Hope the tornado kind of just sticks around. Okay, they are not going for what's his nuts. Which means we're killing ads first. And then we're going for him. Oh, there's a lot of stuff behind me. Where's my devourer? Thank you. He's on the ado. It's not great. Oh, he's like kind of mad about it. He's still mad about it. Sir? I'm the tank now, bitch. I will refrain now from being the tank. I am the tank again. I am the angry pumpkin. Please don't. Ow. You can break out of that attack if you do enough damage to him. Yeah. I'm gonna, I'm gonna leave that ammo on the ground. Yeah, if you do enough damage to him, he gets knocked out of that. El Dino. 26 months. Karate, 7 months. Dean H, 14 months. Thank you all very, very much. I did see the thread, and I did woohoo. Call me Sims.
I didn't get... Come on, where's my freaking... There we go. I guess I don't even freaking need it now. Okay, I do need to regen at least a little bit here. Love some more dudes to kill. Let's make myself a little more ammo efficient. Okay. I'll drop that as well. Yeah, we gotta switch off the machine gun after this. Do I prefer killing tally over rampage on commemoration? I do. Absolutely. Because killing tally allows you to use it as like a multi, multi faceted weapon. You can go from ad slaying to boss damage, back to ad slaying, back to boss damage, and you don't have to worry about rotating back and forth nearly as much compared to rampage. Ooh, maybe. Close around. Mm -hmm. Yeah. All right, there's something there, maybe. Right, I'm, I'm willing to try it out. A machine gun. Ooh. Okay. Yeah, I want I want a non a non sticky version. No, no auto recom yet. I have, what do I have? I have like demo harmony that I want to try. Uh, put that in the bank. Put that in the bank. Let's, go. Uh, let's hit the ad break right now. We're in the build phase here. Firstly, hello. Secondly, you should use no backup plans and condition. I've done a no backup plans build on my Titan back when they did the changes, and I really wasn't the most juiced up about it. So I'm not I'm not in a huge hurry. To bring it back. He's going in. Seems like a good super opportunity here. I guess if Dre's doing that, he wants to make orbs, so I didn't really think about that. It's just been so long since I've even seen a banner shield void titan in the game. So that's my bad. I apologize. On behalf of Dado Nation, I apologize to Dre.
not seeing ads. Uh, sometimes you don't. Sometimes you do, sometimes you don't. Unless you're a sub, in which case you, you never do. If you are a sub, you will never see ads as long as Twitch keeps that function. You will not see ads as a sub. get you hello hello eh. missed I follow and watch too many people that if I subbed them all basically in a hundred month for free content I'd rather just watch the ad lamau that is fair but also you could just get twitch turbo so instead of paying like a hundred dollars a month you could just pay like what's twitch turbo like eleven ninety nine or something like that. I do get a I do get a cut of people's Twitch Turbo uh, subscription revenue, but also like I've had this discussion a lot recently. I I don't care how you want to watch. If you watch a lot of people and you just want to get Twitch Turbo, get Twitch Turbo. I don't care. It does not matter to me. Do you get sub emotes with turbo? Uh, you do not, but we have so many like free emotes through the the seven TV ecosystem that like you know you you will not have your experience destroyed by not being a sub. Now I am trying to make uh, being a sub a bit more enticing on the emote front. We're kind of doing like the whole brim emotes and stuff. So I am working on that. Um, but we have a lot of like really good emotes through 7TV that are accessible for everybody. Bro, Shax, you're killing me, dog. Oh my god. I need to, I need to freaking leave, bro. She's about to kill Shax. Heal him up. Heal him up. Been stepping up the emo game. Yeah, I just, it's, it's something that I wanted to do last year that I just didn't because I didn't, I couldn't think of what to do and i remember a little while ago i was contemplating brim emotes but then danielle's like oh but i want to do brim emotes um or something to that effect so but then neither of us did anything and i was like all right it's time for brim emotes and also i think pg suggested it somebody suggested it a lot of people did so i was like f it brim emotes cute brim emotes what are child labor laws about Profiting off of Brim's likeness. I mean, in dog years, Brim is like 50 something or like 40 something. So, if you think about it, Brim is older than me. And if you don't think about it, very good. That's what we like a mindless drone in the stream.
Speaking of Brim. Brim, what are you doing down there, buddy? Oh, you're still laying in the sun. He's still getting some sunshine, Brim. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Good stuff, buddy. A doot doot doot. Getting a bar to onslaught yet? Nope. Keeping it keeping it interesting with the build variety here. You know, running a stasis hunter for the first time in a million years. Thoughts on Clink Thompson. <laughs> I am uh I'm not very attuned to uh to the Warriors, so all I know is that he had like a kind of a like a dud of a last game uh in the regular season. Attack by I hope what? Expand this mode. Finally, something is actually difficult other than a day one raid. Based take. I would also love to see that. I want to go endless mode. Talk to local thunk. Let's get an endless mode in here. Just for fun, just for love of the game. Uh, local Thunk made Balatro. That's that reference, just in case people did not know, which I would understand if you did not. It's pretty specific. Give me the moats, brother. Oh, hello. Reload quickly. Good. Dunk. Think Brim is a 50 wave or a 10 wave farmer? He'd probably be a 10 wave. He kind of likes to schnooze. Oh, wow, I got cooked. thing is getting baked right now, bro. Mashing. Get back in here. Show the demo. Die. Okay, got one. this thing up this night is going insane this night's an effing discord bro he's like it's weak it's weak go I'm gonna sacrifice myself get my res all right I need an actual weapon now hang on Call me crazy? I want to grab a cataclysmic. You think Shax watches D2 frag montages? I like to think that he would. See all of that training pay off on other guardians. How's the state of the game looking to return? Vibes are up. What are you looking at, buddy? He's just looking straight at the floor. Just 
90 degrees vertical down. Brim, what are you looking at, buddy? What are you looking at, Tubbs? Did you find a clue? Tubbs McKenzie, deputy director? I'm gonna boop you. Doop. I'm just gonna, I'm gonna put my legs up on you, Brim. Ooh, so comfy. So comfy, Brim. So comfy. Big Destiny fan, ATM. Kind of same, really. Wow, this guy's nuking me. I bait and switch, what am I doing? I was about to say, damn, this guy's getting chunked, but then I remembered the Shrieker has like the least amount of health out of any of the bosses. I get so many people asking about the state of the game like that's not a totally loaded question oh my god he said the name of the gun bro um because like i don't know like i'm one of few people who has been around since the very beginning and people trust my judgment on stuff and i'm also live <laughs> you can get a immediate answer I gotta switch back to command. Come in. Okay. Legit wanna know what is your favorite favorite seasonal activity? Um coil. Gotta be coil. Is that a leopard hyper omega poggers crazy? <laughs> and it's wicked as well. Jesus. It's an effing holographic, bro. It's crazy. Yeah, coil. Good enemy density, good difficulty, longer activity, so you don't have to reset as often. It's up there. We'll do we'll do a seasonal activity tier list at some point as well. Even though I feel like it'll trend pretty much in the same direction as uh, the seasons themselves, but like F it. I missed two point blank shots. Override better be S tier. We'll see. Huge shots coming in. Oh God. No, it's killing Shax. No, it turned away. I'm so dead. Oh my God. The timing. 
Excited for Pantheon? Absolutely. Absolutely. Yeah. More knights, huh? Oh, that's a Giga Boy, which means there's another one right here. I don't, this is not a bait and switch weapon. I don't know why I did that. It just kind of instinct took over. Oh god, this guy's still up too. Make you inaccurate. Ow, make me dead. Okay. That is good news for us. We will not get demos. As our wave 49, at least I'm pretty sure we won't. Oh my god. Welcome cross viewers. Welcome. Run some onslaught. I might some run some Ghost of the Deep later. We'll see. But welcome gamers. Welcome, welcome. Skirp. Hope you had a good stream, Cross. I don't know if you're still here. Also did a, a vault cleaning with Mac a little bit earlier. I got to talk a lot of shit, so you know it was a good one. You can dig back into the, uh, the archive for that one. Into the uh, into the VOD, or you can just go check out the Dado Streams Destiny channel, where I archive all of my streams, and you can check it there. Cross was definitely having a day. <laughs> what happened? I'm in a little deep. Some 41, get me out. Uh, I'm trying to keep. Okay. I'm not even saying the rest of the setup anymore for these jokes. I'm just like, yep, Sum 41, they sing that song. <laughs> That's it. Step my game up. Oh, no. Okay, we're fine. Oh, we're not fine. And I'm out. I think it's born 1978, Peter. That's a very specific name and piece of information about yourself that you're just choosing to put out there, but. This is a gauge of pure combat you know, you do you. Hey, what's up, Lucinio? How you doing? How far out is the next stream highlights? Um, we, we were doing pretty good on the stream highlights and then I kind of hit a wall cause I was just, you know, like incredibly not funny. So pretty par for the course for me. But also I think stream highlights are gonna live uh, somewhere else going into the future. People on the main channel do not watch stream highlights anymore. Dre, I'm not gonna lie. I kind of let you down on that one. Okay, backing up. Um, so those those videos may live somewhere else going into the future. Yeah, I, chat, I know you guys watch them. Okay, you guys are the ride or dies, and I appreciate that from the bottom of my heart. Trust me when I say that. Yeah, 
It's the non-believers that we need to worry about. You feel me? Oh my god, this guy's right on me. We gotta go through the storm and start drinking some effing worm juice, you feel me? Grunning any specific roles, mountaintop or coup? I'm trying to get like a decent mountaintop right now. We'll probably switch to a midnight coup. I just don't see myself using a midnight coup very actively at the moment. Which is why I'm trying to prioritize mountaintop. I need to blink. Um, karate. Thanks for the seven months. Hit scan, two months. J Bang, seven months. Welcome back, all of you. Thank you very, very much. El Dino with the 26. I forgot if I got you. If I didn't, thank you for 26 months. This thing's still yelling, bro. Look at this chain. It's insane. I had to reload. Never mind. It's no longer insane. What kind of roll do I want for mountaintop? I, you know, there's a few that I want to try out. Look at that focus fire. Uh, we talked about it a little bit earlier in the stream. About what I'm looking for. I'm just gonna drop that over there. Um, but a few different roles. I wouldn't mind trying out some some one for all action, some uh, some recombination, maybe even some uh, some harmony. Oh, the shrinkers back up. Thank you. I'm so giga dead. I don't have any. <laughs> I need. Give me devour. Thank you. Oh god, that's not good. It's stuck in my ice. Let's go. Wrong weapon. <laughs> Give him what? The technical test. Yeah, if anyone knows anyone at uh, Supergiant Games that can hook Danielle up with a uh, with a technical test Hades 2 code, I mean, you'd be, you would be the GOAT. Whoa, sir. Yeah, I'm gonna plop this. Ow. But also, she really needs this. Also, I want to go back. Yeah, just so unwarranted, by the way. Only I can tell my chat to fuck off. Or whatever you said. Oh my god, Dre, get out. I mean, I watched, I watched the, the playtest this morning on Super Giants. Twitch, but I need I need it. I need it. Oh. Burp. it. When did you sign up, Alex? Did you sign up today or did you sign up yesterday? I didn't realize that they fucking had sign up start yesterday for the test. Brim. Can you can you pet Brim? Execute all targets. Brim. And make sure you're still standing. Can you get me a Hades 2 technical test? I don't think he can. What are you even doing to me? 
Why did we? Why did we even get you? Tell her to tweet it. Maybe somebody can help. I'm sure, literally, like yeah. they are just being spammed with with tweets right now. I also I got I requested it on Keymailer too, but Keymailer's fucked up because I I sorry. I connected my oh, YouTube. Keymailer effing catching strays right now no, for no reason. It, there is a reason. I connected my YouTube and it says eligible. I connected my Twitch and it said not eligible. Uh, no sign of recent pl playing of games. Or like, pl no sign of, like, no recent video games. And I'm like, the fuck you mean? So it's borked. And I'm worried if that gets my chances worked. Wait, did Alex respond? You signed up last night. Fuck! I bet that's what it is. They're going, to, they're just going to chronologically. Fuck! Did anyone sign up today? Like this morning? I got it? Today? Sorry, we'll, we'll do all those redemptions after we're done this run. Oh my god, my effing cuking. You did, you did. Early access was uh, <laughs> Sorry, you continue. That was not directed at you. That was directed at my own ability to hit shots. Look, see, Toes didn't get a key either. Thanks, Toes. You kept a spot open for me, and that's that's the real one. The real one for that. Oh my god. Oh. oh, now the freaking boss is moving, bro. You did last night, and you got in? You did three hours ago and got it? What the fuck? Are you fucking with me? You think I'm fucking with you? Are you fucking with me, Koda? I am not fucking with you. Do not fuck with me. Well, your mother. Or key for the Hades 2 technical test. No, I'm not fucking anything. How can you content time do? Look, you you might be down the list, Danielle, okay? Travel Danielle T, they might be going alphabetical. Hold on, he's cooking. Mm -hmm. it. Ambitious one for st what's with the sticky nades, man? Okay, there you go, Spike. Ambitious one for all. I'm interested. I mean, I would, I would take a look. I haven't gotten a shiny all day, bro. That was the time to give me a shiny. Attrition orbs, zen moment. Welcome Jesus Christ. Slick draw frenzy. I'm gonna vomit That's in my own mouth. Hospitals. Um, let me finish saying good stuff here. Go away, scuba. Thanks very much for prime subbing. Lord Bartley with the 14 grand master with the 13 months. Can you hold, please? I'm trying to thank my most loyal of viewers right now Supergiant. for their completely optional participation in subscribing to me. So I would appreciate it if you could not flex your I, I've been checking insanely my attractive muscles into the camera while I thank the subs. Thank you. <laughs> Chaos Phantom, three years of subbing. Thank you very, very much, Chaos Phantom. And Sinister Buddha with a 94. Thank you very much for the 94 months of subbing. I need an ammo crate with the quickness. Did I miss anybody? Lord Bartley got you. Got you, got you. Hitscan got you. Dean H88, uh, 14 months. 
think I got you. I think I got everybody. I think we're caught up. Nice. Oh, bless you. <laughs> Big sneezers. What? Nothing over there. You have Hades. Hades two or what? I I I have Hades. Just snooze ads for a moment. Speed wave. Curse thrall. Easy. I don't know why I did that. They're leaking. Here's what I will say about this build. Is that with PG doing what he's doing on Void Hunter, I feel like I am doing close to nothing. Like, PG is just doing what I want to be doing, but just way better. Wow, that guy is literally here. Holy yeah, cow. Yeah, if anyone gets a code to Hades 2 and you give it to me, I will literally carry you She will literally. For like a week with your be best friends. Whatever you want. I hope they are dealing with the Tormentor, because I am trying to keep everything off of it right now. <laughs> as aggressively as humanly possible. While also getting my nuke and cute. Damn, I kinda cooked there. Holy. Okay, well, never mind. Right, literally right after I said that, I kind of popped off. Holy shoulder pads, effing. Okay, Jesus. Check my peanut The turrets are doing more damage than I am, I feel like. Yeah, this is renewable. Renewal build. I said renewable, but I mean, it kind of is. It's just like the biggest ammo sink of all time. We still have that crate. Okay, I'm gonna spend everything. If you wanna DM code to, go to my Discord. I can't help it. I don't know anybody at Super Giant. I, I can't do anything for you. I don't know. Do you want me to sign up and then you play on my computer? If I get it? No, dude. My computer's not mine. What, uh, what were you going to say? You say not good? No, it's not mine. Yeah, but here's the thing. is that I could get it on my account and then you... Uh, log onto my account on your computer. Huh? <laughs> I'm sorry. If I could get you into the game, I would. 
and you know that. How far are we playing? <laughs> Account sharing reported. Good luck, I'm behind seven proxies. Here's how much of main character syndrome I had. I genuinely thought that I would have it by now. <laughs> I was like, yeah, of course I'm gonna get it. I'm me. <laughs> Good stuff always happens to me, right? I, I usually get what I want. <laughs> <laughs> Enjoyed Hades 2. Tell me you got into the technical test. If anyone deserves it, you you do. Alright, I'm gonna I'm gonna run the ad break while we're running uh wave 46. Wait, there's one thing still alive? Oh god. It's the worst thing. Okay, running the break during uh, 46, uneventful. Do you want me to sign up? I'll sign up. Okay, well, I'm gonna sign up anyway because if I do get it, I you're gonna wanna have it. Request access. Okay. I've requested access. Are you, are you signed up for female info? No, I just did whatever is on Steam. Right. It's better than nothing. Here's the thing, yeah, <laughs> exactly stealth is like, if I do get in and I get in soon, I don't even wanna tell you because you'll be so mad <laughs> that you didn't get in and I got in immediately. Yeah, I will. <laughs> so. yeah, yeah, but then I, if you get I to will. play, would you still be mad? Uh, yeah. <laughs> So even though you got what you wanted, you would still be mad? Yeah, because you're not going to stop stream right now and let me play. Can two people be playing on the same account at the same time on Steam? No. Rip. Mm, the witching hour is here where the sun bounces off of my desk directly into my face. What I really need is a much larger desk if you want me to have a third monitor. Should I use Vesper or Fallen Sunstar? Very two different builds. It actually does, thank you. Very two different builds. Look at that ad break ending right as we finished. How does he do it? Um, completely depends on what you want to accomplish. Sunstar is more of like a slay out build. Vesper is more of a control build. So, it depends. Farming for a bit today. That's the plan, although I might be stepping into Ghosts of the Deep. Don't say a, a war with the Cabal on Mars. You're banned if you do. These knights have so much health. Can't even proc devour, man. There we go. I checked when my email came through and I got it about a half hour after requesting, so you might get it that quickly. Okay. Uh, we're on 48 right now. I am gonna focus up for like the next two rounds so we don't lose this Because I actually got PG to run a, a full 50 Cool my thing didn't hit anything All 
Uh, we're pretty close to the end. It's just Acolytes. I'm going to save my nade. Shielded Sky Bomber. Okay, we're chilling. Oh my god, that's another Night Wave. Out of green. What is coming around? Hello? Oh my god, this guy's gonna kill me. Never mind, turret's cooked. And Sky Bomber sucking the last enemy. Last enemy. Toss this in. It's wave 50. I don't know what I'm doing. We're done. We're literally done here. If you use Steam Family, you can use games from all accounts simultaneously, but not the same game at the same time. Mmm. Execute all targets and make sure you're still standing when the dust settles. I'm going to have my phone on tap here. Dunka, dunka, dunka. How do I like this build for Onslaught? So we have an Orpheus Hunter and the Orpheus Hunter is doing like eight trillion times more things than I feel like I'm doing. So like it's fun, but without the Orpheus Hunter, I feel like we'd be in a bit of trouble. So right, but without doing another run, without a, uh, without a what you call it, it's kind of tough to tell. Okay, I cannot fight in these conditions. Don't boot me out. This is probably actually the worst gun to be using against this boss. What am I what am I supposed to do? You just should have launched me. Okay. It literally just launched me. No, you're you're good, John Doe. You're good. I appreciate the intel. No. Well, we've done more damage than I uh, than I thought. Ooh, that is a tough one. Unless it was bait the whole time. Okay, you're over there now. I'm just gonna flick one of these. Is that too slow? It was, but I'm still getting 45Ks, so we're gonna take it. Nope. 
Give me that. Give me. Give me it. enemies out there bro look at all those knights if you go past this bridge you will just instantly die to the knights okay bosses off the map take advantage kill ads would love some of this green here this is a mistake I'm not. I did it. I did it already. Oh. Oh my god. That was PG resing me, them shooting my body. Oh, <laughs> don't. <laughs> that was about to be the biggest troll of all time. Oh my god. That was about to be the biggest troll. The bubble goes away and the stomp comes through. Holy cow. All right, nice clear. Demo Frenzy. I, I've been getting Spike a lot. I just didn't want Frenzy, man. If, like, everything else about it is good. I just didn't want Frenzy. Oh, don't forget about the last chest. Also, none shinies today. What's wrong with Frenzy? There's nothing wrong with Frenzy. I just wanted some other stuff. No, this is with friends. I thought we were dressed the same for a second. I was like, this is really close. No, it's, I don't hate Frenzy. I'm not a Frenzy hater. Okay, don't get it twisted. I'm not a Frenzy hater. Just on Mountaintop, I wanted to try something out that was a bit more interesting. That's all. Good place to find two other Guardians for contest mode. Final shape. Clear. Where to find people. Um, you're probably going to have the most luck searching Discord servers or different, like, subreddits, raiding subreddits. Uh, maybe some other people in chat have some other resources for you. Where's my shader come from? Princely Presence. Comes from this season next best thing after spike nades that's a great question i'm not sure what the consensus is let me take a look see i think the whole point is that it's not supposed to matter that much but obviously it does um if you're not going for spike Oh, high velocity. Yeah, the other two options are implosion and sticky nades. High velocity, 100%. Not even a question.
All right, good run, good run. A little bit of a breather here. Will I ever even look at a hung jury? Miss me with scout rifles, man. If I get a sh if I get a shiny hung jury, and it's got good stuff, I'll keep it. Otherwise, I'm not keeping normie hung juries. Miss me with that. Nomad, I got you. What's the question? Dump it, dump it, dump it. So I've got a shiny hung jury. Uh, I probably have. I don't know. Did I? Hung jury. That's a nice old jury. That, yeah, there's that. Um, what do I have? I have a one for all kinetic tremors, non shiny. That's it. Are Jordan threes ever appropriate for a wedding suit? Um, I think if you find some like nice, you know, something little black and white. Uh, you know, something not too, not too aggressive. Some, uh, do they have, when was the last time they released Black Cat 3s? Were those recent? Am I hallucinating that? Black Cat 3? That's, I th isn't that coming, that's maybe coming out this year. As a guest, not the groom. Look, I wore Jordan 1s to my wedding. There's no hate here. Black Cat would be the only thing, like, off the top of my head that, like, probably wouldn't offend because it's just, they're just all black shoe. Um, they can look good. But you really got to match the outfit. I'm trying to find stuff that's, like, that's come out recently. Everything I'm finding is like, this came out in 2014. Like, sick. Thanks. Because there are a lot of, like, relaxed looking Jordan 3s. Like, uh, maybe like a Craft Ivory. Those came out. Or the White Cement Reimagined. Quality on those is a little iffy. Um, if you're wearing something, uh, it's more brown tone. You got the Palominos. Off Noir, Off Noir could could kind of pop. It's got some elephant print on there, but they're also black, white, gray. Not very, uh, not not very in your face. Um, if you're wearing more white tan, then you want probably Craft Ivory. Uh, I don't know if I would go Black Cement. I'd probably go Off Noir over Black Cement, even though Black Cement is a classic, but it's also much more expensive. I think the reimagined. They do a reimagined. They do a reimagined uh, uh, black cement threes. I feel like I saw something that said that they were doing that. Is Lumina good for onslaught? It's not my first choice. <laughs> It's a very, uh, very support heavy type of setup that I think you gotta go. And I think it'll maybe fall off in later rounds because you need to be able to kill a lot. Let's see, muslin, muslins are not bad either. Not too offensive. You know, I'm trying to keep it like very low key. Not a ton of colors. Where are the Jordan 3 haters at? I don't hate them, but I'm not in love with them. Are shinies really worth it? That depends entirely on how much you care about a shiny cosmetic with double perks. Because for most people, it doesn't matter. Dato arrive. Masrick, 84 months. 
Gerbasaurus, 32 months. Hoovercraft with 20 months. Thank you very, very much. But yeah, no man, you can you can find some. You can find some nice ones. But also I would buy if if you are gonna pair if you are gonna buy a pair of Jordan 3s specifically for a wedding, make sure they're also a pair that you can wear like outside of a wedding too. <laughs> make sure you have outfits to support that particular pair of shoes. Sketch impression, please. I'm not sure what that means. I don't want to get ready to stream. I just want to mope about Hades too. Dan, Danielle, just get ready for stream. I don't know who sketches. The only sketch I know is like sketch comedy, and I'm I'm not in a position to do that. Okay, I did say to yell at me about Destiny Three stuff. Um, I want to watch a couple of, of things that Vada has sent me hyper quick. So let me do that with the quickness. And then we will get to some more gaming. He just wants you to point up and say, what's up, brother? The only reason I'm pointing up is to be the tribal chief. And that's it. Give me one sec. And I don't even know what this is. The only reason I know what this is is because they, because PG and the boys, they all love wrestling and they've just photoshopped my head over the dude. And now I'm the travel chief, so I'll be back in a minute or so. I'll be right back. <laughs> Who you got in the Heat Sixers to play your Knicks? I am a Knicks fan. Um, didn't the Sixers get Embiid back? That's going to be scary. That's going to be scary. One second. Welcome back. Vada, I don't know if you're in here, but uh, the, the, um, oh, I should actually do that. Forgot to ask you the D3 question, my B. J back, perfect. You are the original person to want to do that. Yes. Give me one moment.
I'm getting, uh, I'm getting kind of talked up right now. And then we'll do that. Who I got on the Kendrick Drake beef? I have no idea. I'm that I could not be farther away from from that world. Bro, how are you how are you supposed to move the there you go. Okay, how do I make set duration? There we go. Yeah, don't want the dura I don't want the title to be there for for uh the entire talk. Hang on. Sorry. I'm 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 new to TikTok. I'm trying to get this up. Bold. Black. Whoa, no. Probably not that. Um yes. Save. Okay, next. Okay, I'm sorry. Making content while making content is stressful. And by, I mean, I didn't make it. Technically, Vada made it. Who's on Destiny 2 TikTok? What kind of hashtag should I be using for Destiny 2 TikTok? Who's watching? Hashtag Tuesday Reset. Let's see. Nope. Not a lot. Hashtag Mortgage Gaming. <laughs> Dads of Destiny, probably Destiny 2. I got that one. That one, we're we're good. I'm gonna do hashtag gaming. How about that? Kind of, kind of broad. I'm not gonna lie. That's a bit broad. Hashtag gaming. We'll see how we do in the algorithm there. All right, push that mother live. It begins. J back eight months. Let's talk about this effing this D three because we talked about it a little bit recently. What is the original source of 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 these rumors? Source, I made it the F up. What is, what spurred this? What spurred this along? Reddit guy. Luke Smith saying one vague line in the video. I do remember that. Reddit guy who predicted prismatic. In the same thread. Someone on Reddit posted a month ago accurate descriptions of Prismatic and also, also mentioned Destiny 3. Correct one time, so they're one for one. All show, sorry. Very, uh, shoe puff. Shoe, uh, shoe puff pilot, uh, speak of me. Wasn't there a tweet about something too? J-Back, what do you got? What do you got for me? Or what? anybody else? We're trusting a soothsayer, apparently. That same person said they also didn't know... Same person said they didn't know if they were still working on a Destiny 3. Said info came from an ex-developer. 
spot on with prismatic details said d3 may or may not be in production okay yeah the pay the the payback stuff i i i have seen somewhere Someone, like, wrote an article, but I'm guessing that article was based on, like, whatever Reddit post came out, right? He even got the name for Prismatic right ages ago. Okay. Well, again... guy on reddit made a post over a month ago predicted all the into the light weapons and prismatic subclass also said d3 was in a minimal was in very minimal development as of 2022 okay in that case everything that i have said in the past about a, a destiny 3 uh i will maintain in that I think there's a lot of hurdles that Bungie needs to work through in order to be able to make something like that work. Um, and it de depends entirely on their philosophy of how they want to rotate to a Destiny 3 if they do want to make a Destiny 3, right? Me personally, I don't mind wiping the slate clean. I don't care. You want to take literally everything I've earned and get rid of it? I don't care. Literally don't care. To some people, you maybe feel the same way. To other people, that might sound like the most devastating thing that you've ever heard, right? So the philosophy behind carrying everything in D2 over to D3 is like, that's a lot of stuff to be transferring over that's like why are we making three if we're just bringing everything from two into three right like why not just stick with two so bungie would need a very very good reason to rotate over to a three if they are choosing to take everything from destiny 2 and put it into destiny 3 let's say besides like triumphs you know could my triumphs carry over I'm, I'm cool with, with triumphs carrying over, right? I'm cool with that. Or your triumph score, or just, you know, something to point out your legacy on Destiny 2, right? That is not to say that I am opposed to Bungie making a Destiny 3, because there are some merits to making a Destiny 3. Bungie gets to wipe some of the slate clean. They get to maybe, you know, try some stuff over again that they want to try over. Um, it also is a new launching off point to grab some potential new players, right? But people here, Destiny 2 has been out for however many years and XYZ amount of content has been removed from the game and I can't play it and there's so much bad news. If they start over with the Destiny 3, then that's a new launching off point for a lot of people. And I can totally see the financial incentive behind doing that. And again, if they want to wipe the slate clean, they want to make a Destiny 3, I don't care right? It probably helped me too, right? They make a Destiny 3. We got to start over with a new thing. I'm I'm down, bro. This is my career. This is literally my job. You want to keep it rolling? I'm more than happy to oblige. Um, I've just never thought that based on the reaction of Destiny 1 transferring to Destiny 2, even based on the reaction Destiny 1 going into the dark below where they're like, like the whole leveling uh going from 300 to like 331 uh, light level on your items that whole cacophony how that went over i just never thought that going from a d2 to a d3 and wiping the slate clean was even a feasible option based on how much people would be mad about losing all of their stuff if they do lose all of their stuff. And then if they don't lose all of their stuff and they carry everything over, it's like, okay, well then why are you making a three? Why not just keep dumping stuff into two, right? So my, my takes haven't really changed on that front. 
So that's why if something like a D3 does end up happening or it is in development, it, that's why it kind of surprises me is just knowing like how much money people have probably spent on this, how much time they've invested and to see that all wiped clean, I think would be upsetting to quite a lot of people. But again, if Bungie is like, look, we can make the game even better if we can if we can get a, fr a fresh start and really like dial in on some things to make the game even better than it currently can be. Go for it, bro. Go for it. Do it. I would love for this for this game to have a bit more positivity outside of its community, of which it already doesn't really have that much positivity, right? Right now things are like you know, the vibes are up as much as they've ever been, but outside of our community, people are still like, LOL, Destiny, right? And a fresh start with D3 and having it be good, building some good publicity for the game does a lot for the franchise as well. And I think that's really all I gotta say on that. I don't think that, you know, like, I, I don't want to get into, like, engine talk again. I have the whole engine video that I did. I still believe all that stuff. And Bungie has also said in the past, at least, like, one of their lead engineers has been, like, we're not gonna, we're not gonna change engines or anything like that. And I am not smart enough to talk about engines on that front in the slightest. Anyway, we hit an ad break, so I'm gonna hold on that, and then we'll... We'll uh, keep talking about it again. I'm literally going to pause the chat at like right here so I can address a couple of comments. <laughs> Hold, please. Let's all drink some water. Let's stand up and stretch. I owe a couple of those. Everyone stand up and stretch. Have a drink of water or something. Okay, and it breaks over in 30 seconds. Uh, Nef Dementor, thank you very much for prime subbing. Nasty Mooncake, four months of prime subbing. Thank you both very, very much for subbing. Thank you very, very much. All right, 20 seconds. Let me, if I can close out of this. Mm-hmm, hmm hmm Okay. All right. Two, one, we're back. Okay. Continuing that conversation. Welcome back, ad viewers. Um, I remember a short of the ex Blizzard dev saying working on such a packed game forces the devs to fiddle with old code and always creates many more problems longer and longer into the game's life. At some point, it makes, uh, might make more sense for the devs to do a fresh start. I mean, that's part of why destiny started sunsetting content in the first place is like the game was getting so bloated and people weren't spending any time on these other pieces of content and they were causing problems so like i totally understand that like I, we are i'm we're both on the same page there you know if d3 was happening they never would have brought all the d i assume you mean d1 raids into d2 much more likely they do a rebrand of D2 with D3 level changes. I could also see something like that happening, for sure. I could see them... I mean, I could also see them, like, dropping the two, and it's just like, it's just Destiny now, like, whatever. Um, could also be, yeah, Alex uh, uh, dropping last gen. The only thing about dropping last gen is that if there's still a large portion of the community on last gen, I don't think they drop it. 
because it's still like a big amount of the player base and and i don't know if you can but i don't know the metrics behind that i think you know back when rise of iron dropped it was rise of iron that dropped playstation 3 and xbox 360 i'm pretty sure like those were very very low percentages of players still playing on that hardware um and also they were basically at the at the end of their lives anyway whereas I feel like old gen is still somewhat relevant, but it, enti it depends entirely on plop population counts, which I don't think we really have. Yeah, all, all the engine talk here, like, I I believe when the lead engineer of the game says, yeah, we're probably not moving to a new engine. D3 needs to be an entirely different character and environment. We don't need D3 being D2 and bringing all of D1, D2 to the game over time. No one wants to play with stuff that they bought twice. Well, I mean, it's not like, you know, D3 would just be like, yeah, bring all the stuff from D1 and D2. It would, I mean, if anything, it would be that plus whatever, like, new campaign and planets and story and, like, all that other stuff. I don't care if they want to bring everything from D2 into D3 as long as D3 can stand on its own two legs. But also, if they didn't do that, I'd be like, okay, I'm okay with that as well. You know, I'm, I'm pretty okay with whatever they, they are going to do or would do or are thinking of doing or don't do, you know, sure you answer this. What are your thoughts on full sunsetting content? I mean, ideally, like here's, here's what I've said in the past about it is that like, I don't like it, but I understand I understand, like, the decision-making behind it. I understand the philosophy behind it. But also, would I still like those things to exist? Sure. I absolutely would love if those things all came back or, you know, never left in the first place. Um, but I understand the reasoning behind it. I think something that I maybe underestimated the impact of at the time when like all of this was really happening is like I was so like focus on the people that are currently playing the game pilled because like population counts and, and player numbers were still like pretty good that I didn't I get I, I didn't give enough respect to how much that would affect the new player experience much further along I did not have the foresight uh of how much that would impact how many people would actually join the game. Yeah, no, I wouldn't call D3 as, as, as a sunsetting content, no. Um, but uh, I have absolutely matured since then, and I, and I do realize the impact now. But at the time, I was very like, bro, just like focus on the people who are still playing, man. Which, like, as you know, to be fair, they've done a, a pretty good job of, of doing that. My original question earlier is because I believe this whole thing is kind of cope and wanting to believe because this person did a good scoop on Into the Light. I know Cross and others believe that they will because Sony wants a return on investment and Destiny is the moneymaker. Well, I mean, that's. I mean, Bungie is going to continue making Destiny no matter what they make a Destiny 2, they drop the 2. Uh, we go to three, we skip three, we're just going straight to four. Um, it's very much, uh, uh, you know, in Bungie's plans to keep Destiny going because that's what's paying the bills right now. <laughs> they need Destiny around still to, like, pay people <laughs> who work at the company and, like, fund other things. <laughs> So it's in their best interest to keep Destiny rolling, keep it good, 
do whatever it takes to get people to the game in the first place. So that's why I like any time I've seen people continue to be like, do you think they're going to continue Destiny after Final Shape? I'm just like, bro, how many times do they got to say it? How many times do I got to say it? How many times do other creators need to say that it's still going? Also, like literally just think about it for like one second. You think they're just going to like shut down a, a thousand person company because they're just like, yeah, we're done. Like, come on, just literally think for, for 10 seconds. Be like, oh, actually, that makes a lot of sense. <laughs> you know? They've said it. I've said it. It's everywhere. Luke Smith came on literally, like, point blank right at the start to be like, we're still making Destiny after this. Like, how many times do we need to say it, man? <laughs> so... What if D3 is just a D2 rebrand where they drop last gen and update engine, etc.? I don't think that would be deserving of being called Destiny 3. I think that would be a very, very giant bait and a very not good idea. They would still call it Destiny 2 if that was all that they were going to do. I have no marathon thoughts because I still don't know what the F it is, really. I've not seen any gameplay. I've not heard of any gameplay. It's also not even my genre. So I, I got nothing on that. Literally nothing. You feel that Luke Smith thing was only on the stream? I don't think it's in the start of the published YouTube video. Could be wrong. Oh, okay. Do I bother with solo flawless dungeons and exotic missions anymore? Uh, dungeons? Yes. I do every single dungeon. Exotic missions? Eh, not as much. Just casually throwing in update engine is hilarious. It's tremendous undertaking. I've, I've, I'm done trying to like elaborate on that. Like, yeah, sure. Update the engine. Got it. Yeah. <laughs> you know. I think that comment from Luke is really what started it all. Yeah, I mean, people just, you know, taking what he said and spinning it how they want to spin it. Like, what he said could mean literally anything. Could mean literally anything. I wonder why D2 is having this problem with them always needing to say that they will continue up for Final Shape. Final Fantasy 14 WoW have ended. Or are ending long sagas, yet we know they're going to keep making content after. I would argue... It's probably not a great argument, but I would argue that, like, MMO players are a bit more dialed into that kind of stuff. Whereas Destiny players are not... as dialed in even though they are of of similar uh genre it's a lot of it's also probably like a lot of people's first time experience with like something of this scale like playing a game that goes for this long. Whereas if you're playing WoW, if you're playing Final Fantasy XIV, you're probably a bit more dialed into, like, the internet. Yeah, sorry. Let's get some effing gameplay rolling here.
Um, okay. Let me see if Toes is uh, farming. Dun, 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 dun. Current hunter fashion? Sure. Not my best work. Not the best thing I've ever done. My pacing back and forth is fun though. Yeah, whenever I, I I do like to have little chat moments. I'm sure I I know gameplay is not uh the I know tower gameplay is not the most thrilling, but sometimes I just need to like sit down and like actually be able to think instead of onslaught wave forty three um, my APM is is like a uh, freaking Maru out here, and someone's like, "What do you think about Destiny 3? And I'm just like, "Little busy, <laughs> read the room for a second. <laughs> so, anyway, let me see. We think Red Lobster filing for Chapter 11. Oh, really? I don't know. I Danielle loves Red Lobster. I'm not the biggest Red Lobster enjoyer, although their biscuits are... I will say, here's what I'm going to say about their biscuits, is we bought, like, the biscuit mix. And, man, that biscuit mix is literally so accurate to like the actual restaurant. Like it is so like one to one. I was blown away by it. I was like, oh my God, this is actually it. Otherwise, I'm not, I'm not devastated to hear that Red Lobster is filing for chapter 11. I didn't really frequent Red Lobster that much in my life. I've probably been less definitely less than a dozen times it wouldn't surprise me if it was half half a dozen times i'm taking a break from destiny today playing dark souls remastered hey thanks for keeping us updated junie <laughs> best of luck in the gameplay What fragments am I on? I'm on starvation, domineering, reprisal, and persistence. Do I, do I see when you add a stream marker in chat or no? I don't. Avada, do you need like a, like mod powers to do what you're doing or are you good? I just did it above my me message forever. No, I don't see it. I didn't see it. There's nothing there. Maybe there's some setting I can turn on. I don't know. Tell me. Yeah, here's what I'll say, though, about about Red Lobster uh, Chapter 11. It's kind of, it feels like a similar, like, Twinkie situation. Like, go out, buy those boxes of the Cheddar Bay biscuit mix. Just hoard that. That's going to 4X when, when they officially file. Yeah, Twinkies did end up coming back, so that might bite you in the ass. Don't go too hard. Don't go too hard. Or may maybe just make them yourself. Kind of do like a bake sale. 
like you're in the Girl Scouts and in, in uh, and you're nine years old. You just set up shop, do a little Cheddar Bay bake sale. Then you can make even more money. You could charge five bucks a biscuit if they officially close down. I think you'd probably have to reverse engineer the formula though. You'd have to figure out how to do it yourself. That might be tough. Yeah, not financial advice, by the way, strictly entertainment. <laughs> Dumbass, just use a 5 out of 6 Nox for infusion. You gotta lock that, man. You gotta keep that locked down. No, oh, I need headshot kills. No. Why? Every enemy has 40 trillion health. I'm dead. Do you know if the brave weapons will be able to change magazines and such during final shape? I'm not sure what the question is. I haven't gotten an shiny today. Not a single one. Answer no. Okay, chat's feeling confident about whatever that question was. No! F me, bro. Can you give us the exact asset splits of my investment portfolio? Percentage-wise, I, I actually could. I have actually those exact numbers. It's nothing remarkable. Just dump it all on S&P 500 and just let it run. Maybe a little overseas. Oh my God, I actually have anti-barrier, it's crazy. Oh my god, the random has it too. Yeah, S and P. Uh, I mean, past month S and P kind of, kind of down. I'm not gonna say bad, but like they're down. But we had a really hot start to the year, so it had to come back eventually, or you know, had to, it had to uh, retreat a little bit. Why Empire Hunt? Uh, cause we're just kind of chilling right now, doing a little bounty prep. Gonna see if I can get a couple more gamers for another Legend Onslaught run. Excuse me? Ah. Thoughts on Whisper? Been trying to use it on a few bosses and it's good, but the flinch is insane, Imo. Um, I know it's really good for Oryx. Like, people are one-cycling Oryx with it, so it's good, some, it's good on some... Uh... It's good on bosses, but yeah, you gotta pick your battles. Some dark strider. Sorry, striker. 
I need some rage in the chat. Whoa. Am I going to watch the Fallout show? Not only am I going to watch it, I watched the whole thing already. And it was enjoyable. Where did this guy go? Why am I integrating the foot cam? I'm sorry, I'm not investing in a camera specifically for my foot every uh, once, every, let's call it day for 10 seconds. It's not going to happen. I thought it was it. Right. Why Thresh on the Fabringer? Genuinely curious. Uh, this fa uh, this Fabringer is for my Celestial Nighthawk build, where you're just trying to juice your super as much as humanly possible. Uh, for this build, it was whatever I had equipped at the moment. <laughs> That's it. How long did the cringe-free stream last? Um, about 17 minutes is our record. Precision. Shoe cam? I mean, shoe cam is me just leaning out of the way. Get out of here. Yeah, we did die on wave two. So that was tough. <laughs> Boob scam. That's called my OnlyFans. Are there builds that kinetics actually work? Um, I mean, I use a kinetic for my Celestial Nighthawk. Um... Nope. Um. Strand Warlock uses Kinetic. I would say that they probably use, like, Osteo Shriga specifically. In some cases. Um, you can. It's just you do have to give up some pretty good stuff in order to make it work. I'm using Kinetic right now. Yeah, well, I'm in, I'm in a freaking Empire Hunt who gives a shit. Uh, activity. This isn't even real. I'm not even here right now. Mo, what are you doing, brother? Lucky pants with malfeasance. Yeah, but you're using malfeasance. This person's asking about, like, other non-malfeasance weapons. Uh, Chip Chappy, that is uh, true, but it is, uh, I, I feel like, unintended. I feel that it is unintended that you're able to... Um, I'll give it to you. That you're able to throw batteries at your upgrades and heal them. When's the green screen short stream? We'll probably do one in May. Uh, moon. We'll do one more in May. We'll do one more golf, uh, drunk golf stream in May. Uh, friend within two years of subbing thank you very much friend within welcome back two years big milestone we got the ads coming up in a moment here let's just run them down
I feel like the intention was more that it would consume the battery rather than just bounce off. Yeah, if, if the true intent was that the batteries could heal things, they wouldn't allow you to spam a single battery at literally everything and have it just bounce off. Like, that would... Oh, I already did this one. Um, like, it would either be consumed or it wouldn't even work. That's why I feel like... Like, that's a very weird way for Bungie to include that mechanic intentionally. And yes, they wouldn't let you heal the enemies either. <laughs> that is also true. Biggest troll of all time. You're trying to kill the Tormentor and your teammate keeps healing them. Yeah, so that's why it feels very unintended. So if at some point you're doing it and it just, like, it, it doesn't work anymore, you're like, okay, just think back to when I said this and... Uh, be like oh yeah he said it wasn't intended and it turns out it wasn't intended ew quick bounty check here let's see if uh see if we got some gamers and what else what was i just gonna check i was just gonna check something I don't know. I forget. Rip. I don't remember. Oh, no. I was going to go Destiny Recipes. Destiny Recipes. Under. Over, under on me graduating college. I'm taking the over, baby. Let's get there. Welcome back, ad viewers. You missed me staring at my other screen, forgetting what I wanted to do. So, uh, no worries. No worries on that. Okay, Warlock's done. I think Titan is done as well. I think I'm done with, like, all my, like, multi-week... Multi-week bounties, so I think we're just gonna hit up EDZ. As I look for some Legend 50 gamers. Or sorry, Cosmodrome. You want to play Balatro? I do want to play Balatro. I do. I do very much. Pop. Pop. T-Man. Nintendo 64 months of subbing. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you very, very much. Thank you. Thank you. Chad Legend, 11 months. Heat. Heat up five going into the fourth. Okay. see game details is it it's one and it's one and done right oh winner just gets the seed okay god who do i i don't know 76 is gonna be so scary let's soak in the heat box score Butler is having a tough game. So is Embiid, though. So that's probably why it's close. <laughs> You're not all already bounty prepping? Bro, We bounty prepping season just started. It started with this reset. Butler got hurt. Like, out of the game hurt? All right, I'm doing one public event, and then we have two gamers for uh, another Legend 50. So we're going to run it back. You going to play through Elden Ring DLC when it comes out? Absolutely. 
Hundred percent. Although I do know that it comes out at the end of June, and uh, we we may still be a little deep into Destiny World at that time. I kind of give after an expansion uh, one month to do all the Destiny things that I gotta do. Uh, so I don't know if we'll hit it first day. Just kind of depends. Just kind of depends on uh, what Bungie has cooked up. How much of uh, episode one we have access to. June 21st. Oh my god. It's like so. I thought it was like June 27th for some reason. That's even worse. Uh, realistically, what does bounty prep get me? It gets me through the artifact faster. So that way I can get all the upgrades and I can tell you guys, like, what the neat builds are. Yeah, June 4th is uh is final shape day. Is this world's first raid race my last? Um it look, if Bungie still keeps making raids, I'm going to still keep playing them. Um, what I don't know is if it's my team's last, like, together. Because I don't know of the team, like, who's going to keep playing Destiny, who is going to move on, who, you know, if someone wants to find a different team. Like, I don't know what really anybody on the team is planning yet. So, it could be the last one as our team. Uh, it could be literally just another raid and we keep it rolling. Uh, I don't know. It's not a discussion we've really had yet. We're really focused on just final shape for now. And then after the raid's over, we'll see how much people are still playing. And, uh, and kind of take it from there. That's it. That's all we can do. 101 months for Death Giver. Oh my god, damn. Welcome back, Death Giver, for 101. Big. Active hands in the field. Looks like another war set is the same. Big, big. Let's grab it before the hive gets to it. If you're looking for subs on your team, I wouldn't recommend me. Thank you for the recommendation. Yeah, and you know we've had we've had a really good run as a as a unit. You know, if the worst we ever did was like you know top a hundred, top two hundred, and like like one year, like we had the effing run of a lifetime, and also like one of the most consistent teams all time. Like no matter how final shape goes. How the raid goes like we cooked as as a team we cooked and we cooked for like a long time so good amount of pride in that yeah 2023 was not was not our year you know we had a we had a bad run we had a bad year but i don't think that defines us I think we have quite a good legacy behind us. Texas. Ah. Strats in. Okay. I'm going to finish this public event and then we hop in. What are you guys going to be playing? Because I don't mind switching off of uh, Hunter. Toasted Rav, I have been using it with a very large amount of success. Buried Bloodline in uh, Legend. You think they'll ever do, like, eSports Destiny? No. <laughs> Definitely not.
How long have you had the same raid race team since D1? Uh, we've had the same core four people since Last Wish. And then the same core six, I want to say... We have not missed a raid together since... Deepstone? Because I think Slayer was on our team for Crown of Sorrow. But four people have, on, have been on the team since Last Wish. Brother. Is Josh Hart going to hook me up with playoff tickets? I don't think Josh Hart even remembers that event. Nor do I think he even knows what Destiny is. Despite him and I being in the same room together. But granted, it was like six years ago. I have trouble remembering stuff from six weeks ago. Strata's in. You're both going to be banner? Perf. I'll stay on Hunter. Chad Legend, we got you 11 Hello. months, right? Uh, Vile Dip. I probably said that wrong. Thank you for a couple gifted. Enjoy the emblem. Day, Guardian. Two people from chat just walked me through my first warlords from this chat. Datto hug 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 datto. Thank you, Zephyr. Sixty three months. Did I eat today? I had my leftovers from last night. When we raided with Funhouse, they were talking about fried chicken, and I was like, I need to get fried chicken, and I got a pound of fried chicken from Azels, and I had the rest of it today. Pain leads to perfection, Guardian. Embrace it. Show me everything, Guardian. No limit. Do you have to do Warlord's Rune on Master get Buried Bloodline Drop? Nope, you can do it on Normie. Look at these shots. Spicy or Reg, just, uh, just Reg. Yeah, it was the Burks and Smalls Taco. The Burks is not chatted here. Y'all, at the Burks, say something. Say something in chat. Oh, you're already sub two. God damn it. I was gonna give both of you subs. That's very nice of you guys. And you got the exotic? Sheesh. Damn, you got it cooked. That's dope, man. Shout out both of y'all. Some Giga Chad shit right there. Again, uh, Vile Dep. Hopefully I'm saying that correctly. Uh, two gifted subs. Thank you for doing that. Enjoy your emblem. If you still need it. Hmm. 
boost the F. Oh, that's gonna be a meaty one. Yeah. Almost have my. Oh no. Does anyone have overload? Oh my god, we do. Alright, next wave, I got you. Which redeems have I done? Uh, we just did a stretch. What else do I owe? Oh god. Okay, I know I did the weighted squats. I did the drink water. We talked about that. Then we have five pet the brims. I know I've done two. So I owe Brim a lot of pets. We'll get lots of pets tonight. Is he in here? No. Oh, this guy is okay. Never mind. We got it. Um. Huh? <laughs> huh? <laughs> Hello? So the name of the cape that I use? I think I'm on uh, Taken King. Bro. Are shiny drops guaranteed? No. Sorry, the only shiny drops that are guaranteed are from the quest completion, but they're the um, they're not like the true shiny. They're just like the curated one that Bungie gives. They are not what we would call a true shiny. It's more like a like a starter shiny. Ooh, I'm kind of low on green. No. Yoink. Ooh, servitor wave. Hope you've been well less than three. Thank you, Luciano. I'm pretty well, pretty busy. I'm also cursed right now. I'm cursed to live a life of waking up at 7.30 a.m. no matter what time I go to sleep. the worst part of Groundhog Day that I'm living right now. I hate it. I hate it so much. I, I just, I can't. I can't sleep past 7.30. I try. I just sit there. I, sit, I lay there. Trying to go back to sleep, but I know that I'm just not going to. I, I'm just not. I don't wake up intentionally at 7.30. It's not It's not by choice. Works? It is Burks. Thank you very much for subbing and do, for doing a very nice thing. I don't want to get up at 7.30. Okay, I'm, I stay up a little bit later. I should let chicks have this. I stay up a little bit later, and every time I wake up at 7.30, just naturally, even with a blindfold on, to, like, block out the sunlight. It's like my body still knows. What's even crazier is that there was a time where I was waking up at 6.30, and then after Daylight Savings, it switched to 7.30. It's like my body didn't even adjust. So I'll go to bed at like 3, no matter what. I'm waking up 7.30, like, awake. 
It's not even like a hazy, like, oh, man. Let me just... No, I just, I, I open my eyes and I'm like, this is it. I'm not going back to sleep. So now we've been trying to go to bed a little bit earlier. You know? we are going to bed at like, uh, we get in bed at like, probably 11. Be asleep hopefully by midnight. So that way, when I do inevitably wake up at 7.30, at least I slept a lot. I don't have my super. Now I do. Ela, Ela, Ela? I think it's Ela. Gifting a sub as well. Thank you very much for doing that. I asked you earlier if you uh, had a name pronunciation uh, uh, guide for me, and I don't. You might have answered. It's very possible that you answered, and I just didn't see it. That's why I've seen you in Lep's chat in the morning more often. Yep. Hypothetically, I don't have a quiver yet. So I'm gonna try to farm one. Another, I'm gonna get orbs. I'm gonna get these orbs. Kind of orbed up. Should I drop that there? Okay, this this didn't even this didn't even proc. Didn't even proc. Let him out. Let him out. No. That's actually my fault. It was I I didn't realize it was dregs until like way too late. And somehow I still have half my super back. Kick your ass. Yo, Manny, what the F? You're just getting it, okay? But I like, it's just, I wanna sleep. I wanna sleep, bro. I'm so tired. Smalls Taco, thank you very much for uh, gifting a sub to Jay. And uh, Manny with 10 gifted, why? Thank you, but why? He's got G horn, huh? I'm gonna throw on this hothead because that is what's in my inventory. Curse of Rye, your boss wave will now be a heat wave, and your shiny will be a recluse. Curse of Rye, your wife will be wave 30. Curse of Rock. I barely understood what he said. I'm gonna need to. Okay. I'm gonna need to read that one manually. I really don't know why I'm getting this, like it's basically dead, but... Nope. Alright, well, there goes all my ammo. <laughs> oh, God. That is a dead one. That is the boss. That is dead. Bro, 
all, they're all suspended. Six is the best I've ever done on this. Tell Danielle you got the code so she can knock you out due to jealousy. Do you get do you get good sleep if you get knocked unconscious? Demo Harmony, I have this exact role. You get brain damage, true. The payoff, not as good. Uh, where's this roll, where's this roll? Nope. Where's this roll? Demo, oh yeah, no, no matter what. We're getting rid of this, unless that's hard launch. No. No, your brain gets all messed up. All right, good to know. I will not get knocked out. Well, I mean, I'm gonna try to. I don't really feel like it's in my complete control, but, you know, most of the time it is. Grim two months. Takes a minute to get used to different sleep cycles. I get up at 5.30 for work every day, but don't sleep past 8 on off days. Like, it, it feels like I can only... I can only sleep after I get up like super early in the morning like that, if I literally just do something for an hour to an hour and a half and then go back to sleep. And then that's how I can sleep. That's it. That's the only thing that has worked for me. Damn, there were not as many enemies as in, the, in that wave as I thought, which is a bit unfortunate. Don't have a ton of ammo, which is also a bit unfortunate. Uh, we can still use it. Kaboom! Splew. CBS through it, and then run. Oh, I was like, what do we shoot? I just see shacks. Oh my god. I'm still not over. Jack, 500 bits. Curse of Raw, your boss will not be Heat Wave and your Shiny will be a Recluse. Oh, that's with the, all the sim. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, I remember that meme. I remember, I remember. What would you say, in your opinion, is a good light level for Legend? I feel like my opinion is that if you have to ask what level you need to be for Legend, you should be as high of a level as possible. It's kind of like a ZJ. 
like a, if you have to ask situation. No, I hit him in the back. <laughs> Man, it is... It's so crazy how free... Onslaught is with an Orpheus Hunter. Like, it, ha it, like, it has to be, like, the most dominant build... In... All of Onslaught. By, like, insane margins. I already have another. It's just so free, bro. <laughs> yeah, and with no artifact mods for Void. Literally none artifacts. It's just so free, man. A little Buried Bloodline. Providing some debuffs everywhere you go, just in case you don't have the tether. Put on a boss target. Got an anti-barrier. Like... Like, what else do you even need? The well is just icing on the cake. You could do Graviton Lance. That's fun, too. I've just been rocking the Buried Bloodline for, uh, for the Anti-Barrier. And also because it's just really good. <laughs> that, too. Got easily, uh, easily delivered sparks here as well. Well, how do you do? Thunk. Yeah, any or any sort of void, good void exotic, you're you're gonna pop. Collective obligation might be pretty fun too. It's been a minute since I've used collective. But, damn, it's just so free. I haven't used aggers yet. I do want to try some aggers out. Sunshot's also pretty free, yeah. Uh, Ready, Seti Spaghetti. Thank you very much for four months of subbing. Probably should have put that a little bit further out. Whoa, where'd you come from? I should have put that one a little bit further out. Jesus. Okay. Deterministic chaos left to die. It's just a void machine gun. That's really all it is. It's gotta it's gotta cook a bit harder. You can't, you can't give me, you can't give me commemoration and hammerhead with like the god perks and then be like, why is no one using, having a deterministic chaos? You know what I mean? Send help. Sky bombers. Oh boy. Easiest wave nineteen in history. Bungie will disable prismatic in PvP at first or no? No. 
I mean, unless they find something that's like really, really busted. Yeah, even corrective measure is still really good. Guardian down. <laughs> I will switch to rocket again. Wow, they only give you seven. <laughs> the economy is just so screwed, bro. Any thoughts on anything to do with the lore? I don't think you could have opened a more, or you, you couldn't have asked a more open-ended question. Holy cook. Sixers are going to get it done, barring a heat miracle. Okay. Bro, still not a single shiny to delete desperate measures. Auto loading one for all. I don't know if I would really. It's like one for all you want to. Like, I would rather have demo. Yeah, not auto loading one for all. That, that doesn't fly. That does not fly with me. What do you think the best recluse rolls are? I mean, you're basically hoping for the equivalent of a uh, of a funnel web or like a slightly better funnel web. You know, there's not there's not that much to get excited about. What, what am I... I'll tell you what I'm looking for. What am I even looking for? Subsistence? Desperate measures? Master... No, frenzy. Sub-frenzy. Literally just sub-frenzy. Which is like, I already have that. It's called Funnel Web. Kind of done with the sub frenzy. What do we got? Ooh, this is a primo wave for this. Cook, 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 cook them up. Just get an anti barrier through my effing teammates. Oh, big slam. I was I was about to pop another quiv just to flex on him, but we only have like three enemies left in this wave. the same on dregs as I miss every single shot known to man oh that might have been the worst magazine of all time
Is it? It's crazy too. If you want to be a stat nerd, funnel web beats her clues still. I don't. I don't put a ton of investment into into too many stats in PVE. Just because in the middle of gameplay, it just it hardly matters, man. The difference between 51 and 56 stability versus 47 handling and 52 handling. Like, you have to be the, the biggest stats nerd in the world <coughs> to care about that stuff. In PvE, anyway. PvPers, I get it. Because those details matter so much more. But that's why I've, like, never enjoyed doing weapon reviews. Because, like, good luck getting me to to get you to give a shit about, like, six more stability on a freaking hand cannon in Legend Onslaught. I can't kill them all! the captain support them to the pyramid you kill them all that extra six stability yeah, no, PvPers, like, go nuts with the stats. Like, I, I know that that stuff can actually matter, but in PvE, it just doesn't. Range matters, like, a little bit. But for the average player, for the average activity, it don't matter. It just really don't matter. Little bastards are just giant ammo sinks. Have you done, as part of a Destiny gameplay, a gun sound and have them guess what gun it is? Um, I haven't yet. Dot, dot, dot. Thinking of trying to solo, I wouldn't mind giving it like one try, you know, or not, maybe not like literally one try, but like a few attempts of trying just for fun. No, Megalodon Hunter, I'm just look, you, you gave me a thread and I'm just like, I'm going to pull this motherfucker right here. <laughs> I'm trying to fill time, man. Chat gives me an interesting thread to pull on. I'm going to take it. We only got so many things to uh, to possibly discuss in this game. So I'll take whatever you're selling. Yoink. Hit a dying. Hit a dying enemy. Have I ever considered voice acting? Not really. 
Not that I wouldn't be interested, I just don't think I'd be very good at it. And also, it's so competitive already. If someone asked me to do voice acting, I would I would do it. I've just never been asked. Yoink. What wave are we on? Oh, demos. Oh, Jesus. Okay. Where are they at? Okay. Gotta quiver this side because we have sniper shanks and I am not effing around with those guys. Trying to get a couple kills. Oh, I forgot that Strand Titan just absolutely torches the demolishers. That was something that I meant to include in my video that I just totally blanked on is how much Strand Titans just absolutely cook the demos. Seventy sixers win. Ooh. Ooh. Okay. Execute all targets and make sure you're still standing when the dust. Sets. Okay. Okay. Optimal setup as well. Tether banner of war. I mean, it's a very balanced setup. I think you will get some arguments from people who are like, "No, this is way better than Strand Titan." But like, if you have the well and you have the tether, your third can be literally whatever you want it's gun of the year 2023 was quicksilver that was my gun of the year that one was a little far back i'm not gonna lie Oof. Zooming. Well is gonna expire right now. Is that close enough for that? No. Let's get the bower here. Let's get a debuff. Now my body. That'll do. Um, ape ship. I I appreciate the offer. That's a, a bit out of the the bounds that I was uh that I was thinking. That sounds like. Something that needs a bit more uh, acting capabilities, of which I have zero. Auto loading recombination. Now we're kind of cooking. Okay, I'm interested in that. I'm interested. I'm interested. Why does your editor put so much of your face in your thumbnails now? First of all, that editor is me. I still make all my own thumbnails. Second of all, it's just kind of the kind of the meta. It's kind of the YouTube meta. You know, start cramming your face in there. I, I've been getting a lot of comments uh, and uh, positive comments lately about like the meme thumbnails and, and all that kind of stuff. I've had to get a little more creative. Um, but that's just kind of the YouTube meta. I'm trying to embrace it a bit more. Need to pay your editor more. Don't worry, I'm already working on that. We gave the mods a raise. I'm working on uh, everything else as well. I shouldn't be using Tether.
Y'all got any more um enemies? Oh god, what a time to not have Quiv. Give it to me. Sorry. Give me the curated Chinese at all. If I don't have anything better, I do. Um, like I kept the uh, I kept the recluse one just kind of as a, like a baseline. Um, so I keep them until I get a better shiny, and then I will uh, get rid of it. Ads usually come from over here. On the shielded demo waves. Wow, my tether already ran out. This drags though, so that explains it. Hey, hey chatter. Always loving all the content. Hey, thanks very much. Sorry, I, just, I just had to dial in for a second. JCM, 33 months. Thank you very, very much. Thanks for the kind words. Thank you. Did you ever give away those Balatro keys? That's a good question. I will check. Here's, here's my fear is that I did give them away and we try to give them away and it's bait. So I will look. What are you going for? I want auto loading spike nade recombination. Imagine this as spike. Oh my God. To be fair, it's like a pretty good odds. So that one, that's cool. You know, I have a bunch of rolls that I'm gonna try out. And that is definitely one of the rolls. Not too bothered about like masterwork and uh, the first column perks. Yeah, we have a Harmony one. We have a Harmony one. Yoink. Oh my god, just threaded the needle there. I'm kind of low on green though. Low on everything. I can't really use too much ammo on this guy. I'm our anti barrier. Alright, we're good. That'll do. Would you recommend special ammo finder choose through primary or th choose through ammo pretty quickly? Do I have, what do I have? I might have, I have heavy ammo finder. I don't even have, I have none finders, no scav. I have nothing. 
and I only really run into ammo problems when I'm just going completely brain dead, not paying attention. Um, but if you did want to run with one, I mean, you're only going to help yourself, right? And you could probably run double special. Which, like, is probably better than what I'm doing running this Fate Bringer. The Fate Bringer, I kind of just run for, like, cleaning up dinkier enemies and uh, trying to top off my super. But if you wanted to run with, with special ammo stuff, go for it. Best advice for the Tormentor past level 40. He always destroys our ADU. So my best advice would be make sure you have at minimum one Shax somewhere on the board. Oh my. <laughs> have at least one Shax on the board. That's the tier three decoy. As soon as you hit wave 41. Like that's when you should be spending all of your money. Um, then if you get aggro, drag him over to a decoy. Like you should be running away from your ADU whenever you get a tormentor, drag it away. It will follow you. It will latch onto a decoy. Unlike demos, which tend to not, they just kind of do their own thing. Um, they will not be influenced. You kite it over. And you don't break shoulders until you are ready to commit to killing the Tormentor. That's when you break shoulders. Because I know, like, the purple disc in the air is super annoying. You can shoot it to make it a little less accurate. That was a fat finger. Don't look at that. Um. Oh, my God. But whoever gets aggro, you should be dragging that dude away. What was I saying before I literally just had the worst super of all time? Um, oh my god. What was I saying? Drag it away. Decoy. I just flavoned so hard. Drag him to his shacks. Yeah. I was in the middle of something else. Yeah. Oh, breaking the shoulders. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So don't... Don't break shoulders until you're ready to commit because the, the purple whirly disc, I know is super annoying, but you can at least hide from it. You can get cover and you can also shoot it. And the biggest problem with the Tormentor... is that he can suppress you, he can run you down, he gets super aggro when he has no more shoulder pads. So you want to keep him in a not giga aggroed state until you're ready to commit. Because he will just destroy you. The one saboteur. So yeah, kite. Tight and know when you're ready to commit. Because there's a lot of people who will just like, they'll see it spawn in, be like, shoot the shoulders, shoot the shoulders. And then they realize, like, oh, wait, we actually don't have enough to deal with this guy right now. And then other ads are showing up. The other ads will cook the ADU so unbelievably fast, it'll blow your mind. So get the Tormentor away from the ADU, get it distracted, take care of the other ads first if you can help it. Unless you're in a position to just absolutely bake the Tormentor immediately. Which usually requires, like, pretty good positioning. Like, a div really helps as well.
almost gone. So I didn't want to rocket myself and I wasn't sure if he was going to move yet. Give us some support. Some blinding support. Noise! That was a cook. Love that. Love that. No shinies today, man. Tough. Tough, tough, tough. All right, I think we have one more set, one more cycle. I saw another question on demos. Um, focus fire really, really helps. You, you need, first of all, if you have a strand titan, like strand titans absolutely destroy them strand titans destroy demos if you don't have one you just need to literally dump everything what you really need are our upgrades i feel like having maxed out upgrades in later sets what we're doing right now is huge because the turrets do some serious work If you can get a Shax, cool. Shax usually doesn't do a whole hell of a lot, in my opinion, against the demos. They just don't care. And, I mean, usually there's not one by the ADU anyway. Like, the, the demos are going to spawn literally right here and right here. And there's just, like, there's no Shax. Like, Shax is over there. So that stuff, you just got to beast mode it. If you, if you know you haven't seen demos in a while and you think you're going to get them, if you got a Titan, switch to Strand with like a one-two punch shoddy, get that, get that ready to go on the hot swap. And then otherwise, you just have to throw everything you have at it. And I find that usually if you're running a, a pretty competent setup, it shouldn't be too bad. I think the main issue tends to be like, you get caught with your pants down. You don't have a super. Um, you know, like you don't. You didn't have a well. You didn't have this. You didn't have that. Um, or you're running like a like a maybe like a weirder composition that doesn't have the stuff that you're typically used to having, and then you can run into problems there. But something that you can get are upgrades. Responsible spending. Using your money wisely. Sky Bomber's easy one. Grabbing ammo. Say less. I needs it. But where are they actually coming from? It's just dregs. I don't even think we need to care. another turret here yeah like look at all these turrets I mean we're not gonna get demos but like one two three four exotic turrets these exotic turrets go hard they go hard bro so yeah demos stage 30 stage 40 Having solid upgrades really helps. 
And also just mentally keeping track. Keep track of what things you've seen. Because if you haven't seen it for like 20, 25 waves, the odds are likely. And the worst thing that you can do is prepare for a thing that doesn't happen. Like, oh no. And then you get something way, way easier and you can just relax. Yeah, dude, I was I was watching someone and uh, there was a turret that was shooting something at a different point, completely different point. And it was almost able to fully outright kill a brig on its own, on like a mine. Toes knows what I'm talking about. <laughs> and then after that, nothing bad happened at all, and the rest of it was uh, totally fine, and everyone lived happily ever after the end. <laughs> I like the changes coming to Onslaught. It's a good start. I don't know if it's going to be enough to get people off of doing the 10 wave clears. Um, I, don't, I honestly don't think anything will unless they just dump obscene amounts of loot on people, but it's a good start. What changes? They're they're trying to give more loot to like full clears. They're trying to incentivize doing all 50 waves as opposed to just, you know, doing 10 and then bailing. But people are still gonna do that anyway. But hey, you know what? Free loot for someone like me. Okay. Because I like doing full 50s because they're fun. And I'm not gonna bore the shit out of people with running 10 waves and then resetting. There are literally no stakes at all, no entertainment value, just pure degenerate grinding. And that's it. Oh my God, I don't know if we're here yet. How many shines have I gotten today? Zero. I've gotten none today. I hope it secretly works on like a knockout system. You know, after every drop, your chance to get a shiny keeps increasing, but it starts at just like an obscenely low percentage and then it resets. Oh, I guess I buy something. We have 49 tormentor. I don't know if we, I don't know if we get one. 6,000 scrap. No. Oh. All right, missed my chance. Oh, get me away. <laughs> Foghorn sound an ass shank. <laughs> Damn, only 75% on that. Okay, well, I'm gonna save it for the penultimate wave. Because this is not gonna be a big deal. Where did I get that gun from? Nah, you're a first time message. I'm not gonna be mean. Uh, or I'm not gonna be toxic. I got it from Warlord's Ruin. I'm assuming you're talking about the sidearm. It'd be weird if you were talking about like, yeah, where'd you get that hand cannon from? That seemingly regular looking hand cannon not doing anything remotely special. Urgh. 
I think it's mine. Yeah, I was gonna say it was mine. I was gonna say it. Oh, is this a, yeah, I'm not effing around with those. God, Strand Titan can just cook so hard. Excuse me. I just, I just wanted to see that one from my own eyes. Give me the battery. I don't know if that makes it. Didn't. Nice face. Prepare for the boss wave. that one I don't know maybe as a uh, just hold on to that for a sec it's not good trust me right, fair. no big tormentor we got it earlier we got it in like our uh, 31 to 40 range I grinded hard for that launch or that roll on. All right, fine. Goodbye. How many tormentors do you get per clear? You get one or two because there's there's six different augments and only ten times that they show up. So two of them will only appear once. It's a matter of which ones. This individual seems to be upset about it. Mm, I don't know if I'm gonna, yeah, I'm gonna get out. Made some progress though. Oh, hello. I wanna do a little, yo, don't shoot me. Got it. Where's the... Oh. No. Ow. Alright, bye. the debuff go turrets go cool Uh, probably one of the fastest uh, legend clears that I've done. Just over an hour. Threat detector, master of arms. Heal clip under over. Ooh. I'm good on the threat detector, master of arms. Two mountain tops. Third mountain top. What do we got? Demo one for all. Demo Vorpal. Demo Vorpal might be some like, I don't know, some some boss slaying stuff. Demo one for all. I think I have demo one for all. Wonderful demo. 
I have Demo Frenzy. I have Ambitious One for All. Demo One for All I'll drag over here. Just to hold on to. And then... Man, no shinies, bro. I already have Demo Frenzy. Also, again, I cannot emphasize enough how much Bungie needs to change the cards in Legend Onslaught to the higher tier cards. All of these are worth one point. Bro, I didn't even make the most amount of orbs. That's how much the team was popping. I haven't drank any water in a moment. Wonderful day, Guardian. Nice. Okay, we're going to take a short, short little breather from that, and we'll hop in another one. Gotta get a shiny, man. We gotta end the day with at least, with without a shiny, bro. We need and shiny. Uh, Royal with the 22. Ruby of the Sea with 20. Thank you both very much for the 20s there. Thank you. We got uh, uh, Dim Dimladir with the 9 months. Thank you very much for the 9 months. And Hoochie Man with the 2 months. Got Edge Transit first clear. And the Bait and Switch Mountain Top with Ambitious Frenzy first run. Neither shiny, so we head back. Best of luck. I need to get a shiny. I need a shiny. One shiny. At least one. Alright, a lot of redemptions coming in. Let's do those. Did they do squats earlier? Uh, they are not on the list, so... Yes, I did. Drink water. Then we have a fashion redemption. Link prepared. Love that. Good. Please. Is this the, the biggest this picture goes? All right. what do you mean you can't Fashion Redemption from Ratboy W. Wanted an opulent, void look, kind of desert raider slash still suit vibes too. Okay. Well, Grand Luster and other uh, shaders of its kind, a lot of callous themed shaders from the early days, Leviathan um, is, a, is a shader type I've seen quite a lot of um so it's one that i don't typically use a whole lot of nowadays um kind of desert raider still suit vibes too well i mean the your your helmet nails that look we have on i'm i believe that's jur falcon um so i mean not a whole lot you can do with that but i think it it, it looks good <laughs> Um, deep explorer strides for the legs. A little, little robotic, little robotic, uh, for the look IMO. Um, I would definitely maybe go along more of the lines of this, this sort of rounded look that you have going on with like the face mask and even like the circle, literally dead center of your chest piece, the rounded shoulders. I don't know if I would go as blocky, but maybe it does bring the look together. Maybe there's too much roundedness in uh, in the look, and you need to, like, change it up a little bit. 
Um, so I would just want to see what that looks like. And then also, I would just love to see some different shaders too. Not not that there's anything wrong with this. It's just one that I've I've seen quite a lot. But yeah, I mean, you also had uh, a very specific look that you were going for, and uh, I think you got it. If you wanted to go regal with, it. I think you could go even more regal with like the purples and the golds and all that kind of stuff. Because there's a lot of shaders that do that very heavily. So depends on how regal you want it to go. Man, I'm so tired. I wish I <laughs> I'm so sad. I wish I could die. <laughs> Man, this shit always happened to me, bro. Man, I'm so hungry right now. I could go for some food. <laughs> Man, it would be really cool if somebody got me a code 82. All right, that one I can't help you with. Do you want food? <laughs> um, no, I can, I can live. I know you can live, but can you thrive? Uh, yeah. Yeah, I can. What, ha what has happened with Jez? Haven't seen him in a while. Uh, nothing. My guy, he literally streamed for two days in a row, which he hasn't done in like five years. Yeah, so he has been active. This is the most he's ever been active. Yeah, he is the one that has been active. Uh, it appears have that you, you are the one that is not active. Have you even gone looking? So really, the question is, what has happened with you? Jez died, IRL. I am so sad. <laughs> All right, that's my bad. I thought that both of them said GGs, and I thought I took that as we're we're done. I got kicked because Hall kicks in five seconds. Yeah, it does. All right, I will. I I feel bad. I will run one. I just told Sneak that I'd run. I took the I took the GGs as we're done. So that's my bad. All right, we got to do some redemptions here. Where's Brim? No, I don't know. He's in my office. All right, I'm gonna I'm gonna send back the the Brim pets and uh, and we'll get those we'll get those covered. Otherwise, I gotta do five push-ups. I gotta do five weighted squats and I gotta stretch. Workout time. Let's get it. I have done two workouts today. I shall not get it. I have already gotten it. Well, what about a stretch? You can stretch. Alright, let's stretch out what we're gonna be doing. Ooh, I'm blacking out and we're falling down to the ground as blood rushes back up to our head. We feel ourselves regaining consciousness and back up. Very good. Very good. Five-weighted squats. I'm gonna juice them. We're gonna go 22 and a half. Oh, I didn't turn this one properly. I was like, damn, that's really heavy. How can they fucking see anything in here? God damn. What? It's so dark. They just believe that, look, the camera does good, okay? No, don't turn that one on. Then I get backlit. Uh. <laughs> then I get backlit, okay? You want to hit F9 for me on the keyboard? Do I? That is way too... People are going to see what I do for a living. What's F9? F9 on the keyboard, fun function 9. Oh. Okay. Wonderful One. day, Guardian. Two. Remember to squeeze your butt and kind of yep. almost thrust I, out. I, I am squeezing. Very good. Oh, four. Oh, 
Activate five. Activate your abs too. Your abs. Oh, they're active. So you gotta. <sighs> Every day is dark. <sighs> I give you a bonus one. And now we gotta do five push ups. Watch this. That I will not do with you. All right. Everything. My personal redeemed. trainer. No, I just work out a lot. Wow, that sun is hitting me yeah, right in the okay. face. I regret. I regret. <laughs> that is that is a bit much. There we go. The Manscaped boxers. These are not Manscaped. I am not wearing them. The others are dirty. I've achieved peak destiny fashion. How would I go about showing you? Uh, you save up channel points. You save up channel points and when you do a fashion redemption or you catch me when I do a fashion show, which we are going to do one in May. Because the moment I start, the moment I open the floodgates for like, oh, look at my fashion, look at my fashion. That's all that is. That's all the stream turns into for three hours hey, Brim. ordered order neon be gone I thank him. do i steam sign i've not been asked that in a very long time what does that mean sign someone's steam profile i fear the same thing would happen with that as well May we see dog? <laughs> Big gun. Dust brim. He needs a spotlight. You need a brim light. Dun 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 dun. Um, okay. What is Sneak running? He is on Jur Falcon Hunter. Interesting. Like my cats? Interesting. My cats are my cats. <laughs> Dinks! Um... Here's the thing. I do. I wouldn't mind going back to like Warlock for a run. Why are you doing legend content? You're gonna start on something else. <laughs> All right, I'll I'll do Quiv again. It's been a while since I played a hunter. How do I hit hide my in-game chat like this? I have it hot keyed to T. All of you tank shadows, 22 months of subbing. Almost a two years. Thank you very, very much. What's the triumph for this ship? Pre-order final shape. Arguably the easiest and yet most difficult triumph mm -hmm. to achieve. All right, ad break starting right now, which is good because we're literally just sitting here doing nothing. So let's hit that, and then by the time it's over, hopefully we're in another round. Join on sneak. Nothing. Okay. Let me check my... Yeah. Yep, nothing. <laughs> sorry, buddy. Sorry, sorry, buddy. Thanks. I'm 
not the main character. <laughs> and you never have been. Somebody else is. I hate that. It's Ryan Haley. <laughs> I hate them. What's up, Cello? How we doing? Uh. I feel lousy. Well, Danielle, why don't you play some Destiny 2? It'll make you feel great. Three, two, one. <laughs> you didn't laugh. You're supposed to laugh with me. That was the joke. Too sad to laugh. I've heard of this great streamer. Her name's Travel Danielle. You should watch her. <laughs> She's sad. <laughs> no, you're supposed to say, but I am Travel Danielle. Oh. <laughs> I'm, I'm, I'm too sad to brain Come compute. Come on, man. Brain no compute when sad. Welcome back, ad watchers. You missed me literally just sitting here. Because I thought Sneak was ready to go. <laughs> So pretty thrilling stuff right now. Danielle's sad because she didn't get into the Hades 2 technical test yet. I really wanted to stream it tonight. She really wanted to stream it tonight? And instead, instead I'm going to have to stream Destiny. And instead she's going to have to play Destiny? That's fair. I can pet the brim until we're ready to go. Devastated. Can you see him? That is devastating. Um, yeah, you can kind of see him. Oh my goodness. Look at this baby. Oh. Oh, dang. Friend. Quick dog anatomy. Oh, someone needs to know the parts of the dog. Oh, okay, here we go. So this is this, this is the chomp, and this is the sniffer. Okay, and then down here we have the beans. Can you zoom in on this thing? This is the big bean. You can, but like you're probably not gonna be able to see too much. This right here, this is the big bean. Cello, it's my favorite game of all time. And it's think, 10 out of 10. I think that's everything. On every single yeah. spectrum, it's 10 out of 10. The floppers. I just, I'm wondering, I'm sad because it's like past, way past business hours, so I'm sure that they're not even. That... Ooh, this little crown. Oh, little crown. So it probably won't come until tomorrow now. And this liquid bubble. Mr. Turf constantly looks like a dad on Christmas morning. It is a vibe that he puts out. Blame Summit for infecting my brain with the concept of wearing pajama pants on stream. Who? Summit. Mm -hmm. ah. 
Uh, Vigil, thank you very much for 21 months of subbing. Itchy face, Brim. Itch in your face. Itchy head. <sighs> Did you guys hear that? We're double Orpheus. All right, hang on. I thought I thought if he was on a different hunter build then I'd say okay, but two Orpheus is just like redundant. Like you don't need that much. Oh good Jerry Falcon. Okay, fine. comes every time Brim you never you never oh, want to Jesus old Christ God. Brim you never want to Get do up. that with me buddy only when Danielle's not home God. look at this chomper got, the chomp got a bigger lap than you phony ass oh thank you oh thank you so much I'm, why am I lead? Ah. I joined on sneak. I guess he rejoined, didn't he? Yeah, you rejoined. That's my bad. That's my bad. Look at, look at Tubbs here. Tubbs McKenzie, Deputy Director, how are you? Look at this little frown, though. It's right here, just a little frown. Just a little Hello. frown. Little frown. That's all I, all I want to do all day. Is just I want to hold Brim's little chomper in my hand just like this. And then sometimes... Kiss. Oh, thank you. Just I'll hold it. Just hold it up. I'll hold it up the whole time. I don't care. The chomp. You gotta hold it down like an alligator. Chomp. Sheep. Okay, I gotta let go, buddy. You want off now? What is happening? <laughs> nice. Okay. Sorry. I just I I've done Midtown like three or four times in a row. I just need to change the scenery. those connections wonderful day guardian wonderful day guardian Yeah, it's one of those three. All right, give me one sec before we start here.
it's time to game. Sorry, yeah, that was that was pretty diva. I had, I had a pretty diva moment right there. Doing, doing. Ah, uh, the silhouette and Naminius, both with a couple gifted. Thank you very much. Enjoy your uh, pulsar. Approaching, impending. It's showing up. I don't know. I forget the name. Emblem. Thank you very much for doing that. Oh, yeah. I guess I could have gone Strand, Strand Hunter, too. Approaching. Mm. Approaching. No, there's not a new emblem. Trust me, you... Again, you would know... I've made this joke already, so I'm not going to do it again. But you would know the moment that there was a new emblem because 80% of every Destiny streamer's screen would just be information on how to get the new emblem. So you'll know. You don't have to worry about that. Yeah, there's be exclamation point emblem, exclamation point gifted subs, exclamation point how do drops work? Exclamation point connections. I don't know what else. But point is, you'd know. <laughs> also, a lot of people would be coming back to Destiny. Yeah. What? What? Hello? Oh, we needed those batteries, man. What the F? No, Bungie doesn't get a cut of the subs. That would be... That would be a little wild. Wow, that guy's dead. Wow, that guy's also dead. Who are you? Okay. Thing scrap millionaires. Millionaires. Um, we also have Dr. Willis, 25, and Carvotic with the uh with the 30 or sorry, Carvotic 25, Dr. Willis 35. I know how to talk. When's the God Roll video coming out? What if I told you it already came out like multiple weeks ago? How would you react to this information? Not my finest tether, but also the, the Fallen, not their finest set of enemies spawned in. Checking, checking, checking. There's nothing going on. Dork Knight with 10 gifted? What the F? Five emblems. Call myself a fake fan, frown. It's all right. It's easy to miss in this new YouTube algorithm world. You know, sometimes you miss one video and just is like, oh, YouTube, YouTube's like, oh, you, you clearly don't like this person anymore. We're just gonna unsubscribe you. Uh, make sure that their channel never appears in your feed ever again. Like we got, we took the hint, we got it. We got it. It's fine. We're picking up what you're putting down.
Oh, someone asked if I got the military blues. I got them on the shock drop. They're on the shelf. They're hard to see right now, but they're on the shelf. Have I been practicing it all for Pantheon? Pantheon is gonna be the practice. You feel me? I ain't too worried about Pantheon. Pantheon's gonna be our practice. Pantheon ain't gonna be nothing but a thing. I'm ready. How's the quality on the blue? Some people had issues with QC. Yeah, but when I, I feel like that also applies to literally every single shoe that Nike can send out. <laughs> Uh, I mean, I looked mine over and they looked fine, but I didn't give them, like, the deepest review of all time. Did I go to college? I sure did. I sure did. And I got a degree in who gives a shit. Oh. Welcome back. Whoa, excuse me. Right. That was a bit aggressive for one guy at like four health, but you know, you do you live your life. Do you think desperate measures will work in endgame content like the day one raid or more for general gameplay? I initially read that question as like, do you think they're going to disable it? And I was like, what do you know that I don't? Because like, I don't, I don't see why they would. Um, I suspect, I mean, I haven't really used it too in depth. That's probably didn't need to do that, but. Um, but like, it's a damage perk. So it'll probably be fine. And in encounters where there's not really a boss, and even where there is a boss, like you can have it on a you can have it on a on a primary weapon. Okay. Well this hurts. Like off the top of my, off the top of my head, if I saw you running with desperate measures in a raid, I, I really wouldn't think twice about it. That is a level of overthink. Uh, that gets you right into math class rating. I'm not gonna lie. I wouldn't worry about it too much. It's on the big money savings SB drop this morning. 
So I got the classic green Dunk Lois piece as a treat. I didn't even know there was a drop this morning. To be fair, I'm also not really that in tune with a lot of Nike drops anymore because I've cut back dramatically on the amount of shoe purchasing I have done. That'll do. Um, thank you very much again, Dork Knight. Very generous. Very, very generous of you. Thank you very, very much for the 10 gifted. here. Nice. I think Hammerhead will be relevant. We have quite a few good Void MGs ATM. Um, I do think it'll be relevant because I don't think everyone has bothered to go farm a crafted commemoration. So for those people, I, I think it'll be obscenely relevant. So that, that's going to be a weapon for, like, people who haven't been playing for, like, the past year or two to go get. I'll go, I'll go uh, thirds on a deke right there. Um, but if you already have, like, a god tier, you know, crafted commemoration level 17,000 million... Do I think you're going to get a massive upgrade with Hammerhead? No. You might get something else that you maybe like a little bit better. But in terms of how strong it is, I couldn't really tell you how much better uh, it's going to be. Relearning D2, why, why do you prefer Stylish Executioner over Trapper's Ambush? Just preference. Or is one mechanically better? Well, they, they, two, they do two very different things. And I just don't think you need two uh, things to make you go invisible. If I if I know my Void Hunter correctly, which I I hope I do. Um, but I use the Dodge Invis, even though I know it's like not the greatest, uh, because I don't have like the. Uh, I don't have the muscle memory to do, like, Trapper's Ambush and stuff like that. And also, I just don't really think I needed a ton. Yoink. Wow, that guy's dead. Wow, you're literally dead. Wow, you're so dead. Like, superhero dead. Like, mega dead. Are only in uh, shiny weapons enhanceable in Final Shape? No. Oh, look who had the foresight to buy a freaking decoy. Yeah, I'm hearing the spoilers. a massive super that I don't think did anything <laughs> the boss unfortunately Getting really exploders God, how does he do it and the decoy is still alive this guy's just going ham on it no eh. Yeah, Orpheus is probably the most relevant it's ever been in this in this mode. Yeah, let me just make sure I have my my story straight. Yeah, Trapper's Ambush. Yeah, making people invisible. Like, I don't need two making things invisible things. You just need the one. And Stylist Executioner is just kind of like a go-to. 
He's just kind of a go-to. I'm also fascinated at how many people are like, what is this effing weapon that you have, bro? The effing buried bloodline. What is this? It's like, people just are not in the loop about buried bloodline. I mean, I have a video on, on YouTube on my thoughts on it. But it's from Warlord's Ruin. It's the it's the dungeon exotic. And it's it's kind of cooking right now. I mainly use it on Hunter. Uh, it also has the benefit of being anti-barrier for the season. Which is pretty nice, because barriers appear uh, with both enemy races. Holy moats, I'm about to bank an effing jumbo blocker. how many modes there were. We're bringing it back. Do you think Orpheus is more impactful now in Onslaught or way back in Reckoning? More impactful. Um, I don't know. You could, you could get... I, I don't know. They're both kind of equal. Like, you could get Reckoning done without it. But, like, if you had the option, why not bring it with you? What's Frost Armor gonna do? Bro, I'm I'm the one always... I'm, a, I'm always the one telling people what things are... What, I'm asking you now. What's Frost Armor gonna do? Salem KT? Yeah, you're the streamer for the next 37 seconds. What's it gonna do? What's it gonna do, Salem? You tell me. <laughs> Someone asked Salem if you could bring one weapon from Destiny 1 into Destiny 2, what would it be? Streamer, why aren't you asking, answering my questions? <laughs> oh, man. No, it's all right. You did good. You did good. Um, you immediately buckled under the pressure. <laughs> But also, ah, I don't know, man, is also the perfect answer to that question. So I'll give you one for two on that. Um, I think Frost Armor will be reminiscent of, uh, of Woven Mail as a way for Stasis to have more tools to be able to stay in the fray, have some more defensive options uh, to compete with the likes of Strand. That's what I'm guessing is, uh, is going to be happening. The relic himself. Oh yeah, I have Shadow Shot too. I'm gonna do that. I wanna be popular. Welcome viewers. Uh, welcome to the stream where I am telling people what the sidearm I am using is approximately every three minutes and nine seconds. Glad to have you. That was a nade of all time, bro. Ask him to borrow your account. This is oh, I'm just kidding, I love you. <laughs> uh, 
please let me in. Please let me in. I'll do anything. Let me see. Did I? I still got nothing. I know, buddy. And you got that side. Yeah, walk in, walk into it, walk into it. Stupid, 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 stupid. Oh god. Damn, I'm kind of bricked up over here, bro. It's kind of bricks galore. Oh my god, you guys hurt so bad, actually. Ooh, what, what, get the hell down from there, idiot. Angel, I have. I have. And if I hadn't, Danielle would have told me. Would have told me too, rather. Oh, snake with the trade. Okay, okay. That's a good strand hunter build. I'm afraid if I say what the build is, you will not know what it is. Like if I just said Sir Tarachne's facade whirly bird, would you know what that is? You will know. Okay, well then there you go. That's a good one. Assassin's cow will punch everything. That is not strand. I regret to inform you. You have failed the test. Dude, spy, I, I haven't seen a single shiny today. I'm seven and a half hours in. I brought off an effing linear to a knife fight, bro. This dude ain't got no face. There we go. Right. It is strand gravel prox cowl. Fair enough. Fair enough. Uh, you are I, very aggressive uh, with the gravels. Uh, I think, um, nice. All right. <laughs> that is fair. That one's on me. You are correct. I'm just not big on Assassin's Cowl. I know people really like it. I'm more of a, I'm a more of a liar's handshake kind of guy. So whenever I hear Assassin's Cowl, I just automatically think Arc Hunter. Imagine getting in a knife fight and they pull out Briar's Contempt. They hit you with a linear fusion shot. Crunchy with the 69 months of subbing. Welcome back. Thank you. Surely you're not ending stream until you get a shiny. I mean, I didn't want it to go that way. Because I was hoping today was not going to be like another double digit hour stream. Because I actually need to start thinking about main channel content again, but. We'll see. When did I get this shirt? During Lightfall. I got it from Bungie when they sent me the Strand uh, Laser Light Show gloves. They also sent this shirt. For a less aggressive build, would Foe Tracer be better than Facade? Yeah, probably. I mean, just by virtue of the fact that Facade is basically entirely built around grappling into stuff. 
Will the cock measuring contest be part of the fashion show? Ooh, no, that is only for tier three subs. On the OF. I cannot outcook. I mean, it's, no, it's all, oh my god, I got cooked. I stunned it. Let's go. Bro, I'm about I'm a, I'm going to have to put out like six different TikToks on what this effing sidearm is, bro. It's crazy. Get on my face. Holy. That probably missed. Nope. Sir. Thank you. Okay. Sorry. Come in. Just to make sure AD you didn't erupt. Oh my god. Gonna wombo combo you like it's effing trials in 2016. Damn, Angel. Very Discord pilled. Top 10 questions on stream. What's the most annoying a question I get? Most annoying question I get. Uh, yeah, besides the D1 exotic into D2, I don't know. <laughs> no, right now, what side was that? No. Um, God, when people at sarcastically ask me, hey, Dada, what's your thoughts on having thoughts? What's your thoughts on your own thoughts? I'm just like, wow, man, yeah, you're hilarious. Definitely haven't seen that one posted 800,000 times a day for the past 10 years. You doing banner after this? No, that's that's a That was a top tier question at the time. Yeah, it's got to be, it's got to be that. It's got to be the, what's your, what's your thoughts on your thoughts, LOL. Super original joke that I had, by the way. That one just gets tiring. Yeah, T-H-O-T-S, uh, Nightbot, spoilers, still hates it. Sorry, that's not even that's not even Nightbot. That is Twitch uh, mod uh, stuff directly. Held a re uh, held a message for a reason. Misogyny. Allow. We'll post it to chat. <laughs> water. I had a big sip of water earlier, but we'll have another one. Why not? You know what? Well, let's just kind of live our lives. I don't know if you feel this way, but I'm over the my opinion has arrived YouTube comments. No, I'm uh, that one. I'm not over because I, I don't feel like it's. Uh, I don't know. It's kind of like. Um, what's the word I'm looking for? It's like endearing to a degree to me.
But also, I don't really read YouTube comments nearly as much as I used to, so. And I even I kind of embrace it sometimes, you know? Like, I had a couple of uh, tweets and stream titles that was like, opinion man, I opinioned all over the place. That one, that one I don't mind. That one has not gotten old for me. We got a guardian down. I'm gonna get him. That that is one that I am pretty actively embracing. Yoink. Oh my god, that was a natty. That was a fat natty. That one, that one has not gotten old, but the th thoughts on your thoughts, thoughts on thoughts, thoughts on having thoughts, that one, if I never saw that question again, it would be too soon. If a genie appeared, um, appeared in front of me, like wish two would be to never see that question ever again. They just make you blind. Ironic. Woo! Wasting ammo. Big needle storm coming in. Nice. Does buried bloodline need the catalyst to be good? Let's review what the catalyst does, as I don't remember. While Devour is active, this weapon weakens on hit. Yeah, that's pretty good. You should get that. Once I get the catalyst to a weapon, I just forget what the catalyst actually does because it just becomes a part of the weapon. I'm just like, yeah, that thing weakens. It weakens, it gives you devour, it's sick, bro. Wonderful. Surely I am not the only person that can deal with this. Evidently, I am. What's your favorite muscle? It's my favorite muscle? I don't know, but they're not on my body, I'll tell you that much. Skin? <laughs> yeah, I don't think skin is a muscle. <laughs> Switch the gun! Get out of here, Vandal. Somehow doubled up on batteries, both at zero. Where's this guy? He's over here. Oh, it's just a normie one, too. Skin is an organ. Really? I did not know that. I didn't really know what it was classified as. Wave 30. Skin is an organ the way that Y is a vowel. Holy shit, is this guy spitting? That was bars That's right there. Group. Also, shout out to the guy who said like five minutes ago, I bet no one else is watching Datto from the hospital waiting for their wife to give a baby. 
That's kind of insane. And if true, congrats on that. I hope your wife has the most normal birth of all time. I didn't shoot the other gun. I still don't have bait and switch. I'm really good at the game, by the way. I still don't have it. I'm really confused now. I thought I did it right. <laughs> oh, now you're... Yeah, frick me. Reload everything challenge. I'll pop it up there. Give us a little bit of space. Excuse me. I have ammo. Yeah, turn away from the action there for a sec. <laughs> You're awesome. There was no way I would be watching you while waiting for the birth of my child. Kind of a fake fan, by the way. <laughs> no, I don't blame you. <laughs> uh, mods, make the chair that that guy is going to sit in while his wife is giving birth slightly uncomfortable. Thank you. Yeah, make it so the of the four legs that have the the little like uh like little end caps on them, well, one of them is missing. Why do we spawn over here? I'm confused. This is just to make sure that you're awake and paying attention. They put you in the wrong spot. Do we have a Shax? We do. Holy. Well, I was going to buy that. <laughs> Guess not. I'm pretty low on the power ammo. I will be yoinking the good stuff as soon as we get a bonus objective. What is bro shooting at? There you go. There you go. Retro with the 39 months. Thank you very much. I almost have a Tev. Never mind. Teammate does. Pretty sure teammate has popped more tethers than I have. And they're on Jure Falcon. Uh, yeah, I'll do one of my own, why not? I thought theirs ran out, it did not. So that's probably why they've been popping way more tethers than me. is they've been doing it in a really smart way and I've been doing it in a really stupid way. Oh my god, one's right there. Holy cow. Let him hit it. Nice. I wasn't even looking, bro. I looked at stream for a sec. I don't even think I have 
the weakness grenade. Yeah, I don't. Get get suppressed, idiot. Shielded sky bomber, moron. Oh god. Get suppressed, largest enemy I think we've ever seen. <laughs> no, not the largest, but pretty big. Seen a video with you and Sir Demetrius. Hey, thanks for... Uh, well, you didn't say it was good. You just said you saw it, so... Thanks for watching it, I guess. I didn't even make it. It's Sir D's video. Let's rewind. Hi, I'm, I'm Datto. Nice to meet everybody. It was good, but the thumbnail shows Nessus, and I couldn't stop thinking about that. I will relay that information. Oh, my God! To Sir D. I will let him know about your grievances. Thirty-five rounds in, I actually put a good tether down. Drunk Datto Raid. The best I can give you right now is Drunk Datto Mario Golf. We've done it twice so far. We'll probably do one more uh, before Final Shape. Probably going to be like an every two month affair. Wow, you have no HP. Any other Onslaught locations coming out? I don't know. I would be surprised if there were, but I also wouldn't be surprised if Bungie wanted to surprise us with something in the future. I'm not going to make the assumption that they will. Uh, nor am I gonna set the precedent that uh, a secret map is coming. Nor will I set myself up for disappointment if one does not show up. I'm just, I'm just establishing that like, if they did have a secret map, that would be sick. Wow, my butt. Is that how long it takes your liver to recover from getting drunk? I just I just don't want the bit to get old, you know? If we're doing it every week, then it's just kind of like... Ooh, again? He's doing it again, huh? All right. Look at these shots. How does he hit them? Turn around. When content warning. I'm worried that I missed the boat on it. That game came out like right as I had to go AFK IRL for something. I think the buds got in like one play session and they were like, all right, we're good. So maybe, maybe, but I will not promise anything. Uh, you know, the camper drew, I, it, that's not something I, I usually check. I'm not, I'm, I'm not gonna lie to you. I don't really keep a registry of, um, that statistic. When I die and, and I, I get to see my scoreboard, 
Uh, that one's probably going to be pretty far down the list. the weirdest question I've been asked. If you scroll up about 15 to 20 chat messages, uh, you'll get pretty close. <laughs> Shielded demos. Okay. Oh, let's drop it. I'll drop one down there. Why not? Wow, this shield is so much tankier than I really remember. The shield's tankier than them. Nice. Heal this bitch up, get rich in the process. Blow up and then act like I don't know nobody. countries of the world do you think you could name in 15 minutes 50 to 75 75 to 100 100 plus hmm I could guarantee 50 to 75 I would bet pretty likely on 75 to 100 and I would say that over 100 is unlikely. But now I'm thinking about it. It's like, how many countries are there in the world? Like, it's around 200, right? Depending on who you ask. That was like 193 or something like that, 192. When I reload, I'm going to go for that. Bro, how long is he shooting for? I'm still shooting. Oh my god, it hurts. I can dance all day, I can dance all day. Another Tev on that. If you get, I can dance all day, I can dance all day. Your back probably hurts. Any shinies, man. Come on. Give me a shiny. I just had to clip it on myself. I was like, that might be able to be a clip. Arrow Weiss, 56. Dianathos, 52. Mutai, 57. Thank you all very much for the 50s. Welcome back. 
Thank you very, very much. And we have Harrisite with a Prime sub. Checking, wow, checking, checking. I didn't get told about that ad break. Not only my back, but my neck, my pussy, and my crack. Ooh, that is tough. That's actually really tough. I didn't want to drop a quiv on like some dregs and stuff, but here we are. I gotta switch back. Thoughts on the onslaught loot buff that's coming? Um, I think it's good. I was like, where are the ads, bro? Um, I think it's good. I don't know if it's gonna really be enough to get people to like never do 10 wave farming ever again, but like the way I'm looking at it, I'm like, hey, free loot. Wow, that quiv was very not good. My quiv game is very off right now. Wow, that guy got baked. Kind of, I'm waiting for this. Look at the captain just getting cooked. That's two turrets through overload. And we're on 42. Oh my God, we're already on 42, okay. If you just sit down coffee day with anyone alive today, who would it be and why? Out of my super? I don't know, I would, have to, I would have to think about that one. I don't have like a ton of like celebrity worship or anything like that. Camo point, he says. Or I'm about to get stomped out of my brains. What did you expect that was gonna happen, man? All I've been hearing about is how Briggs effing kill it in, through Invis. I'm like, I know exactly what's gonna happen here. I'm gonna walk in and I'm gonna freaking die. <laughs> I had Invis. I was Invis! I went Invis! They don't care. We tested this on Midtown. Having a conversation with like David Attenborough or Obama would be super interesting. I'm kind of Ryan Reynolds pilled. I feel like he would just be a fun, a fun dinner date or like Robert Downey Jr. I don't know, someone, someone a little talkative. But fun. Has d led an interesting life. Yeah, I'm going after the triumph where you don't spend any of your scrap. Jack Black, that'd be fun. Any giving me devour? Things die too fast, man. I'm also not really getting any killing blows. That might be the part of the problem. Per 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 Oh! 
Oh god. Nope. No. Stunned idiot moron. Yeah, we're doing the spending no scrap challenge. We're doing the what is he doing challenge. Sean Evans Hot Ones interview would be fun. Two things about Sean Evans. Number one, has he ever done an interview where he was interviewed? If not, literally get on that already. And I'm talking about on his own show. If he hasn't, get on that. If he has, then okay, I missed it. And second of all, I wish he wants, I feel like he wants to get his questions out so badly that he ends up saying them really fast. And I just wish he would be more conversational about it. You know what I mean? Like the questions are good. The questions are good and he gets so much praise for being a good interviewer and the quite like, don't get me wrong. I, I enjoy the questions that are asked. But I wish he would just like relax a little bit. I wish he was a bit more conversation. It always feels so like corporate. That's the editing. I mean, I guess so. But then like if, but like you've been doing the show for that long and it comes across in the editing in that way. Like, I don't know, just, I feel like it's just like so, so quick. I don't know, I just wish it felt a little more like we're just kind of talking here. I'm talking over here. What do I even buy? Give me this turret. No, you can have you can have an interview still kind of be chill. I like I understand not wanting it to make it like a 50 minute, you know, thing. I'm just saying like slow down the questions a little bit, like physically speaking them, and then you know, you add like an extra minute or so to the duration of the video, it's not gonna kill you. I don't know, that's, that's all I gotta say. Still enjoy the show. Fan of the show, like watching. The Conan episode was awesome. I'm just saying, that's just my, that's just my opinion. Yeah, we failed the challenge. Oh, I was gonna do that. I was all ready and everything. Brother baited the challenge. Or am I still in the challenge? If we're in the, what is he doing challenge? Now I've just spent scrap. Now you're still asking, what is he doing? I'm, I'm two steps ahead. Overload captain to where is he? Okay, still down here. Where you get stuck, man? You get lost? Did you fall in? Oh, that's not great. Okay. Well, looks like we're cooking. So here we go. Can't hit this dude's shoulder for the life of me. Oh, this is not a great one either to have marauders. Is my quiver already gone? Did I pop it too early? I think I went too early. I want to get rid of these saboteurs. Dude, all it takes is one of these saboteurs to just sneak up on you and you're just toast. Yeah, I guess I went too early with my tether. Damn. All right. 
Sucks to suck, I guess. Still a vandal back there. I can't see shit up there. supposed to be one tormentor per 50 waves i think i got two tonight uh it's possible to get two are you going for the wipe on 50 challenge i'm really not i've done the wipe on 49 challenge about three or four times now and i'm not in a hurry to do it again <laughs> What's happening? Oh, Acreus, by the way, I understand what they're cooking. Um... Oh my god, I already have Acreus on here. Okay. Um, uh, just throw on a freaking forbearance. Why not? Acreus. And we have arc reserves. Oh my god, damn. Give me freaking arc weapon surge. Yeah, I forgot what boss we were doing. Don't worry about it. Turn for an A ram. Starman, six months. What's the sidearm data dead? Read an article saying wave 50 completion chests have a higher higher shiny drop chance. Is that true or anecdotal? It is uh, anecdotal at best. Source, I made it the F up. Gun wasn't fully reloaded. Posting cringe. Oh. Forgot to melee. Runs well out, five seconds. I'm out. Yeah, nice meme, I'm not fighting that. Huge grenade launcher, get out of my face! Hi, Dato. Hi. Sir, 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 ow. Clean up some space here. Don't, don't you dare. Don't you dare. Oh, literally dead. Okay. <laughs> Got it. Please, shiny. I don't even care what it is at this point. Let's go. Finally, at least one, man. Oh, at least one, bro. Finally. Oh, please, 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 please. A demo frenzy, ambitious frenzy. Uh, okay, I guess so. I guess. And then this one. 
Attrition destabilizing chain bait and switch. So that's a bit tougher. Not even jagged edge. That's that's tough. That is tough. That is tough. Uh, didn't I get two mountaintop? Uh, I think it's just me, like, bumping into the item a couple times. Wonderful day, Guardian. Demo of Vorpal. Am I really going to keep a demo Vorpal? I don't know. Refresh. Just going to throw all of these in the vault for now. Man. Two, two shinies. I can't even be that mad about like multiple shinies. But, ow, <laughs> that's tough, that is tough, eight hours, yeah, one of those hours was the vault cleaning, so seven hours, Salty with the three dollar dono, sorry to hear about your neck and your crack and your no-no region, uh, Zatatsu, or maybe it's Zatos Zat Zatosu Prime Subin. Thank you very much for priming. Uh, Starman with the six months. Hurricane Marco with the three months. Ghost Dragon with the 46 months. Thank you all very much for subbing and resubbing. The pyramid ship is kind of nice. I'm not gonna lie. It does it does shade very well. Oh, that's tough. I gotta do some uh, some some organization of my own this weekend with all the shinies that I've gotten. Because I've just been kind of throwing them in the vault for now. What is this? Oh. Yeah, throw you in the vault as well. Throw you in the vault. Yeah, I gotta just dig through all my shinies and see. Because I don't... I, I think there's like... Almost... None that I'd actually want to keep. How do you just do that with the Postmaster? I don't... What did I do? What did I do? Oh, the menu bugging out. Yeah, no, 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 no. That's just... That's a menu bug. Don't worry about that. Don't worry about that. Don't worry about that. Um, how do you think Bungie is recouping the dev costs of Into the Light, or are they just eating the costs? I literally don't know. That is a question. I don't know how anybody can answer that. Um, I mean, they're literally still working there, so it's not like they were going to do nothing. Right. 
Um, I don't know. <laughs> That is so outside of the realm of <laughs> my knowledge base. I couldn't I couldn't even like fathom a close answer. I did see the new changes Bungie is releasing for Onslaught. We went over it today. And then I had Vada make a TikTok and then I posted the TikTok. And I think it's good. I don't know if it's enough, but it's a good start. It's a good start. What game do I love more than D1 or D2? Here's what I can give you. I can give you games that aren't Destiny that are my favorites. How about that? So Final Fantasy X. World of Warcraft. Natural Selection 2, Rock Band, Balatro. Off the top of my head. How's that? A Brather. Danielle's pog champion about something. What happened? Did you get in? Danielle, did you get in? What are you pog champing about? I don't know who that is. Someone liked her tweet? I'm going to look that up. Oh, okay. She tweeted at like a bunch of the devs. Also, I can't see who liked her tweets. So, wait, no, I, I can. Because she said this guy. We go to likes. And there it is. Ah, so someone from... Supergiant liked one of her tweets. Got it. She like freaked out and I was like, oh my God, she got in. She's like, nope, somebody liked one of my tweets. And I was like, wow, that's such a far second place. But okay, you know, anything you can get right now. <laughs> anything, anything you can get. <laughs> Why can't I chat? Says someone in the chat. Um... I don't know if I should be telling you this or not, uh, person in chat who said that message, um, but you are being highlighted as a restricted, suspicious user. I'm gonna click on your name. You've said three things in this chat before today. One of them was dot dot dot. One of them was a heart. One of the were one of them was just letters C and U. And now you are a restricted suspicious user. So I don't know. Maybe you did something else in some other chat. Um but I have no way of assisting you in that matter. Mm, banned in another person's chat. Mm. Mm. And not just another person's chat. My wife's chat. I would lay low. I would lay low before somebody gets a cross check on you. I don't know the reason. I don't know the reason. But someone will perform a cross check. 
What's up, baby legs? Jesus, <laughs> huge name, by the way. One message there, and it was ho. Mm, can't c be calling my wife a ho. And that can't also be your first message. By the way, this also, this person has not typed in the chat since getting called out. Yeah, not the greatest first impression that you can make, especially on a on a lady streamer. I get that. Totally get that. I want to go to a different character. True, not on any women, but in particular, my wife. You know what I mean? Titan or Warlock? What do I have cooking on my Warlock? Let me see. Let me see. We do have Phoenix. I wonder how Hierarchy of Needs does in this place. Because on some builds, I feel like it would... Or some waves, I feel like it would go berserk. And then others, I feel like it would be absolutely nothing. But I'd be interested. Sunbracers, I already know it's what's cooking there. I've already done Vesper. I would also like to try Crown of Tempest. Uh, and or Fallen Sunstar. I haven't done Osmiomancy myself, but I have seen it used. Um, we did some Strand stuff. This is my uh, Fallen Sunstar. Hmm. Hmm. Um, you know what? We can switch in the middle of it. I am just going to go with this for now and see how it does. Sniper? I'm probably not. We have Unstop Bow. Barrier? We have Radiant, so we're kind of cooking there. I don't know why I have a PvP Defiance of Yasmin as part of this build, but I guess pop off me. What about, like, a Heritage? I'll take a Heritage in case things get uh, a little saucy here. Okay. Um, we also have an ad break coming in in just a moment here. I'm going to just stand up and kind of like take a lap and uh, and go to the bathroom. Verity's brow. If I had something set up already, I would entertain that. I don't have a Verity's brow set up yet. All right, and it's probably going to be uh, last run of the day. Uh, unless we do... Unless we do, like, really bad right at the start. I'd say if we go, if we go 35 deep and then wipe, uh, that, is, that is my limit. That's my limit. We're going to LG. I am uh, I'm running out of juice, and tomorrow's another quite busy day for me. I have uh, we have some kind of a twid in the morning. It's gonna happen, uh, and then I have two meetings in the afternoon, and then I have Dungeons and Dragons finale. Which I'm very excited about for multiple reasons. Number one, it's the finale. Number two, I get to level up to level 10, which is very pog. Number three, after the finale, I get to reclaim my Thursdays back. <laughs> I get my Thursdays back, and I am so stoked about that. Because Thursday is like my midweek, like, still working, but I can, I can kind of relax like a little bit, kind of catch up on stuff. But I've had to commit so many Thursdays to D&D. So I'm just happy about getting my Thursday back. <laughs> and there's the year ad break, so let's BRB.
Hello. I have returned. We're going to do one more run. And then I'm going to call it. And I'm going to get some dinner. And I'm going to chill with Brim. When, we, we, when will we get your god, lo, god roll list for the brave weapons? Uh, you have already received it. It's already been given to you. In fact, let's do like an exclamation point add com brave. Let's do brave rolls. There you go. We'll add that. I just added a marker. Don't ignore that one. I just clicked it again. Ignore that one as well. Clipper fan, 3212. Thank you very much for prime subbing. Where are the Clippers in the playoffs? Playoffs. Bracket. They are for... Oh, they're playing the Mavericks. I'm pretty sure that's a rematch from last year. GL, GL. Knicks are playing the Sixers. It's going to be a good series. Am I an NBA fan? I mean, now that the Knicks don't suck complete ass, yeah. <laughs> Again. Damn, this thing is clocking these fools in the head. It's been forever since I've seen... Five-figure crits on an effing yellow bar. Which build? What is the build that Sneak is running? Yeah, I've been a Knicks fan since I was a kid. I've had two out of the past 25 years to be happy about something. And this was one of those years. Don't know Mega Dance about. What about the Rangers? I would be more stoked about the Rangers if I cared about hockey. Sneak loves the Rangers, though. I'm pretty sure he does. At least I see it appear in my feed from him every so often. Let's drop a rang. It's perhaps too much of an investment this early. I'm a Giants fan and I'm a Mets fan. Yeah, this kind of cooks as well. It's against a night wave, bro. I mean, granted, it's early. Ow. Thread the needle here a little bit. Oh, I don't have radiant. How does that freaking work, bro? Okay, very early tormentor. Oh, nope. Wow, you're not dead.
This guy's gonna kill me. Is my well still up? It is. Okay, well, last guardian standing is not ideal. Oh my god, that guy was zooming, bro. And somebody left the team. Yeah, that's where I wanted the frickin' ring. I just have literally nothing for this guy right now. Okay. That, uh, that got a little dicey. <laughs> we made it, though. We made it. Yeah, I'm originally from New York. Why are people apologizing to you for being a Giants fan when the alternative is to be a Jets fan? Probably because the Giants for, like, the past ten years have been kind of ass. But, like, we've, we've just exited the time period where I think the team needs to start getting it together. Like, if you win a championship, if your team wins a championship, how long do you give them of them sucking ass before you're like, okay, it's time to get it together, dude. Me, I give it 10 years. And we have now exited that time period. We're about 13. We're about 13 deep, so I it, it is well within my right at this point to be like, okay, it's time to get it together, bro. Like, when's it gonna happen? Oh, this thing is under attack. Red the needle down there. That's an unstop. I have a bow for unstop. Wow, we're there. Didn't want to do that. No, I'm a Mets fan. I'm a Mets fan because everyone at my high school and like junior high school was a Yankees fan, and I was like, I'm gonna root for the Mets. So that was a mistake. This is a gauge of pure combat potential. Make me proud. Holy aim assist on that one. Yeah, I didn't I didn't know a lot about sports back then. Sorry, I knew a lot about the Knicks, because I went to I went to a few Knicks games. I was I was watching, dude. I remember like, I remember one year when they it was like one of the last years where they were actually competitive, and I think they probably lost to the Pacers. I remember like my nine, ten year old ass effing sobbing. Like I was, it was all passion for the Knicks when I was a little kid. I cried because the the Knicks lost in the playoffs. Like, when they were playing against the Spurs, like, I kind of knew, like, everybody knew. It's like, they don't have an effing shot. But when they lost, I, I think it was probably to the Pacers. It's like one of the last years where they were actually competitive. I remember my, uh, I remember me crying about it. And then they sucked for 25 years. Minus like two years. <laughs> yeah, like no, I I knew 
I knew that, uh, you know, when they played against the Spurs, like, there's no shot. We are gaming. When Red Sox broke the curse in 04, that was an event for my fam. <laughs> yeah. So I'm just happy to see the Knicks competitive again. This is a healing rift again. That's all I wanted is just for them to be competitive. And then like when they have like a full team like stacked up, like bricked up, they are a force. Okay, I'm gonna let you do your thing. So I'm very excited to see a fully, sir? A fully healed up, fully torqued up effing Knicks team next year. Damn, those saboteurs are usually so obnoxious to take down of any type. Have I tried Trinity Eagle with Vesper? Uh, no, I've only done Cold Heart. What I really need to do is, is do Indebted Kindness. That's what I need to do. This is where the ring, I, I got three effing ring juices in, in one go. F me, bro. Just wasted it. All those years of academy training wasted. I'm gonna do it over here. Slam. Uh, where's the other guy? Oh, I almost rocketed myself. Cooked. Stand as far back as possible. I don't remember this thing hitting like a truck, man. I'm just used to using it in GMs, and like GMs, it does pretty good. But in this, it's just like hitting like a truck. Like a Ford F 150. Yeah, pretty excited for Knicks, bas Knicks basketball when everybody's healthy next season. Mr. Pie Man with the 65 and Model Dust with the 38. Thank you very much. Thank you. Knicks and Minnesota finals are going to be generational. God, imagine the Knicks winning. Even the Eastern Conference. I'll take that. It's been, what, 50, 51 years since their last title? They won in 73? 73? 71. 71. 73. Yeah, ECF this year is, is going to be tough. They need, they need to go on an effing run. Do you want Spike on Mountaintop? I mean, it'd be cool if you did. It's not like super needed, but like it's pretty cool still. Bro, who needs rockets? I'm just seeing 16,000s popping up like it's my goddamn job. Holy cow. What's my opinion on the Warriors dynasty being over? They were not my team. So, I don't I don't feel like I have too much to say. Can these guys like come into line of sight, please? Although, I did like when I was in college. Uh like I watched Steph Curry kind of become the player that he has become cuz he was at Davidson.
uh, like 09, 08, 09 era. I'm not gonna lie, I'm I'm not really built for for the slaying. I'm gonna get out. Keep chat. Sorry, I'm I'm not really built for for heat wave. That's my bad. So I was around like seeing him blow up, and I always thought that was cool because like you know, you've never heard of Davidson otherwise. And I was much more engaged with like college basketball back then because of Villanova. Auto loading one for all again, bro. Twilight Fade, tier three, yet again, 71 months of subbing. Thank you again for your tier three support. Nice, we got some good, we got some good sidelines here. Yeah, we got some good, yeah. Nova ain't really been there since Jay Wright left. Yeah, I mean, look, they got, we got some almost back-to-back -back championships. Tough to be mad. And he was gonna leave at some point eventually, you know? Like, it was gonna happen at some point. They were gonna have to rip the Band-Aid off and we'll see what they end up becoming. Can any enemies come around this corner, please? The pan's 500 degrees, it's just burning itself right now? Come on, man, peek. You know what's really unfortunate is that this is another dungeon exotic and some people are gonna come in here and be like, what is that bow, bro? And I'll be like, God damn it, again. Damn, I should have had this sideline the whole time. Can't see. Oh my god. Almost just clipped that. That's the wrong gun. Holy saboteur cooked. What was that? What did I just get slammed by? That was Shielded Sky. I didn't even know Shielded Sky Bombers were up. Is this the best place to try out new builds? I mean, if it's not, I would love to know where. Are we on 14, 15, something like that? Do I know what frost armor does? Yeah, but I can't tell you. God, I wish double rings actually did something for you. Be so sick. 
25 thou on a night. Oh my god. Damn. Alright, this one we want some some healing for. Need and critical. Just one crit, please, bro. Thank you. I got rings for both. Here and then here. Sir, excuse me. Kind of rude of you. Now we're going to hold that one. That is... I'm going to guess... An unstop. Yeah, it was an unstop. Okay. Rossarago! Deleted. I actually ended up getting another Rossarago recently. I think I got the subsistence... Best your roll. Subsistence onslaught. Victory yeah. So, threw that into the vault very quickly. <laughs> I wish it was the one that I got for the video. But I was like, look, I either make the video now, or I just have to hope that I get it. And I was like, F it, I'll just make the video. Wish you could buy Dungeon Exotics at like jacked up prices. Yeah, I don't think they're gonna do that. Unless they remove the dungeon, in which case, You'll be able to. I mean, you can just also look for farming groups. Or at least people just doing their resets. You know, nothing wrong with that. Any build advice for a Void Titan this season? Ooh. Uh, so you said Void and Titan and also this season and also this year honestly i you really your only option imo as a void titan you could do what my boy dre was doing like some severance and closure stuff with some overshields you could do like a collective obligation type setup otherwise i don't know how much void titans really cooking i you could also maybe do like a peregrine yeah peregrine situation where you give yourself an overshield and then you just insta-gib stuff. That'll be good for, like, killing demolitionists. That's actually not bad. Um, having some burst damage on demos. That could go kind of hard. Um, but then the rest of the time you're just, like, shooting guns and stuff. Um, so, yeah, it's not it's not popping too hard. But it is it is workable. But you're, you're pretty shoehorned into some specific builds. Save that one. All right, everything's dead. What's happening? Okay, I was like, the meter's full. Why are more ads? under attack says who got him premiere can post direct to tiktok yeah it can post direct to a lot of places but Catch me trusting Premiere to export to an effing video upload website, bro. What do we 
We got Acolytes. You know what? What else are we going to spend this on? We're going to get it back anyway. This boat fires in a half a nanosecond. I still can't get it to fully charge. Any ideas on the next cosplay? Not really. I haven't really been in that zone. I would like to do another, like, original, uh, like, Goth GF 5.0, whatever we're up to. But otherwise, I'm just kind of doing the ones that I've been doing, because getting full costumes made every single time I have an idea is really expensive. <laughs> Yeah, this bow's cooking. It's absolutely cooking. I had I had like a little concern of like, am I even really gonna be able to get it off the ground? And it turns off, I am. I am getting it off the ground. Yeah, I don't know. I just haven't been I haven't been in that mood. I gotta be in the right mindset for it. Do stellar blade. What kind of guy do you think I can turn into or girl I guess I don't know because that is ambitious can this ogre be like literally anywhere else I don't know just it's gonna boot me off the map okay, well look we need another we need another another freaking well here okay, here's another well Holy shit, the stun lock. Nice. Not feeling seawardy enough? Yeah. That's a good, actually a good analogy for it. Also, shout out to the ladies for taking back the seaward. Which I'm not going to say here because YouTube gets really mad if you use it. And I don't want to have to edit this out of the vid. Sorry, I should say like American. Places where that word is not comfortable. You know, Australians, you guys already had it. I'm talking to everybody else. The F is the C word. Um, see you next Tuesday. Uh, Gvain. I don't even know if I said that right. Thanks very much for prime subbing. Thank you very much for doing that. How can I get Callus Mini Tool? You run one of the three exotic missions in the rotator. Presage? Is it Presage? Presage. You run Presage and you hope that you get it. You can't really farm for it. That's how you get it. You have other options. Go go try and get like a bug out bag or something. You got options. Fourteen has an ocean or a oceanic server region. They just opened up world traveling and OCE was test areas. So there's so much culture clashy going on right now in the servers. It's kinda neat. You gotta barely gotta aim this thing. How much water do you drink daily? I try to have at least two cups of this, which I know is like, you know, maybe not enough. What the teleporting knight? Get the frick out of here, bro. Bro, 
but you know it's way better than where I used to be so we take those Excuse me, pardon me, sorry. Shielded demos. Well, I know I'm putting my well. Blink. Tethered King of Brain. My well is probably out. All right, this one, this one's a bit harder to thread. I'm not gonna lie. Uh, not my best work there. I don't know. I kind of want to do like a last hurrah cosplay type thing where I just like go all out and spend a lot of money on on something pretty significant and then like that'll just be my last one. Have I suffered through any trials lately or is it self care to pretend it just doesn't exist? Um I mean I don't I don't play a ton of trials. It's not really my department. Um, but every once in a while, like, Frostbolt will ask me to come play Trials, and I oblige. Because, like, he only asks, like, once every, you know, two or three months or something for a card. But that's really all I do. Why would it be the last? I don't know, because I'm getting old. Hey, you. I don't know if I can pull it off anymore. I don't know. Oh, blue. I could have thrown a healing grenade at you, but I don't, I literally don't think I would have made it. Sorry, right, we get you. Um, I don't envision myself getting any use out of heritage on the boss fight, so I'm going to switch. Huge shot. This guy taking any damage? This is not the boss fight. This is just the in-between. Where heritage actually would have Pop the F off. <laughs> oh my god, I can't wait for that change, bro. No, I waste my thing. Where are you going, man? Yeah, I don't know. I just I like I haven't really been in the zone for it the mindset for it. I've just been doing it like less and less. Mm. Ow. So we'll see. I think it's one of those things where it's like, if I, if I do another one, 
if I do another one, then I'll be in uh, I'll be in like more of a mood to be like I want to do that again. But it's because I haven't done it in a while. Besides Christmas, but like we do that, you know, for for sponsored stuff and Halloween. But we do that every time anyway. Um, I think once I actually do it again of like my own volition and not for some sort of like holiday, you know, sponsor whatever thing. Maybe I'll want to do it more. Are the Firewalker pants for Titan good in any way? If you're talking about Path of Burning Steps, they're okay. Let's drop this. The problem with this bow is that you keep slowly moving up and moving out of the Well of Radiance, and then everything starts to hurt. <laughs> Love how your streams are just a Q&A about if things are good or not. Yeah, welcome. Although it's tough, it's tougher, uh, or it's tougher for me to engage in a bit more banter when you kind of have to go a, at least a little try-hard mode in this. Twenty-nine. What do we got? Mines? Mines. Let's hit this guy with a freeze. Do 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 You sir. Wow, I thought slow was supposed to make you inaccurate. Any god rolls yet? We have got some rolls of uh, of mountaintop that I'm interested in trying. I'm gonna say up in five. Let's do, let's do a rocket. Let's do some rockets here. I ain't, I ain't effing around. But Onslaught, Boss Room, Wave 50, Room won't open because crystals don't expand when we shoot them any fix. I have no idea. I don't even I don't think I've even heard of that happening. Also, we are nine and a half hours into the stream. The the banter starts to run low around hour five, hour six. <laughs> so someone says try a trace rifle. SSI Commander, 10 months. Thank you very much. For resub in 10 months. Thank you, thank you. How many shines have I gotten in the last seven hours? Uh, two. And they dropped both from wave 50, but that was after about seven hours of getting nothing. Any recent recommended serving size annoyances? Not that I can recall. Ooh. 
God, I love Shrieker Boss, bro. Just free low. Absolute free low. One more shiny to end the day. How about that? How about one more shiny? Wow, no. Overflow one for all. Yeah. I have tried Vesper of Radius. I've tried Vesper of Radius on my own. I've tried triple Vesper of Radius. My issue with Vesper of Radius is that it starts to fall off around th wave 31 plus. It is fun. But it does start to fall off a little bit. Although, I wasn't using it with Indebted Kindness. If you run with Indebted Kindness and maybe some like special, av special ammo generation you might like it more even though it does well in gms gms are a bit of a different experience gms aren't throwing dozens of enemies at you all at once in the same way that onslaught is where are they gonna come from okay over here okay 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 Man. You know how much I invested into making that ring? Those things take so long. I feel like wasting points. What kind of milk do you like most? Coal? 2%? 2%. Or do you prefer milk alternates such as soy or almond? Goat? Nope, I'm 2%. I used to be on the, on the skim milk train, and then I was like, nope, 2% milk, better. I do not use milk alternatives unless I am completely out of milk and Danielle happens to have uh, alternatives. That was some cookery. This is a bad idea. Oh, I thought you were going to get staggered more. I don't even know where my ring is. I'm just hoping. Vada, you still here? Maybe maybe grab a couple of clips of this thing absolutely cooking and I'll talk about this build real quick. We'll talk it up. Maybe this and buried bloodline. Saw Red Pose with damage testing saying implosion rounds are the go to if you don't have max blast radius on mountaintop. That is some information that I think only the gigaist of nerds really need to concern themselves with. No disrespect to the people on doing the hard work on the ground floor. But I would not concern yourself the most with like such minute 
things if you are if you're just kind of out here vibing you feel me don't stress yourself out Sixteen second well of radiance. Yeah, you can use that one. Yeah. Yeah, grab that and then grab the night wave before that, Vada. <laughs> and, uh. Let's, let's go ahead and use those two for a quick little explanation of this build <laughs> for the talk. I don't know if I want to be super high up on the kills, but if there was like a damage output meter for this, just like showing total damage that you dealt, I would be up there. You are good, Vada. I don't know if you hit a marker. But I have timestamps for you if you want. You got the marker? Sick. You know what? I'll, I'll use a ring here as the knight and all other enemies roll out of the way. Oh my god. Why are you hitting me so far? So far away. That is totally fair, Votto. I can just like yell. Like, marker, marker. Mark this! Somebody! <laughs> uh, Laraza B. Sorry, that was about nine minutes ago. Thank you very much for dropping a Prime sub. Thank you very, very much. Enable exclamation point marker if it's not already. I will look at that. Knowing me, it's probably not enabled. Where are the dudes? Whoa! Where'd y'all come from? I don't want to waste my ring. Did I play the dungeon tonight? No, nah, I didn't end up doing any ghosts. Oh, is it? Is it up there as well? Need a ring. Peek. No. 
I need a ring. I got it. No, I used it. Demos. I am just shy on a well. I am fine on a well. I'm going to DPS the one that is debuffed. Because <laughs> that guy behind me is not. Oh my god, land. Thank you. Sir. I don't know where he went. I cannot believe it's already been 50 minutes, bro. Okay, Vada. Well, to be fair, you're basically the only person using it so far, but I'll change it. <laughs> I'll fix it. Jump. Yeah, I'm, I'm basically tapped on energy. Uh, we're going to kill this boss and we'll hit the ad break, and that should be the last one of the day. Yeah, dude, you just, you kill hours in this mode, man. You just kill them. It's crazy. Just like Coil? Even, even more than Coil, bro. Yeah, Briarbinds is, uh, is awesome for Midtown. Even Vostok. Stay a little bit farther back. That's gonna miss. Waiting for a stagger. There's a stagger. There's another stagger, nice. Oh, the staggers, baby. Wells out very soon. I'm going to back up so I can generate a new well. New well, new well, new, I don't know how the song goes. Freeb. Is that bug still a thing with this bow, the double stacking? I have no idea. Outlaw opening shot. I'm good. Montagna? Nope. Excuse me? And... No. One thing I don't like about most exotic bows is the hip fire to use a special ability when charged. I prefer it worked by holding down the reload button so you can charge an arrow. I feel you because I would love to hip fire this bow more when I do have a full guidance ring ready. Um, but if I had to hold R to get this bow procked up and ready to fire a guidance ring, holy shiz. Would it just slow the pace of this thing down so much?
Other bows, maybe. This one, I'm kind of okay with it. It would, like, this, this bow would come to a crawl. How do you get that much super energy turn? Is it mostly the bow? Yeah. You're just, like, slaying out. And you're slaying out with a primary. Or is it just kinetic that gives you more? I forget. Ring activated. Wow, I only have one point. That's kind of tough. Okay. And building this thing from scratch also kind of sucks. That's, I didn't want that. Now I have to effing. Good idea, good idea. Launching some rockets. Saved. I'm dead. I'm alive. Don't shoot my teammates in the back of the head challenge. Ow. I don't know what's happening. don't have hit reload with the bow as much they could just make it a press while X is primed yeah maybe all right nor no tormentor but in that case I am gonna just throw on the old song of your Ute right now I should probably spend spend a little cash I don't know if I got that one in. Ringed up and ready. some power ammo. What do we got? Oh, speed wave. Easy. Easy. Oh, ogres. Hard. Me yeah, medium. I'll give you medium. I'll give me medium. I don't know what the progress is on my thing. There we go. Too many buffs. I forget that this build makes well lock like fun to play. Oh, I'm... All right. 
Um, so the bow works. You have guidance ring on the left side of your screen. And when you fill it up to six, which you do by getting headshots and kills. If you get a headshot kill, it's worth two. Uh, you can throw out a guidance ring by hip firing a shot, like fully charge it up. And then you'll shoot like a little ring, which I'll show you when we get over here, because I don't want to waste it, because it costs a lot of time. So here we go. Guidance ring out. And then when you shoot through the ring, you get extra shots that go through it, and you can like re knock an arrow like hella fast. I just realized Dado does Destiny is an alliteration. That's kind of the point. Yeah, but also without the dying. Again, without the dying, sorry. All right, no pee pee poo poo in here, please. I'm gonna keep that to Mr. Fruit's channel. We're gonna keep that immaturity over to Mr. Fruit's channel. Stacking two rings does not do anything. That is correct. All right, let me try to get one of these suckers back here. All right, we'll do we'll do a take two on that when we get outside. Boink. Okay, so we'll we'll take that from the top. Ready? Can you just, can you ask that again? character okay and three two one hey dad how's that bow that you're using work uh so you have the guidance ring which you're gonna see on the uh, left hand side of the screen here anytime you get a headshot uh you get a point anytime you get a kill i'm effing dead again bro it had to be knights it had to be knights hadn't it it couldn't have been thrall f just use the first one i don't care Stupid ass knights. I was in the middle of dropping a well too, you stupid idiots. Guidance ring. No, I can't do it while I'm angry. All right, this is a poorly positioned guide. I, it's all coming apart. That being said though, I'm getting insane amounts of energy. Hit the bonus objective as it popped up. <laughs> Just use the first one. I'm, I'm going to my trailer. I don't have radiant. No. Nah. All right, what do we got? Sky bombers, easy. Where's where's bro going? You ever get triple ringed up? Okay, that being said, these guys are probably nuking us right now. Like I regen my entire explosion. <laughs> eh. I don't know why we're throwing batteries. It's over.
All right, Shulls. All right, Mr. Shulls. You're right. You're right. <laughs> I'll do. Uh, maybe I'll do it in the boss room. There's gonna be a lot of ads to kill in the boss room. Actually, F it, we ball. I don't know, we're not gonna be surrounded. Like, we are surrounded, but we're not surrounded. Good. I didn't want to do that. <laughs> Wonderful day, Guardian. Poggers. So true. All right, we'll try. We'll try to take three here. What's with the KFC texture on the warlock? You guys are just fucking hating on Forbidden Wish, bro. One of the best in the game. Trout, thank you very much. Nine months. Thank you. And EN Ovation Media with the 29 months. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. All right. We'll try take three. Here we go. I'm just getting the character. I should probably give them a well. Hang on. Here we go. All right, someone hit, me with, someone hit me with a question. Probably should help with the boss, huh? 23,000, that's the, what the frick? Okay, ow. Ah, I'm gonna, dude, I'm dead. We didn't start yet, that's fine. That's a reset. That's a reset. Let's just reset that one. Hey, Dado, how's that bow work? Uh, so what do you need to do? You see guidance ring on the left-hand side of your screen. Anytime you get a headshot or a kill or even a headshot kill, you make some progress on your guidance ring and then you hip fire, hold down the shot. You make a ring, you shoot through the ring, you do extra damage and you get to knock your next arrow like hella fast. So you just kind of like go around and cook everything up. Excuse me, excuse me, pardon me. Let's get a little bit closer. How was that? Was that a cut? Crack all these open. See if we get a FN. I think I already have this one. Not top. No! Midnight Coup. Attrition Orbs, Kinetic Tremors. No. Mountain Top. Life from Water. No! All right.
I just committed a cardinal sin. I gave an all black shaded hunter best dressed. 715 kills. Okay. So I did a lot better than I thought. I like 50, 50, 49 because it got disconnected. <laughs> um, that's actually more uh, than I thought I was going to get. It was either going to be like a thousand or I was going to be in the middle of it. But I would love to see like total damage outputted. Also, 275 orbs created. I mean, literally just by DPSing. All I did was just shoot this bow the whole time. 275 orbs created. What else do you want, man? <laughs> it's insane. You, you, know, you know what you also probably want, Vada, is like the fragments and the aspects that I'm using? I am using Heat Rises and Touch of Flame because I just don't have the muscle memory built for Icarus Dash. If you want to put an Icarus Dash, you can totally put an Icarus Dash. And then Fragments, we got Torches, we have Char, Blistering, Ashes, just spreading Scorch as far as we can, boosting our Ignitions. And then, I mean, you just need Torches for Radiant. Like, that's always good. First time chatter is already subbed. Holy. Tried using Storm Dancer in Onslaught. I've only been using Chaos Reach. I do want to try using a little uh, Tickle Fingers with either Crown of Tempest or uh, Fallen Sunstar. Okay, Danielle just screamed, so either uh, one enemy jumped out at her, or she got into the beta. I don't know. I just hear her, you hear it all? <laughs> just hear her squealing? <laughs> Redeems? Okay. Yeah, this is, uh, we're at the end, by the way. I'm done. <laughs> Drink water, we did that. Favorite muscle? I don't. I didn't even really answer this one. I just gave a sarcastic answer, so I'm gonna give you your points back. Gildo, we answered yours. Stretch, we did that. Pet the brim is not in here, so I'm gonna give that back to you. Um, we answered the milk question with Colioli, and then we have Mega Nura with a judge your fashion. One more fashion judgment. We're gonna do that, and then we're calling it a day. Fashion, 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 fashion. Meow. Okay. You have three. I'm just going to grab all three and we'll go kind of quick on them. I'll kind of like peek through and see what my favorites are. Uh, all of those orbs that I was creating, by the way, pretty much through Solar Siphon. She got a reply to her tweet this time. Oh, okay, okay. Also, you probably want to know what mods I have equipped for this. It's literally just all focused on firing this bow as fast as possible. Ran my first, full last wish raid. Just start Got that one an over. under pressure kickstart Tekion's force and a rewind rounds collective action one. Either worth keeping if I don't have one yet? No, not really. You pretty much just want, like, you want controlled burst at a minimum. If you don't have controlled burst, IMO not even worth keeping. For PvE anyway. Um okay, last thing for this build, and then I'll let you go, Vada. <laughs> for effing all the things that you have to clip. <laughs> um The mods for this setup that I use anyway are just entirely focused on getting as many arrows out as possible, as much damage as possible. And creating as many orbs as humanly possible. And then just like heavy ammo finder to round it out. Time dilation. Powerful attraction. Even though you're just going to be spamming wells. Uh, basically the entire time. That's impossible. Okay, okay. There you go. Yeah. 
Yeah, Vada's Vada's getting some Vada's getting paid today. All these ads that we're running. They're going to mods and it's going to Vada. <laughs> All right, I think we're done. Vada, awesome stuff today. I don't think it'll be this crazy all the time, but I was just in the mindset of it. So I was like, let's make that something. Let's like we're in it, we're in experimentation mode right now. Of like what's going to what's going to work, what's not going to work. So, yeah, Vada Vada's been doing some awesome stuff. Been a super big help with the main channel. It's been good. It's been real good. It's been real good. All right, we're done. Um, no stream tomorrow. I probably look hideous, bro. Bro, all the volume in my hair is just like completely deflated. I got an oily ass effing face that the USA is going to invade pretty soon here. Um, I'm going to go. No stream tomorrow. I got a lot of stuff to do. D&D &D finale tomorrow. 4 or like 5 p.m. PST. That's 7 or 8 p.m. EST. We need to do the fashion check. You're right. You're so actually right about that. Let's do that real quick. Sorry. Hang on. Kind of baited. Fashion check from Mega Nura. Why is one of these so much larger than the other? I don't get it. Okay. Um, I think this one's probably my favorite. I get what you're going for here with all the light up effects. I respect it. I think this one is is probably my favorite though. The the armor selection here. Um, you are just accessory the f up. And I love that. You have a nice gradient on the shaders as well. Like you start light, it kind of flows down the rest of the character. All different shaders, by the way, love that as well. This is literally default. You don't even have anything on this. Armor selection's awesome. Shader job is also really, really well done. I love this. I actually love this. This is, this is great. This is actually great. Yeah, I really like this hunter. This is like a much better version of like an accessory hunter that I did a couple years ago. That's really nice. That's really, really nice. Um, okay, yeah, no stream tomorrow. Uh, I got a lot. I got a lot of stuff to do, but we don't normally shoot on Thursdays. But now that I am reclaiming my Thursdays back, maybe we can do we can do in some some cheeky streams on Thursdays. Um, we'll see. But one more D and D session tomorrow. Uh, probably we'll have some kind of a twid video as well if there's uh, you know enough to make a video on. If not, maybe I'll just make like a, a TikTok out of it. So, I think I'm just Dado Does Destiny on, on uh, TikTok. Uh, really starting to rev that up. Revving up the TikToks. Um, so, if you're already a degenerate, feel free to follow me over there. But, I mean, if you're watching streams, you're, you're probably getting most of it anyway. Friday, we'll be back. Uh, toes, I don't know if you're going to grind any uh, ghosts on Friday or something. But, I will be very down. Otherwise, we'll just do some more Onslaught. And, we will play some Balatro. On Friday, Friday, I really want to get back to having some some amount of variety, and uh, and that's it. And the next Tuesday, we got a, a new set of weapons to go not um, get god rolls of or shiny versions of. You smell me? Anyway, PMH twenty five months. One dato plop two daton three. I don't know what happened to my other. I don't know what happened to my alerts. I want to scroll up real quick and see if anybody else did anything. I don't think they did. So thank you very much. Right before we go for PMH uh, 25 months. Thank you very, very much.
Um, good stream today. Had a good time. Had some good jokes. Uh, getting getting the TikTok uh, engine off the ground. Um. So yeah, trying to trying to make that happen. Lots of good jokes popping off today. We, we were a bit slower in the second half, kind of running out of energy. But you know that that's that's gonna happen when you're pulling back to back ten hour uh, ten hour streams. So, but I've just been having a good time on, on onslaught, man. Like try like playing with new builds, changing it up. Onslaught runs just murder time. Like it's it's crazy. It is crazy. How would I rate the cringe levels on today's stream? I thought today's stream was kind of a banger. I think we had like minimal cringe. You know? So I think it worked out pretty well. Maybe we'll give it another shot on, on Friday. I don't know. We'll see. Um, I'm gonna send you. Where am I gonna send y'all? Where am I? Where am I sanding? Where am I? Where? Where am I? Where? Who? Who now? Let's see. Let's go to sneak. Uh, Danielle is also streaming. She's live right now, playing Hades. Probably just wallowing in her own sorrow. So if you want to go hang out with Danielle, you can obviously go hang out with Danielle. Twitch.tv slash travel Danielle, all one word. I'm going to send you all over to Sneakums, though, because we did just do a couple runs. And uh, yeah, have a good time hanging out with Sneak. Thanks very much for chilling. And I will see you guys on Friday, unless you join us for D&D, &D, which is like, you know, it's like a couple people who, uh, who swing by. And yeah, we'll see you on Friday. All right, be good, everybody. Take care.